It's that the Rambo. With the world, cause I'm not a young, it don't care. Tell me who you are, what's in the mind? Effects of the you lost again. Step aside to the world. Green in the mind, no, it's in the mind. It's just like you smile. Show me a smile, that's what they like. Call me a guy. Just not a fan. Black got eyes, it's not a fan. Can you mess mama? The rest is tea, curiosity. Meet them in your knock, meet them in the show. The same is now, what a meal is now. We're getting out of control. No doubt, no harm.
There we go. Hello. Good morning. I hope everyone's doing well. Um, I'm Sean. Welcome to the channel. Welcome back to Pokemon. Um, sorry this isn't earlier in the day. Uh, it turns out uh, I'm sick. I got some tummy issues. Hi, Sean. Hi, Fig Leaf. Hi, Slab. Hi, Paws as well. Um, yeah, I woke up at 6 in the morning and had to use the bathroom. And then I had to use it again. And then again. And then I fell back to sleep. And then I woke up at like 10.30 and I had to use the bathroom again. It's been a morning. And I think it's because I, f I usually take Metamucil. And I think yesterday, I, I just got up, got ready, and left. And I forgot to take my Metamucil. So that at least has something to do with it. And all the junk I ate. I ate a lot of junk yesterday. It was bad. So. Um. Yeah. If, if stream needs to abruptly pause. Not P-O-Z. P-A-U-S-E. You'll know why. You'll know why. Um. Yeah. I did play a little bit after I ended stream yesterday. Uh. It was only to, like, grab a bunch of the Pokemon that I've already, like, I saw, and they were, like, old Pokemon, so. Yeah. That's, uh, that's about it. I'm gonna, slab, fair warning, I'm gonna open up my party menu. So if there's anything you don't want to see, now might be the time to, uh, take off or at least, like, mute me and, like, minimize the tab or whatever. <laughs> I don't know if you saw my Odyssey with obtaining the game yesterday. I did Fig Leaf, and I'm very, very sorry that um, you had to go through that. Um, yeah, I've, I mean, I've been there. I, I was there with exactly Xenoblade Chronicles 3 when I ordered it from Nintendo, and they didn't ship it until the day of release. So, I'm surprised... And I'm trying to bull moose to buy it. Good. Uh, are you gonna try to return the Amazon one, or are you just gonna return your copy to bull moose instead? Because I don't know if Amazon will charge you for the shipping to send it back or not. I'm just gonna do that in the future. Probably a good idea. That's why, like, Hitman and I, like Hitman, I was gonna just like order it for shipping, just because you know I don't drive. But Hitman was like, no, if you're buying this for me, we're going to pick it up. Uh, yeah, the Amazon copies have already been returned. Good good um yeah no i hitman was like no we're we're going to pick it up because i'm not gonna risk it coming late or not showing up at all i refuse the delivery oh okay wait so did it show up yesterday because i might have missed that i know that it said it wasn't gonna show up um and then you said you went to the store to get it it didn't okay so you just went to the site and said don't send this to me anymore gotcha gotcha anyway on the Pokemon, it was set to deliver Sunday. That's bullshit. That's absolute trash. Uh, okay, so we got Bullhop the Tauros, Lil Peps, uh, the I forget. It's like Croc something. Uh, we got Leggies, the Toad's Cool. And then these three, I'm just like, I think they evolve. I know this evolves. This probably evolves. And Flamigo, I'm not 100% sure on, but it may, might evolve. Might evolve. As for the boxes, we're on box 15, but you know, I did some organizing. So I got stuff to just trade because they're just duplicates. Play Coco is cute. So cute. I mean, I I mean, I love Play Coco. Crocolore. Crocolore. There we go. Uh, alternate forms, you know, Pokemon with different, with more than one form. Stuff I got to evolve. I was working on these six yesterday skiplum was great because that sleep powder for all the stuff i was grabbing uh stuff for my party and then i organized everything i have pokemon that i'm just like oh i, I mean i need a a meryl still because the meryl i have is going to evolve into a zoo reel i forgot if they officially revealed tad bulb or not they did not that is a that is a new pokemon at least to me um <clears throat> so yeah but yeah, everything's organized where it should be for now. Gimagool's way up here by itself.
Okay, so you have no idea about it yet. Got it. Exactly. There you are. I knew I heard something. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go to the Poke Portal. We're gonna connect to the internet. I haven't seen any shinies yet. I, to my knowledge, I haven't had any shinies yet either, but if what I've been told is true and they don't sparkle and they don't make a noise on the overworld, um, there's a good chance I could have missed them and just had no idea. Morgan and Ryan found shinies. I'm just, oh, did Morgan find one too? What did Morgan find? They don't sparkle, but you can see them. Right, you can see that they're shiny, but they don't sparkle and they don't make a noise. Unlike in uh, Legends Arceus, which... Oh, Lord. We're gonna do a surprise trade, because I haven't done one yet. And that's what this box is for. So you know what, we'll... So we'll surprise trade one of our... Well, no, we'll, we'll do a nimble. You have to look for the color, it doesn't spark anything. They didn't make a noise until you initiated battle. Morgan found a shiny Mareep. She messaged your Discord at like 1 a.m. I got one yesterday, but it was. Oh. That was fast. Got one yesterday, it was easy to spot, so I might have to. Might have passed a couple as well. Yeah, you, it's hard to know. Yeah. I feel like Nimble is late enough that it could be new to somebody. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I have a Japanese one now. Go me. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what? Let's do another surprise trade. <laughs> Tarantula. It's probably, it's going to be a lot of early game Pokemon, but I didn't expect another Nimble right away. That moment when you literally just lifted half the animation from Sword and Shield. Yeah. At least the models look better. They definitely put more detail into them, which is good. Sword and Shield needed that. Even if it's just like texturing on their like fur and skin and whatnot. I didn't see what it was. It was legendary release at a lot of hacked Pokemon. God damn it! Uh, a lot of hacked Pokemon and raids and stuff. But all the problems, at least the Pokemon models are good. You can't make this up, I swear. <laughs> yeah, well, let's do another surprise trade. At least I'm getting more IDs, right? Jesus Christ. Um, oh, do I, can I not see the uh, OT on this screen? All right. Hopip, let's go. Three for three, let's get another Hopip. Hey, Sean, why are you faking this? It was really elaborate for a bit. Look, don't, don't reveal my secret. Don't tell everyone I got Jerry doing surprise trades at the exact same time I am to time this out with his Japanese nimble. I'm gonna shit myself. I'm gonna- Oh my fucking god! <laughs> what the hell? Is it- What is happening today? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, okay, we're gonna try Starly. We're not gonna do Diglett. We're gonna try Starly now, and it's gonna be different. <sighs> oh my god. No, no four out of four. I want something new. Uh, 
I got a hangnail. Okay. That's new. <laughs> I haven't I haven't got one of those yet. We've broken the curse. Rip, don't rip me. I want new stuff. <laughs> <sighs> okay. I mean, I'm gonna keep these other ones just because, again, they're different IDs if I ever run into whoever does the lottery in this game, if that's still a thing. Oh. Am I still online? It did say communication error. Also, I noticed a lot of items will respawn. Oh, and I fell. Um, every day. So, that's good. Poke portal. Uh, it's fine, because I literally would have passed away because it was laughing so hard. <laughs> well, here, here's your chance when I trade this diglet for a diglet. Okay, it was Wooper. It was close. Not exactly the same, but close, I guess. Golden Dragon sent out Felino. Do I send out the Gimme Ghouls? Is there something special if I have more than one Gimme Ghoul? I don't think so. Okay. I'll do that in a moment then. I want to check these uh, raids as well. And then if anyone wants to join them, we could do that if you'd like. I was actually, I was gonna last night after stream, I was gonna just do some more raids for fun. But I started seeing like Pokemon I hadn't seen yet, including what Quaxley's mid evolution is. I only saw the sprite. I didn't go into the battle. I was just like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm not gonna. Oh, if it wasn't stuck at work for two more hours, figly, just do it anyway. Look for some two stars if you find any. I got a two star love disc that's flying. Do you want to do that? It has been slow, to be honest. Did your foot Coco evolve yet? Yes. Yes, it has, Slab. I'm down for that. Give me a minute. Okay. Yeah, I I, I don't want to like show it just in case because I know you don't want spoilers either. Um, and Pokemon has returned. I also I meant to and I forgot to. I just don't want to see Quexi's final Evo until mine evolves. Okay, that that's fair. Um, I have yet to see any of the final Evo still, so I'm good to see anything you have. Okay. I'm mostly just listening. Okay, well then I'll try not to like say things. Oh my god, Teddy Arso with bug type Terra hat is so cute. It is, isn't it? Okay. Um. We're around a similar place, I think. Yeah, I've done. I've done two gyms, one Titan, and one base so far. The goal for today is that I at least want to do another Titan, if not two more, and then maybe two more gems. So, let's find follow your dreams. I'm mute if I need to. Okay. I'm good to go. All right. We're gonna we're gonna select leggies. And we'll challenge as a group. Here's the link code if anyone wants it. I can put it in chat. I mean, it's on screen, but. There's the code if anyone wants that too. Oh, we got Fig Leaf! 
with the belly bolt. I haven't actually found belly bolt yet. And there's Hitman with Sprigatito's second evolution. Or not the second evolution, the second stage. Although in the Pokemon card game, second stage means final evolution. You know what I mean, though. It's, it's the one right after Sprigatito. <laughs> and then if anyone else wants to join for this love disc... I love the mid-evolution. It's a, it's a good mid-evolution. Like, as far as mid-evolutions go, despite the fact that it, you know, stood up, um, I think it, I think it's pretty good. I think it's alright. It's a Digimon. It's kind of a Digimon. It's kind, it's kind of like a... It, it looks like it would be a student of Renamon. Oh, I was going to say, too, I've been meaning to make Fue Coco eggs for everybody, and I just I didn't yet, because I ran out of time last night and I had to go to bed. Yeah, it's great if I change my electric type. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's fair, too. Man, I don't think there's any new Pokemon that I actually hate. All of the new Pokemon are really good, as much as I wish it was stated. All fours. It could have been way worse. True. That is true. <laughs> All right, I'm going to ready up. Um, we're going to give this a couple more seconds. If anyone wants to join, feel free. <laughs> Wait, I'm on the way. Okay, you got 39 seconds. I mean, I can't slow down the timer at all either way, so. To be fair, it's going to be on two legs. It's designed. We got it's pretty good. Yeah. It just would be nice if we got a more animalistic starter, because we haven't had one, God, since Gen 5? Because 6, we got the trio for, um, like, the mage, the knight, the thief. And then 7 was Incineroar. Oh, it ended. I'm sorry, Slab. Uh, we had Incineroar, Primarina, and Decidueye. Gen 8 was... It's saying I typed it wrong? Oh. It might be because it just ended as you, like, put it in, maybe? Next one. There, there was another one. So ne next one, we'll get a full group going. Oh, your hair is cute. Thank you. I tried to choose something that's similar to like my hairstyle, which is like kind of up in the front, but the closest thing was what they called Pompadour, which I don't really think was a Pompadour, but still. Oh, right. It's flying, not water. Why did I choose whatever? <laughs> you guys all have this. I'm still getting used to terror typing. I'm sorry. I'll try to stun it, I guess. I also have the pump because I had to match Quaxi. Exactly. I was actually wondering yesterday, like, did Slab get the pompadour because of Quaxi? Shaking head. Listen. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm tired. I was up pooping all morning. Okay. Did, did we do it? I will also say, looking at uh, Palmy or Palmo right now, whatever it is, um, very glad that Pika clone this generation 
Uh, this might be a spoiler, so I'm, I'm gonna give it a second. Uh, I'm, I'm very glad it evolves. Because if we haven't had that. I think ever. I think every Pika clone has stayed a single stage since uh, Gen 3. So. Hey. Yeah, because we had um, Puzzle Minon, Pachirisu, Emolga, Dedene, Togedemaru, more Peko. Yeah. Belly Bolt is so cute. It's cute, but like the fact its eyes aren't where they're, they look like they are, it bothers me a little bit. <laughs> All right, where was that other one? I know there was another one. Hi, Vespa Gwen. Well, there's another Terra Pokemon for me, at least. Not a raid, though. Is this Diglett again? Whoa, okay, now you're over there, and you are Diglett, okay. There's the other one I saw. Gotta get those rewards, they get way better. Levels. Oh, yeah. And then, what do I press here? Is it, do I click that? Oh, here we go. Oh, hey, I can get a Raichu now. I've been catching a lot of Pokemon. I will say with items seemingly respawning um, I'm, I'm kind of happy about that because it means it doesn't feel like I need to pick up every single one every day so all right we got another one uh, let me grab this item, but everyone get ready if they want in for another raid. This time it's a Mankey. Uh, let me change my Pokemon Psychic or Flying. I don't really have. I mean, I guess I have Flamigo. Can you wait like a minute? Yeah, sure. I, I'm gonna level up Flamigo anyway. Get it on par with the rest of my team. Ooh, okay. What's the terror type though? Right, I keep forgetting about that. <laughs> Hold on. I want to say it's normal. I don't know what the symbol is exactly, but it looks like it might be normal type to me. So I have the XP can still exist. Me too. I was thinking about it the other day. Like, it's nice to just, if you get a new party member, but they're way under leveled, you can just get them up with everybody else. I think it is, yeah. So actually, I could still go in with Flamigo, but I'll probably use Bullhop instead. Faint? Nah. Mud shot? Ooh. Over mud slap? Yeah. I'm good? Okay, I love these names. Sound fake to me. This must be what we sound like to non-fans all the time. Oh, absolutely. Abs I mean, granted, I, I nicknamed Bullhop. Um, 
Yeah, we're actually good there. Let's challenge that as a group. Everything's a fake mod until it's not. This is true. Oh, I didn't mean to hit start raid. Shit, I didn't mean to sit. Fuck! No! Oh, that's a nickname? See, I can't tell. Yeah, no, it, it's a... It's a mutant from Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I didn't mean to keep hitting A. I'm sorry. Can I leave? I might be able to leave. I think I can run. I don't know if the raid will stay, but I think I can run. It is normal though. We know that now. It's no good. Can't run away from it. Okay. I'm sorry. I failed. I mean, it's just a manky that becomes a normal type, which isn't even that good. Hit yourself. Ha. Want the rewards mainly? Oh, I'm sorry. Fucked up. Well, I got the main key at least. <sighs> Jen, how dare you mess up the one raid out of dozens currently available? I know! I'm a big stupid poopy head. Okay, I'm gonna find another one, and we're all gonna do it together. Eventually. No, I want the item too. Yeah, just a potion. Okay, that's that Terra Diglett. That's not a raid. You can look at your map for symbols? Oh, true. True. Uh, okay, I got a fighting one. How do I set a waypoint again? Is it Y? No. Hit A on it? No. Oh. Set a destination. Yeah, that, that would... That would track, wouldn't it? I said, ooh, item. Cherry berry. Okay, I'm not gonna fuck up this time. It's a fighting type Ralt. Did you get the sprint from doing a Titan, Sean? I might have. Playing the Pokedex in this game is gonna be a time. It sure is. All right, we're going to, it's, it's fighting. So psychic or flying is good. Change Pokemon to my kicky bird. I'm 
I'm not touching the controller. There's the code, though. What's up, Seth? How you doing today? U T T P G. Granted, it's only one star, but still. I should shake that up some more, probably. Hey, we got a slab. Hitman, do you want do you want in? Do you wanna get a full team of birds going? Yeah. Oh. He's using his Fletch Ender. But Hitman, you could have a flamingo. Come on. Soiled it, yeah. I hate that bird. What? Have we seen the Tarantula evolve? I'm curious what level. You hate the bird? Slab, I can check for you if you want. Um, Cause I have seen, actually I have seen what it evolves into, so. Let me check Bulbapedia. Uh, 15. Fig Leaf has Molly seen the flamingo. I hit ready. Uh, Fig Leaf doesn't say he's ready, but I'm just gonna say start anyway. Uh, so they hit ready to go, but the game stuck communicating. Oh. Now that we have Flamingo finally. Did you love it? Thank you, Sean. You're welcome. Hopefully it just sticks you in here, Fig Leaf. It's fine. I'm in anyway. Okay, good. One of these things is not like the other. Um, am I the only one that hit it? <laughs> Would you do terror raid battles? Do you not have the game, Seth? Or are you just not far enough yet? It's a one hit wonder. It sure was. <laughs> I had acrobatics, but I didn't hit it yet. These seem like guaranteed catches, right? They seem like it, yeah. Guess I'm not far enough. Oh, Seth, it's it's very early. Um, so all you gotta do is uh, you 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 started the game. You know you're on your way to school. Once you get to school and do the shit they make you do there, there'll be a point where they're just like, all right, adventure time. And then you just, that that's when you're good, so. Oh, this is a male. I want Gallade. I gotta check, I'm gonna check the Pokedex. Cause for some reason it looked like there was only two slots after Ralts. I could be wrong though. I'll take that. Pokédex. Oh, I just started on the treasure hunt. So you should be good, actually. Now that you've started the treasure hunt, I think you should be able to do uh, raids with anybody. Alright, Ralts, where are ya? 
There you are. Yeah, so it goes 62, 63. Oh, no, there's a 64 missing. Okay. Never mind. Seems like Galator in here. I, I, for some reason, I saw 63, 65 and went like, oh, that means there's only two after it. Oh, sick. We can trade later. Uh, I got a mail ready if you want. Um, did I touch on it? Did I just see Sandy Gas? Maybe. <laughs> Perhaps. Yeah, it doesn't show empty slots. I don't know why. Probably so it's easier to get through the decks. Uh, but it, that just confused me, so. I do need to organize my boxes a little bit now because we have caught a few Pokemon. Mine is female. Which might actually be better to be a Gardevoir. Yeah, so I guess I can stick that right there. Another thing when Sun and Moon came out. It it's a fun Pokemon. Uh let's see. Mankey needs to go in the box. Okay, so that's 56. 59, 58. I just already have a fairy type I want to use. Uh, is it? Okay. Uh, we're not going to spoil it for chat, but is it the one that Ryan was using on stream yesterday? Ooh, 322. I think so. Okay. Because I saw that and I, I also kind of want to use it. Let's see. 30, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Yeah, for those of you who don't know, um, I organize my boxes because I'm crazy. Move this hop up. Actually, mm, nah. I was thinking like, well, what if I swap that and train this one instead? But the skip limit's already so high level, so. Move Tarantula. So you're right there. It's in my fourth gym right now. Ooh, nice. Is nothing you've seen? I think so. The fairy type? It's nothing I've seen in game, but like I said, I saw Ryan using it. We would be playing this if I wasn't villager hunting and new people still play New Horizons. <laughs> what? <laughs> I hope you're having fun. Okay. I'm gonna leave that box alone for now. Go back to box 15, which is where all my new catches are supposed to be. Um. Hmm. A choodle. I don't know. Can you call this a choodle outbreak? It's a choodle something. Oh man, what what do I want to do? I guess. Hmm. I kind of want to try another Titan. We'll go for this one. This looks like a Titan, right? Probably. If it's not. We're gonna find out what it is. I go for your second Titans now. Uh, for now, Sky Titan, I suggest. Well, I'm going for whatever I just marked on the map, and if it turns out to be a mistake, I can, I can change that. I ran into a bird. Oh, also, I've noticed that some of the Starly like to T-pose if you're not, like, super close to them. It's kind of hard to see because they're so small, but yeah. They'll just stick their wings out. Assert dominance. Uh, I could also be... Oh, actually, does he... Hold on. I see a gimme ghoul! It 
Is there a Pokemon Center close to that? Oh, actually, that's another base. There's a Pokemon Center. It looks like the closest I can get is here. So what are these coins for? I have no idea, but I have a lot of them. I've caught three Gimme Ghouls in chests and found a bunch of others, so... I'm sure we'll find out eventually. Oh, there's another Mankey. What the fuck is that? What the fuck are you? Capsa kid? Oh, it's a it's a Kappa. It's a yokai. Okay. Um. Let's just throw a Pokeball. The Peppa. Nice. Spicy pepper Pokemon. So wait, if this is a spicy pepper. What is Red Coco? The more sunlight this Pokemon Bay is in, the more spicy chemicals are produced in its body, and thus the spicier its moves become. Okay. I'm being assaulted by pig monkeys. It's a play on words. Hitman, almost every Pokemon's name is a play on words. <laughs> Capsaicin is a part of the pepper for spice. Yeah, I, I know. That's the stuff that I can't handle for shit. Oh, fine. Die, I guess. We got some ghastly just hanging out. We got mud bray. We got uh we got two raids actually. All right. Oh shit. Uh okay, we made it. Is that a... Okay, that's just a char cadet. Um, a bug type thing that evolves from this whooper. Who wants in? I think it's, they say it was one star. Yeah, it's only one star, so not great rewards, but... I'm in battle. I'm good. Okay. Hitman's out. Fig Leaf might be doing his job, unfortunately. Alright, well, I'm going to they want in soon. I'll probably just do it myself. Joining? 
Okie dokie. Okay, if no one else is joining, I'm probably just going to start it then. Oh, pause is in. Hi, pause. Sorry, I was in the bathroom. I'm back. Okie dokie. Okay, I think we're probably good then, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit start. That's not the thing that... Oh, I didn't know Minecraft was in this game. Oh, it's a Tynamo! Oh! I apologize. The sprite looked... Okay. <laughs> the sprite looked, um... A lot like, uh... The other Pokemon I mentioned. I know it was a Tynamo, just hadn't caught one yet. Oh, uh, okay. I don't think I caught one either, so. There we go. Yay! Although I don't know why you would want to change Tynamo's type with its ability, it makes it... With no, it, it has no weakness, so... Alright, can I make it back to that side? We're gonna find out. After I check whatever this... Terra Pokemon is. It's a Weasel. Oh, there's a bridge. Oh, shit. Oh, I fucked up. I registered caught 141 Pokemon so far. Nice! I have not. Okay, I caught one of these. In a raid already. Ah, uh, Choodle, nope. It's a bad Choodle. That's that pepper Pokemon. Okay, where did I say I was going? I'm going all the way over there. So I gotta, let's see, follow this path and cross this bridge. Um, I think I just broke a hundred. Sean, I was so over level for this first gym. I was 15 over. Oh dear God. I was actually kind of afraid of that. Um, I wish there was a better way to scale Pokemon games. But honestly, I think what they're doing now is like the best we're going to get. Oh, he's a fancy.
I should probably have little peps out front just because it has yawn Hey. I've leveled out after the second gym. Ah, okay. And now it's raining. Oh, uh, just a big leader. There we go. And we'll heal you up. I'm also actually gonna change Lil Pep's nickname because they're not Lil anymore. So we gotta go Peps now. Thought I heard a gimme ghoul. I also didn't need to heal Bull Hop just because. So, PC or Pokemon Center right here. We do two of each, and I think you won't be over leveled. Mine are 32 right now. Oh, okay. All right. Well, there also seems to be a um thing in the area. So, let's see, Peps. What is your stats? All right. So, despite the fact you have a Special attack lowering nature uh, Your special attack is still higher than your attack. So I probably shouldn't get rid of incinerate over fire fang I did actually pick up a few mints While playing um, I, I even picked up an adamant mint which I'm very happy about so we'll probably end up using that at some point um, But I yeah, just gentle and hasty other than that so Oh. Well, all right. <laughs> I guess we're going to figure out what Tad Bulb evolves into. <laughs> I had no idea it evolved with a Thunderstone. All right, I guess that makes sense. That one's on me. <laughs> I guess we'll uh, put that away for now. Cause I doubt it evolves further after that. Um, we'll put Capsicate in here for now. Even though we already have a grass type. Right, picnic. We got a picnic. I, I need. I need a, like a nice flat area with no people. That's not, I don't know why I thought that it looked like a different color. Didn't sparkle though, so that means it's not shiny. Okay, I did look up uh, Pepsi's Egg group? I did not look up Tauros's egg group. Okay, actually, so with Tauros and Peps, or sorry, Bullhop and Peps, I should be able to make some babies. I'll try right here. Picky Nick. Nope. Picnic. Have them only in your party makes it easier. Oh. All right, pack it up and go.
All right, and you know what? While we're here, let's let's make a sandwich. And we won't drop the cheese this time. Actually, um, jam. Eh, whatever. Egg power. Oh, I guess I should get egg power, huh? Oh, well. I'll make another sandwich. It's fine. Look for egg power. Yeah, I guess after this. We're gonna have all the pickles in the middle. And then we're just gonna not eat the middle part. Right over there. Perfect. Open my mouth to eat it. Let's make another sandwich. Okay, egg power. Jam sandwich has egg power. And that's it so far. Does the little flag just keep it all together? And keeps the strawberries from clipping outside of the bread? Because it's doing a bad job, if so. Okay, there we go. Yes. Do I need to keep making sandwiches for the eggs to... keep spawning, or is it just random? I can stack up to 10, I think. I just saw the Quaxley final Evo. He is so gay. Okay. No spoilers, though. Um, sorry, there's a huge-ass bug in my room. And I don't know what to hit it with. <sighs> Damn it. God, I hope it's... Still there. <sighs> yeah, it, it's gone. I don't know how it got in my room, but it's gone. Oh, there it is. Crawled behind my all my junk in here. God damn it. Well, I'm not gonna sleep tonight. Fuck. I guess that's motivation to clean off my desk so I can 
kill shit more easily. Bro, look at Taco Croc's fit. Um, I mean, it, it's fine. I'm not sure. I, I I mentioned this yesterday. I'm not sure I like the fire sombrero. Only because, like, we already had um, Incineroar with, like, the fire belt. And then we had um, Cinderace with, like, the fire soccer ball. So... I don't know how many of these eggs I need, but we'll grab a bunch. I don't need that anymore. Nothing. I wish I could open up my menu in the picnic menu too. That'd be nice. I say you're probably gonna need like at least like six. I'm thinking. Okay, we're at what two, maybe three. Do I want another sandwich? Let's make another sandwich. Another another jam sandwich. I need more recipes. I think I need to like go to more of those sandwich shops and just buy them, I guess. it up again there's a guy that teaches you them after you do stuff oh okay gotcha The sandwich shop with a big sandwich above it? Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, because I do want to get <clears throat> higher level egg power, probably. Okay, I think that's enough eggs. Yeah, that should be plenty. 
go. Um, wrong button, but whatever. Okay. We'll just put these. We'll put these in the party box for now. Okay. Also look at these for when catching specific Pokemon and grinding XP for Pokemon. You can put boosts on it and say which lasts like 30 minutes, I think. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I'm probably not going to use them much because I never did in the first place. Like, if I want to train up something, I'll probably just do raids and get candy. So. Yo, Sean. From what I gather, it seems the open sky titan lives somewhere up on this mountain. But there are all these crazy boulders raining down from the mountain, too. It's going to be a little tricky to stand around and look for the titan while dodging all those. I think you'd be sent flying off if you get hit by a falling boulder. Maybe you could power your way through atop that brute strength of yours. Hopefully they remembered the code for the food on like Xenoblade. Yeah. Fucking... Did they ever fix that? In an update? I would hope they did, but I haven't actually like looked into it at all. They did? Okay, good. Rare candy. I heard the gimme ghoul too, but I'm just gonna leave it for now. I'm sure, I remember to come back for it later. I say Patch should put in death fall screams. Beautiful. Gimme ghoul. There's an item over here. Technically two. I didn't run into you. They didn't make the hitbox on Karaidon smaller. I'm going around. Ooh, a sunstone. I do have a sun current I need to evolve. I'd like to heal, please. Not that I think I need to, but, you know, whatever. You know, I just had a thought. I did the Thunderstone, but what about the other stones? Is there anything? That's the wrong bag. Fucking, come on. All right, it evolves with a fire stone, which means I think I know what we're getting. Hopefully I can like get stones more easily soon because I am using them pretty quickly. Jesus Christ. Do you know how Charcadet evolves? Um, I guess it's not level up. 
Skull Villain? Oh my god. What a name. Well, we finally got my f Grass Fire Pokemon. Hell yeah. The Redhead converts spicy chemicals into Fire Energy and blasts the surrounding area with a super spicy stream of flame. Skull Villain. Oh my goodness. Spicy Extract. If I didn't have grass, I'd be using it. If I didn't have fire, I'd be using that. <laughs> uh, leafage is physical. So is razor leaf. Well, I was getting a piece of armor from a guy by trading him 10 Sinisty armor. Do you mean the, um, like the, uh, kettles? Oh, okay. All right. Uh, these are most incredible. I didn't actually read this. These are incredibly, incredibly spicy extract, sharply boosting the target's attack and harshly lowering its defense. Uh, I actually don't know if I like that. I guess that means I can put you away now, though, because you probably don't evolve again. I have a couple things in here I need to evolve, so... Let's throw... Mastiff in here, because I'm pretty sure that evolves. Yeah, I need to find something to see for Violet. So each Pokemon family has a material they drop when you defeat... Oh, right. You Violet, you need 10 cents to material. Scott, you need 10 bronze ore material and you need to trade it. Okay, I have seen bronze ore somewhere, so. Have to check that out at some point. Numo, actually, I don't think I have Numo yet. Battle, yawn. Do you remember where? No, and I don't think I actually encountered them either. So I probably can't look them up on the map. I'll double check. Maybe it's just in my Pokedex. Ow. My speed. I think I said this yesterday, but I wasn't sure if it was a glitch or not. But I put a bunch of Pokemon to sleep and none of them keep their eyes closed. And like, how is that not a thing? It's been a thing since Gen 5. I think the only exception was Legends Arceus because they changed how sleep works in that game. I think it's a glitch. They're supposed to? Okay. It's another glitch, maybe? Maybe, but I've closed and opened my game since then, so... If it's a glitch, it's a persistent one. Heal that damage off of, uh... Peps. The memory leaks are consistent? Mmm. That's true. Any big game on the Switch. Again, this is why I think that these big games don't belong on a console from that, that runs on like the same power as stuff from like you know last generation. Uh alright. I saw yeah. There's one raid, there's two raids down there. So let's see if we can do them. Ooh, we got a, I don't know, Shuppet? That's not bug, is that rock? To be fair, it didn't seem to run really well on Switch. For the most part, 
Um, so it leaks, but it took like 10 hours. Rock, maybe? I think it might be rock. Hard to tell. Um, so now I can use leggies. And if anyone wants to join, here's the code. They legit needed more time to polish, but Nintendo was like, no, we need, to po we need a Pokemon game. I have a Peter Chat, gym badge anywhere. Fair enough. Yeah, no, they definitely um did not finish this game for sure. I, I had a bunch of glitches yesterday, as y'all know, so... Most of them graphical, but still. Graphical glitch, like seeing the underside of Diglett when he unterrazzled. Oh, really? I didn't notice that. Um, I had the ground disappear on me when catching Pokemon. I had a, I had a weird graph graphical glitch last night after I ended stream, actually. I caught, I think it was like a Magikarp or something in the water. And the Pokeball was in the water. And the water effect was like trying to move the Pokeball around. But it was only moving the circle around. It's hard to describe. It's, it wasn't the Pokeball itself. It was like the circle where it's supposed to be normally. Oh, I found a dark type Toxel raid. Ooh, I don't have a Toxel yet. We're gonna have a big update in a week, calling it. Probably not a week. They, I think they need more time to... It's not a glitch. The water reflection is just wonky. Well, still, like, the spot where the Pokeball was supposed to be was moving around, which is... It's like the Pokeball itself was stationary. But the effect that was supposed to be overlaid over it was moving around. I don't know how to describe it without like just showing it. I had another one too. I'll have to check something. So I'm just going to have lunch. But after that, I want to do this one. Sure. That happened in Legends Arceus too. Oh well, still it's still a glitch. All right, only like 30-ish seconds to get in on this rock-type shuppet. Clue to. All right, it's me and Fig Leaf. Let's go. Shot, mud shot. Oh wait, it has levitate, doesn't it? Never mind. Oh no, my leggies. Woodward Surge. God, I wish I had like a giant nose like Squidward, like that one episode where they went on dry land and they were like not clay models, but they're like little models of themselves, like caricatures. Y'all know the episode. 
That's back when SpongeBob was good, so. It was the episode Sandy was having like competitions with everybody underwater, and she was like, Y'all wouldn't under any circumstance survive on land, and everyone was like, Oh, yeah, you want to bet? And they all went up on land and almost got eaten by a seagull. When they were racist against Sandy? Not, you know, it was. Yeah, basically. Basically. A. You know, I have seen a Larvitar. I could maybe check the area where it's at. Lungs literally snapped off. Oh, yeah, that that one. <laughs> right. Hitman told me that he was fine getting Violet so long as I got him. Oh, actually, there's another Titan path here. Interesting. Um, so long as I got him a Larvitar. So let me check that. Habitat. Okay, so it's actually a little north of where I am now, it looks like. And it is sunny, so maybe Larvitar is already out. Hey, Sean. Apparently this desert is home to the quaking Earth Titan. Speaking of which, the ground's been shaking off and on and... Uh, you're making me feel a bit sick. Sorry, I'm gonna go sit down and rest a little before I get back to the Titan hunting. Hell yeah, if I'm a boy. Oh, I will. I will. Cacking a needle. Got some silly cobras as well. That's nice. Oh, I want that item. No, not the Pokemon. I want the item. Oh. I care about Flittle. I have a Flittle. Thank you. Ooh, a Noble Stone. <gasps> Larvesta? Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. First, I'll grab that. Hello there. Oh, and there's a chicken! I mean, I know, I know it's actually like an ostrich, but I'll, I'll call it chicken. Um, Bramblin. Okay, Bramblin. Pretty sure you can get him early one in the mountains near. I saw someone find. I mean, I'm sure. I just I figured we're in the desert. I remembered. I remembered you wanted one, so I was like, all right, I'll go find one. Plus, when you want one at a higher level, that way it's a little easier to evolve. Hell yeah, I would. Exactly. Exactly. Let me know if you have a Pokeball preference. Fucking... Ugh. Infestation. Alright, we'll try... Great Ball. And I got the crit catch on it. Oh, it's a grass ghost. Okay. A soul unable to move on to its afterlife was blown around by the wind until it got tangled in dried grass and became a Pokemon. Poor thing. Alright, you. You're probably what Flittle evolves into, maybe. Espathra. So a much higher level. 
I don't know if I can catch this, right? Dust ball if you have it, but those are rare. I know, I think I have one. I don't even know if I can catch this with the badges I have. So if not, I'll just run. Or kill it and get a bunch of levels. You can, but it'll be harder to catch because you don't have the gym badge. Oh, okay. So maybe, what you're saying is maybe use some Ultra Balls on it. Gotcha. I have picked up a few of those. Yeah, it's not possible. You just get a penalty to catch chance. Okay. Well, I caught it. Snarl. On you? Um, you are a special attacker, so Snarl's probably better than Bite. Mastiff wants to learn Bite, though. And you have Snarl. <laughs> but you are a physical attacker, so... It immobilizes opponents by bathing them in psychic power from its large eyes. Despite its appearance, it's it has a vicious temperament. I'm so glad we got the ostrich Pokemon. Okay, and it does look like it either evolves from Flittle, or they're somehow related, I think. Seems like that might have been a good catch. Hycacnea. Larvesta Fuzz. I know our buddy, um... Static's gonna be happy that, uh... Why'd I get Rain Dance here, not... Sunny Day. Uh, it's gonna be happy that... This game has Larvesta and presumably Volcarona in it, provided it doesn't evolve into anything different. Hoshan. Okay, Here, here's the other Terror Raid. We have a, we have a Poison Toxel. We're gonna go with pauses. How is that a terror raid thing? All toxels are gonna be either poison or electric. Uh. All right. J. Y. F. Nine. Okay, you said this is a psychic one, is that correct? I'll probably just go with peps then. I love the little fire from bro. It's dark. Oh, it's dark. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm going bull hop. Yeah, Paws has uh, whatever that Pokemon is, which is the one I saw Ryan using last night, and I kind of, kind of want to get that one, if I can. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm still not a fan of the Fire Sombrero. It's probably just me. It's just like, we, we had the Fire Belt already and the Fire Soccer Ball. We don't need to keep making objects of fire, so. I guess Fig Leaf wanted in too. I'm going to cross chop him. Oh god. I tried to join, but it said no. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Fig Leaf.
Uh oh. It is Pokemon game bound to happen. Yeah, unfortunately. I did the kickies. Way easier and faster than last time, so that's a plus, I guess. Absolutely, yeah. Oh, Sean, could you also help me with something? I have a Pokemon that can only be evolved during that online group thing. What online group thing? I didn't mean to use an Ultra Ball. It dodged my attack? Why do you use Cross Chop? I think Cross Chop has a slightly lower accuracy. Oh, uh, do you mean the Union? Like, we play together? Yeah, sure. I mean, pause. If you want to join my, like, a call together, we can just do that, too. And, like, hang out playing Pokemon together. Remember how you can do it? Yeah, that one. Toxel. Okay. Um, Poke Portal. Problem is, I found out you can't do gym battles. Make story progress in a. Wait, really? Damn. Okay. Wait, I really thought you could, but honestly, wasn't expecting people to. I kind of was. Play together, doing by friends, blah blah blah. Okay. You just teleport and do your own thing. I want to, but just in case, I'll wait to join a call until my mom gets home. And we're getting takeout for dinner, and I'm usually the one who orders. Ah, uh, okay. Um. Pause. You want to make a group, or you want me to do so? We can still try if it turns out it, to be wrong, it's wrong. Alright. <laughs> I'll make it. Okie dokie. Let me know when you're ready then. I'm gonna try to get closer to whatever Titan is there then. Also, there's a terrestrialized Pokemon over here, and I'm gonna go see what it is. Oh wait, no, I need to go get a larva type for Hitman. That's what that's what we're doing. Ah, it's a Sandy Gas. Okay. We got some Rufflets too. Oh, there's a Dawn fan. Sunstone. Got another one, so I don't feel bad about wasting one on a sun current then. Stone Journer. <gasps> I found that fairy that I want to add to my team. And spikes. Wait. Oh, there's two. <gasps> my boys. <laughs> okay, it's all set. All right, hold on. <laughs> I'll join, and then we got some Pokemon to catch. So apparently you have to fight your friends if a shiny showed up, first come, first serve. I don't think we should say first come, first serve, you know. We'll just be like, hey, whoever wants it the most. LJ. O. Y. One. B. Yay, okay, so I can just leave? Or not leave the group, but... Wait, no. Maybe I gotta wait for pause to, like, okay it. Taking a break for a minute to get some leftover pizza. Oh, I want pizza again so bad. I have some, and I can go heat it up, but I don't know if my Tum Tum's got it in it. Hello. I like your hair and your hat. I guess just, I like your character overall. 
Oh no, I'm all the way here. Well, I got my dolphin now. Ooh, congratulations. Um, all right, I was in the desert, so I can fly here. So, do we just have to be in a union thing together, pause? Or do I have to do something specific? Damn, I'm half a level away. You got candy, right? Or did you just use all your candy? Oh, so we got another Terra battle here. It's pause crystal. Apparently, I can't touch it. All right. Yep, okay. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. I got stuff to do anyway. Just use the last one. Oh. I am sorry. This is Pause's Crystal. Ugh. I can't even at least check it for them. Where are my boys? Oh no, where are my boys? Also that new Pokemon I was gonna get. Oh, there's a Bronzor. Now I know where Bronzor is. Found one of your crystals? Damn. It's always two steps forward, one step back with, uh, with Game Freak. Hey, it made raids easier, but only you can interact with them when you're doing multiplayer. Oh, my boys. They look really low red. Oh, no, I fixed it. Okay. Oh. So right here, they're low res, and then I move over the camera a little bit, and they look better. <laughs> Way to go. Company. This company! They have the best selling franchise in the world and they don't know how to use it. I mean, I guess you're still getting billions of dollars, so. Alright, I think we have to switch to Great Balls for now because this isn't working out. school looks so funny. I love it. You want to learn flame charge? Char cadet? Yeah, we'll learn it over Ember. Hell yeah. Phalanx! There's a gimme ghoul there. I'm gonna have to battle. I'm gonna grab this. Grab that. Um. Oh, good. Another one of these spawned. Okay. 
I'm guessing this is the evolved form, so. Tinker Tough. Go ahead and give you a nice yawn. Do I have... I have some heal balls, but um... I'll wait. Also, Killer Cat Bronzor for your mats, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now we'll throw a heal ball. Yeah. Oh, I didn't actually read the deck entry. Shit. I should have done that. Pokédex. Ah, there you are. This Pokemon will attack groups of Ponyard and Bisharp, gathering metal from them in order to create a large and sturdy hammer. What the hell? Tinkalink is a Prevo, such a cute name. There is one of those around here. I'm gonna grab that in a second. I wish there was. I don't know if it's still around do so battle five people and go to the poker center near the desert you can get earthquake for that guy Ooh. okay I I'm gonna worry about that kind of stuff later though so thank you for letting me know um tank a tank go sleepy buys please oh Sean you should see the final Evo's pokedex and wait there's a third one I didn't know there was a third one. Sorry, you're fine. Like, I've already got like enough on my plate thinking about like gyms and other stuff right now, so. Now we don't need to learn Roar. It swings his handmade hammer around to protect itself, but the hammer is often stolen by Pokemon that eat metal. Aww. Okay, so actually I'm going to add that to my party. Like everyone else. I'm gonna be super original with the name too, you wanna see? Here, watch watch this. Oh, why did I why did it exit? Did I hit the wrong button? It did. Amy Rose. Oh, there's another one too. Uh, come here, you. What's evolving? I think it's pauses dolphin. <sighs> Come on. 
Come on. Be a pal. Save the ball. I guess I could try licking it. It might kill it, though. Oh, okay. No, we're good. And that was a crit, so I can actually do it again. I'm probably, you know what? I'm probably just gonna throw a ball, though. It's still asleep. Might as well. Or not. If it wakes up, or if it breaks out again, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit it again. Cause it's gonna wake up too, so. Ugh. Little, or not little peps anymore, just peps. Um, all right, yawn. I'm gonna have to hit up a Pokemon Center uh, after I catch that Larvitar. If I catch that Larvitar at this point. Gimme Ghoul! Why is your catch rate so low? Good. Wait, wait, I just found a wild Rotom. Oh, nice! I think I've seen one. I'm not sure, but I, I think I have. All right, got 60 more move coins. I crit it. Oh no. Um, um, there's a dung beetle Pokemon. Um, um, <laughs> it's gonna be like bug ground, and it's gonna be like, oh, it's dirt. Hot damn. Uh, how would you like a nice lemonade? I do also want to get peps evolved today pretty badly. So I, I should, I'm going to be focusing on using them a lot probably. Also, its name is Relor. And we caught it. Huzzah. Oh, it's just bug, okay. This Pokemon creates a mud ball. Mud ball. By mixing sand and dirt with psychic energy. It treasures its mud ball more than its own life. Okay. If you say so. Oh, hi. I guess. I'm, I'm just gonna go. Actually, that's a... Thing. I did not check Amy Rose's stats at all. Also, Mold Breaker. Down attack, up special attack? Really? That seems like it's a bad nature for it, but alright. Okay, let's head over this way. See if I can't find this Larvitar. There's also a town, so that's good. Actually, I think I was already in the area where Larvitar would spawn. So we might not be able to get one during this weather pattern. I neglected to check which weather pattern would be most beneficial for catching it. Oops. There's a Meryl, though. 
Pa's got the Rotom! Okay, just in case I'm going to disband the Union Room. I need to order food now. Okay, that's fine. Go ahead. I, I will I will wait for you to do that though. Just in case it like I don't know. Makes me stop doing what I'm doing. Our group has been disbanded. Okay. And now we're back in this town. I don't really care about being in this town. Thanks for helping, Sean. Of course. I'm glad to be of service. All right, let's check this again. Larvitar. Uh, habitat. There's a cage, like shade, rarely seen. So it might be like a rare spawn. I will, let me explore around here a little bit more. It was a little more north, I guess, so. Would it actually, if it says it likes shade, would it actually like spawn in the shade? Hmm. Some rufflets. One of our bronzors. Tinkatov. check more this way I suppose oh, it's a dawn fan I do need one of those twenty five okay we can handle that ow Talk about the paralysis. I'm better off just snarling more. Oh god, no, no, no slam. Okay, good. Peps, I hope you enjoy lemonade. Getting buffed by the sandstorm doesn't help either. It's probably low enough health. I'm gonna start chucking great balls at it, right? I really need to get something with a uh, false swipe, though. Okay. Rufflet. I do still. I, I didn't mean to run into it, but I was about to say I do still need rufflet, so.
That poor thing over there. Repeat ball. Okay. Uh, we got more dung Pokemon. We got probably a higher level Nacklin than I have, so I should probably pick that up. Snarl TM. Let me get that Nacklin. And then I'll check that Dark Raid. Purifying salt? Oh no. Smackdown? Oh no. I guess just try a great ball. I love how I said I'm gonna go after one of those titans and here I am not doing that. Okay, let's heal you up in case I need you. Squirrel. Ooh, a dark shelter. Yeah, I want that. Um, that does sound fun. If anyone wants a... It's only one star, but if anyone wants a dark terror type shelter, feel free to join. Weird, Ryan's online, but he's not showing up on my Twitch. Probably need to refresh. There we go. If no one says they want in or no one joins by like one minute, 30 seconds, I'll probably just start it on my own. I also should probably have lunch at some point. Doesn't seem like we have any takers. Just gonna go ahead and start it. No one likes my Shelly boy. I, I actually, I don't know why, but I really do like Cloyster a lot. And it was more like a recent development too, I think. I trained one up either in X and Y or Sun and Moon. And I ended up getting a shiny one in uh, Shield. When it has Skill Link, it's a very fun Pokemon. Unfortunately, my shiny one, I've said this before on stream, my shiny one has its hidden ability, which you can't change off of. Even with the ability items. And it makes me very sad because I don't want Overcoat on my Cloyster, I want Skill Link.
<sighs> Yay, shelter. I know that's a water stone evolution, I believe, so. Uh, does that respawn all the Pokemon? I feel like it might. Let me take a quick peek, see if I can't find a Larvitar real quick again. Oh, I need Stone Journer. Let me grab this, actually. do more damage okay so that's two s not even set of moves just two moves Start checking Pokeballs first, see if this works. That Ruffless right in my face, like, you fucking up my stone, buddy? Ayy. Stone Journer. Oh, we got a high level young goose. Although I know I can find gum shoes elsewhere, so. Uh, let's see, I didn't realize how tired I was. I think my social battery is drained and I just started feeling it. Oh, I'm sorry. If you need to take a break from chatting, by all means, please do. Another phalanx. All right, let me check that Pokedex again. Okay. It is nice that... So, so like, I got Shelter, right? So I can look at this and see what's next, which I know is Cloyster. Um, and since I got Love Disc, I can look at what's behind Love Disc. It's Quillfish. And what's beyond Love Disc, it's Finian. It's nice that like, I, I can recognize some of these. And the ones I don't recognize, like if I was going to go to Stone Journer, I bet I didn't already know that was Ice Q, I could be like, oh, maybe that's an evolution for Stone Journer. Actually, what's after Phalanx? Oh, it's Halucha. Okay. And Shepa should be Bayonet. Silazar is... Not an evolution. So I'm fine for typing, chatting. I just, uh, but I can't think of using my actual voice. Oh, uh, okay. Wiglet. Ooh, that seems like it might have an evolution. And he said, take it. Oh, dear God. <laughs> That's a hammer. Okay. Yeah, it, it's cool that you can do that. Anyway. I'm getting distracted from what I actually came here to do. Larvitar. Okay. So there's a few other places I could go check right now, I think. But I might just leave it as is, since I'm already behind on what I wanted to do today. That's our knife. This is a knife energy right there. Yep. Except it's more, more Thor anti, uh, yeah, more Thor, like. Ooh, actually we got. Uh, yeah, we'll we'll grab one of you already. 
Santa Conda. Oh god, you're level 40. Okay, um... <laughs> you can get a low level. I don't care about leveling, but yeah, it's not a big deal. I want to find you one. You said you wanted one. I don't want you finishing the game without adding it to your team if you want a part of your team, so... Oh, not para flinch strats. Oh, okay. We got rid of uh, paralysis. Oh god, that wasn't that good. Um, you know what? Let's terrestrialize and use it. I do need a rock type. Yeah, so. My hat now has a hat! Shed skin, no! Oh, fuck, dig. Um. That's bad. I have a flying type, though. Not that I want to send it out. Attack these. Yeah, if it has shed skin, I feel like I feel like using yawn on it over and over again is just a waste of time. Which sucks, because sleep is gonna be the best way I can catch something that's level fucking 40. Attacking move is dig though. Wait, no, right, it has head butt. Don't listen to me. I do want to keep Flamigo alive. Uh, so it is 50, hyper potion 60. Okay, good. Sandstorm's gone, at least. <laughs> okay, Glare is relatively okay. Means I can at least attempt another wing attack. Okay. I honestly might need to take on more gems more than anything just to get more ultra balls. All right. Hell yeah. Okay, where is this thing? It's right down there. I can fly to this city now. Hold on. Fly here, fly to this spot, yes. I don't know if it needs three clicks. I probably should just be able to hit a fly here and then just go. Ooh, 
Please help. There you are. Is that base? Oh shit, do I have to go through the base to get to where I want to go? Ah, it's you, Sean. Director Clavel? Like I said before, the name's Clive. Please don't forget it. Anyway, Sean, I owe you one. Thanks to you, I've accepted in I've been accepted into Operation Starfall. What's your end game? I need answers, that's all. How do I resolve the situation with Team Star and what's causing its members' odd behavior? Uh odd behavior? Team Star is a subject of more than a few nasty rumors swirling around the academy, you know. Some say the bullying was ca has caused a worrying number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in their bases, plotting to cause trouble for the academy. But these are rumors. The matter I am directly confronted with is something else. I'm talking about Team Star's persistent truancy. They've all been skipping class for a while now. Five of them in particular, so-called bosses of Team Star, haven't so much as set foot inside a classroom in over a year. And it seems the team's rank and file have recently started stirring up mischief as well. That's so why I took it upon myself to issue a direct order to Team Star to disband. I informed them that they should, should they refuse, I would have no choice but expel all students affiliated with their team. I'm afraid there's been no response. And the deadline I set for them to make their choice between dissolution, uh, yeah, dissolution or expulsion is nigh upon us. So you see, I overheard you talking on the phone with Cassiopeia. It couldn't have come at a more crucial time. It's Cassiopeia. Can you hear me? Eric! Whisper, whisper. Another time then. Be careful. I see you're coming up to one of Team Star's bases. Was there someone with you just now? It's just me. I also changed um my my phone thing to uh to Fuecoco. My my phone's uh case. Well, be warned, the Team Star will have its guard up after losing one boss you are to you already. This base won't go down as easily as the last one. Proceed with extreme caution. I'll be in touch. Alright, well, didn't mean to actually trigger that cutscene. Um... Now, if I... I could probably go around if I want to. Well, let's see. I did also say that I want to get Hitman that Larvitar. So let's go find a Larvitar. I'm doing classes? Oh. Well, I mean, it's gonna take me a while to find a Larvitar anyway. But uh, if you find a good use for the classes, let me know. You're getting smart. I mean, I'll believe it when I see it. I'm sorry, that was mean. Ah, I ran into a bunch of birds. Yeah, do them. I won't tell you why, but do them. Okay.
Okay, let's head up this way again. West Province, Area 1. Great. Ball. Okay, it looks like I need to cross the river. Which I can actually do up north. And then I might be able to make my way over there. Maybe I should just keep going up this way. We'll, we'll follow this. Oh, actually, I think the bridge up I need to go take is up here. And they are super easy. Oh, okay. X speed, but I'm already so fast. Look at me go. Ooh, there's a Pokemon Center up here. One that I've already been to. Shit. <laughs> I could have just flown here. Oh well. Electro Ball. Oh. Hello. And goodbye. Wait, hold up, yo! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> we found our first shiny, baby! Oh, that's a good one, right? Oh, I love Rock Rough. Oh, we got the crit catch too. Oh, yes! I saw it was blue and I was like, wait, hold up. Is that a new Pokemon? And then I noticed I was a Rockra. Hell yeah, let's go! Oh my god. That's awesome. Just the universe being awesome right there. Hell yeah, it is. Sad to throw me a bone. In the form of a dog. Now it's, but like, I don't think it has any new forms or anything. Like the evolution. So I like, I don't want to put it on my team just to, you know, have it on my team. Um, switch graph view. Okay. Yeah, it also has a pretty bad nature if I'm being honest, but you know, we'll take it. What, well, dude, right? Shiny Rock Ruff. Uh, you know what? I am gonna move this to a separate box just so it doesn't get lost. I wasn't even gonna set up a box for this. Cause I figured like, oh, I'm 
probably not going to even recognize a shiny if I see one. Uh, let's see. Swap. Yeah, I'll leave it there. Wait, wait, wait. You found a shiny? I did. I found a shiny rock rough. Hold up, there it is. There's the goodest boy. I don't know what the um, Lycanroc forms look like shiny. Maybe I can go check that real quick. Uh, it seems they are also blue. Okay. It's one of my favorite shinies. I mean, I'd, I'd be jealous. <laughs> be jealous. Oh, I like our forms are amazing. I've always wanted one. I feel like if I'm going to evolve that, I think it's going to be into the midnight form. Because I think that the midnight form being blue is going to look really good. Very thematic, too. Oh, sorry, Mudsbray. Oh, I will be jealous. Good. I'm glad. Oh, something all the way down there, but I'm already near the cave entrance. Oh. Oh, so land it. <gasps> Dino. And a Toxtricity. And a Gumshoes. And a Dub Trio. That's a bunch of catches that I just don't have yet, so that's good. Oh, I'm not supposed to be here yet. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, it'll resist Snarl, it'll resist Incinerate, it'll resist Lick. Um. Yeah, I was waiting for you to find that out. Dino was just like, you thought? <laughs> I mean, good news with Dino being a high level, uh, it'll be easier to evolve? <laughs> oh, I should have terrestrialized. Or not. Ah, oh, damn, that was exactly like half. So I can't use another double kick. Shit. Um, let's see. Headbutt, so double kick is actually 90 base power together with stab. So if I use headbutt, it should be less. That was much less. Okay. I think I need to start throwing balls, though, because it's about to wake up. Okay. Ooh, way up there. All right, so here's here's the deal, right? I don't want to just leave this cave. <gasps> There's Sableye too. Oh, Sableye is one of my favorite Pokemon ever. This cave is great. I love this place. Um, I want to get to the other side because I want to. Usually in a game like this, even if I get into an area where I'm not supposed to be, I want to try to be able to get elsewhere. And it doesn't seem like I can. I... Shit. Okay, never mind. I guess I can't go this way. Unless I'm missing something. I don't think I am, though. 
Alright, never mind. I was gonna try to go get that Larvitar, but... I'm gonna have to wait. I could jump down here, though. Wee. Ooh, Dragon Tail. That's a TV show that I sometimes watched back when I was a kid. I think it's probably deeper in the cave. It's no big deal with that. Yeah, but I just want to get one. I want to be a good friend. Plus, I want you to owe me. Oh, I think I see the dolphin over there. Oh, there's a terrestrialized dragon air. Oh no. Can anyone tell me how to get a Pokemon to come closer to me? There's also a bird of some sort. I don't know if this one I'm familiar with or not. It might be a Corvusquire. Dragonair, come here. I am a friend to all. What if I just, what if I just drown real quick? Maybe throw your Pokemon at it? I don't think they go that far. I'll try though. Yeah, I don't think it's exactly going anywhere. Oh well. Oh well. Would have been cool. I should also, like, keep my Pokemon out more often. I keep forgetting to do that. Okay, looks like we got a dragon den. I want in one of the. Anyone want in on a dragon den? Hello? Watch roll? Okay. Yeah, I'm in. Cool. Let me just catch this. And, uh, we'll do that. I could probably throw Pokeballs at this to being level 16. <laughs> Electric flying? Oh. When its wings catch the wind, the bones with the impure electricity as Pokemon dives into the ocean, catching prey by electrocuting them. Jesus Christ. <coughs> okay. Alright, and our dragon den is... Oh, um, it's that, uh, the dark, not dark, it's that ghost dog that got revealed a while ago. Oh, we can use Amy Rose here. Alright, link code's going up. If anyone else wants in, just say so. Or just put in the code. Whatever you want to do. Grievered. Yeah, that's the one. Thank you, Makoto.
If it's dragon, it's weak to dragon, fairy, and ice. Also, I'm going to eat some saltines. Alright, seems like that might be it, so I think I'm just going to start it. So, if these hacked raids, right, they're hacked, does the Pokemon you battle, is that shiny in the fight or is it shiny afterwards? Yeah. So it is shiny during the. Uh, oops. It is shiny during the raid. <laughs> okay, that's good to know. Reverd. It is said that a dog Pokemon that died in the wild without ever interacting with a human was reborn as this Pokemon. Why, Game Freak? What is wrong with you? All right, well, I guess I can continue up this way. I see a gimme ghoul. Yeah, I don't want to have come all this way for nothing, so. It was like that in Sword and Shield, but mine wasn't hacked. Right, I think I my, my Cloister is a legit one. Because I started that raid, if I remember correctly. Um, guy's so horrible. This is meant for kids. There's a natural shiny G-Max elephant, and I Master Balled it? I would hope so. <laughs> And I'm sure it was probably before G-Max Soup, so... Probably thought it was extra special before they were like, Mmm, soup for everybody. Ooh. But yeah, you know, people just want to... Want to make shinies and be like, oh, look. Look all these shinies we're getting. Wow. 
just you know make them not special doesn't have the DLC right what what I'm saying is you probably got it before the DLC was a thing and it would have been like extra special but because the DLC came along it was like um here everyone have uh everyone have uh Gigantamax if you want it oh god damn Well, I found a pupitar. Hitman, would you like a pupitar? Mock, we just stay the fuck away from me. Well, might not get a people's tire. Yeah, that works. Good luck. Thanks. I'm going to need it. Earthquake. Yep. Okay. Hmm. I have an idea. Okay. I was gonna say, how did you read that? Okay. I'm gonna swap bull hop back in. get another attack drop on it. Then it can't go bull hop. Unless it gets a crit. Okay. Now I can heal and res. I will say that stone edge on a uh, Flamigo was pretty, pretty scary. Thrash could be bad if it confuses itself. Heal up, um, Paps. <laughs> All right, we got the confusion. Heal up, bull, bull hop. Okay, I want to try to get a sleep. So we're gonna hope and pray that it's an earthquake or stone edge and kill Peps right away. Oh, come on. All right, we lived it, but we're probably slower. We're gonna attempt Yon though. Hell yeah. Going to be having a big IOU after this, huh? Maybe. We'll see. Tell me, what is uh, your exclusive that's supposed to be opposite of Larvitar? Do you know? Because I was thinking it might have been Dino, but I have Dino in my game, so I know that's not true.
I'll be honest, I don't really care about Bagon. <laughs> Alright, you said you want a dust ball. Shit. Hold on. Break out of this, please. Thank you. I have one dusk ball. Let's give it a shot. Hmm. It's not confused anymore. I'm gonna swap Bullhop back in. Get another attack decrease on it. <laughs> it's still doing so much. Are we speed tied? I think we might be speed tied. It's either that or it has a priority. No. I don't think it has a priority move. I need to catch it this turn or it needs to not KO itself. Damn it. Don't. Okay. Oh, come on. Snap out of confusion. Okay. That's all right. Not great, but all right. I need to switch back to Peps and try to put it to sleep, though. Is Spoik something you don't have? Uh, yeah, I haven't caught one yet. If you just want to trade me that, that'll be fine. Why didn't I use Yawn? I meant to use Yawn. And now it's thrashing. And now I'm dead. Okay. Oh, God. Thrash is normal, right? I don't have it. I'm gonna switch in Flamigo because it'll at least dodge Earthquake. Give you something to register. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Okay, we need. This isn't. I needed to use Earthquake and try like hit with it and not hit itself. I used Thrash. I need to use Pokeball, or yeah, I need to try to catch it with Ultra Balls again because it's confused. It might KO itself. There we go. Pupitar, let's go. Payback? On you? Uh, yeah. We'll forget Low Kick. Master Flint Sword and Headbutt? I mean, if you still have Tackle. Uh, we'll forget Scary Face. This pupa flies around wildly by venting with great force a gas pressurized inside his body. It fart flies. Wow. Okay, everyone else, um, please don't mind me. I'm just gonna 
just gonna make my way through here I'm gonna make my way downtown walk in fast faces pass and I'm homebound um, yeah <laughs> Focus Blast, baby. Do you play using Dawn Fan you got? Eh, not really. I mean, I'll have to see what becomes of it. Oh, you know what? I should... I should heal everyone up. Because Lord knows if I find a shiny in here, I'm going to need uh, everyone to full health. You got past a Larvitar? Oh, I mean, did you want a Larvitar? I got you the... I got you the Pupitar. I can get you the Larvitar too if you want. Right now, I'm just trying to find my way out of the cave. So... Hello? I know it's going to be super high level, but I'm curious. Glimmit. Okay. Nah, I'm fine. It's just money. Oh. <laughs> Defense throws sharply. Okay. What? What are you even supposed to be? This looks like an ultra beast to me. Did it just explode? Sure did. Duly noted. Oh lord, there's so many Pokemon up here. And that one's stuck in a rock. Oh, so is Sableye. Because why wouldn't they be stuck in a rock in this game? Look, I'm loving this game, but dear God, the programmers need more time. Jesus Christ. How's today's weather look? Leave the cave and you'll find out. South Province Area 6. I put Gothitelle in this game. Why? Behold these muscles. Okay, well, I made it to the town, which is what I needed to do. Heal up my Pokemon, please. Okay, that was an ordeal. All right, Hitman, are you ready to trade? Oh, well, I'm excited. Thank you, sir. You are welcome. Let's go ahead and uh, set that up, shall we? DM on Discord? Oh, yeah. Why don't you send me... A trade code. Yeah, you, you set you send me the code and then I'll put it in real quick. Then after this trade, I think I'm going to take a break. I'm going to use the restroom and maybe, maybe make some lunch.
how I set up a trade though. Um, it's in the Poke Globe thingy. And then you make a password that I have to put in. So Poke Portal. Link trade. And then go down here and like set a code and then do begin searching. Also, I just realized that with Pupitar at like 43, it'll evolve in like 10 or 15 levels. <laughs> wow. How what a what a beautiful password you put in. Oh right, yeah, level 43 Pupitar. Uh, with Shed Skin. I don't know if that's good or not, but... Burr. Oh, there we go. Thank you for the spoink. <laughs> Thank you for my big boy. You are welcome. I'm sorry that you like can barely use it for a while. <laughs> Alrighty then. Yep, yeah, quit out of trade. I think I'm good. I got my fourth gym badge. Oh, our levels going like way up after that. Yo, hold on. Hold on. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. So for anyone who was born far after my time, uh, these sprites on the wall are all from gen one. And I think like maybe gen two and stuff. So like, like you'd have like, you know, water Pokemon would be resembled by this, and then like normals by this, and bugs, and some of the fossils, and flying, and like Tauros. Oh, that's so cool. That's such a nice throwback. I love it. I love it so much. These might be specifically Gen 2 versions of them, since they are colored with red. Or it might be like Game Boy. Oh, they're on the ground too. It might be like Game Boy Color versions of like the red sprites or something. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Give me the TM. I love it. Oh, another focus blast. Oh, favorite gym right here. I don't even care what the, the test is. I don't even care what the... The battle is like best gym. Best gym right here. Also, that slowpoke is fucking huge. Right, I said I was gonna use the restroom, didn't I? And yet, I'm still playing Pokemon. Oh, it's Squawkabilly. I was like, what is that noise? What's going on? Ooh, 
Krefki. I also have my party. I need two more, I know, and one I need is a water site. That's a stork. Bombardier. Dual wing beat. Oh god. Okay. I think I have a poke doll. I have five poke dolls. Yeah, my party's slowly coming together. They made a stork that bombs people. Ooh, in prison. I'm also getting some nice TMs that I probably shouldn't have at this point in the game. Not that, like, in prison's very good. I'm, I more so mean Focus Blast specifically. Light Clay. If I ever get a Pokemon with screens, sure. Alright. I mean it though. I'm going I'm going to use the restroom. We're gonna make some lunch. I'll be back in a little bit. And boop. Finally we can relate. Our side by side is vague. I knew all along we'd find some way to communicate.
Okay, I'm back. I'm tired, <laughs> but I'm back. All right, we made it to here. I didn't need to necessarily be here, but I made it to here. Uh, I'm gonna go do the thing I meant to do, which is apparently one of these Pokemon. Uh, oh. I guess we'll fly to this one and see if I can make my way up there. Ugh. I got me some ginger ale, so that's good. That'd be good for my tum tum. All right. Uh. Check the map again. Me back in. Go through this. If I go this way, maybe that'll get me up to where I need to go. Oh, excuse me. All right, we got some ruins, which means we probably have some new Pokemon. Or it's the same shit I already saw in the desert, but lower level. I guess I could work on the bronze ores if I wanted to. Hex. Ooh, we got a terror raid. I don't think I've checked this one yet. Let's see. We have a Fairy Shellos. I'm gonna set this up. If everyone, anyone wants to join, feel free. Let me just see if I have any good Pokemon for this. Um, I need Steel or Poison. I mean, I have a Steel type. Hold on, before I start this, let me see if I can... Give me a minute. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can teach my uh, Amy Rose any steel moves first. If I even have any. Metal Claw. It's better than nothing. Yeah. Actually, before that even, I should check its summary and see if it can learn any fairy moves. Or steel moves, rather. It can learn Battle Claw. Okay, good. Glad I didn't waste that then. Oh, it has a um, modest nature. Okay. Well, that explains that then. We can get rid of Sweet Kiss. There we go. All right, Hitman, you let me know when you're ready. You're good? All right, here we go. I love... Uh, they said I love too. It, I love Lono or Yono. I don't know what that is yet.
All right, there's Hitman. If anyone else wants in now, uh, please let me know, or join by the one minute mark, because otherwise I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna start it. Dark is Udian's fairy, right? No. Dark is in fact weak to fairy. And I think, I don't know what, I don't know what fairy's resists are, but I would be willing to bet Dark is one of them. Fighting is also weak to fairy. You want poison or you want steel? Or if you don't have either of those, fire will at least resist fairy moves. But since it's a Shellos, it might have ground or water attack still, so. Just keep that in mind. RK9 is probably a pretty good pick. All right, let's go. RK9 is at least defensive, so not even defensive, it's just well rounded. Oh my god, look at that crown. You know what the Terrastralized Pokemon must feel like? It must feel like the player from Legends Arceus whenever we get ganged up on by like five Pokemon. Kind of like the crown for fairies, though. It's a pretty good crown. I'm here for it. I'm just going to keep heading up as best I can, anyway. store already I see another den up here although I don't know if I can get to it or not oh, item 
No, another item. Damn. Uh, that is a nimble, it looks like. You know, the rarest shinies for the new Pokemon that we're going to be getting are going to be the tiny ones. That you're just running past constantly. Like, oh, you have a shiny Tyranitar? That's great. I have a shiny nimble. Because no one else saw it. we go all right it's probably either grass maybe bug but probably grass oh it's the um it's the dung beetle we have a grass dung beetle everybody i'm pretty okay to skip this if i'm being honest but if anyone wants to let me know I haven't touched the classes yet, and I probably should. <laughs> Alright, it doesn't really seem like anybody wants to poop beetle, so... <laughs> if anyone changes their mind, feel free to let me know. I do them pause. They're kind of worth it. Yeah, maybe after I... At least take down one more Titan, finally. I'll um, go and check them out. I've already been up here, I think. Hmm. Yeah. Shit. I haven't been down this way at least, but... Hmm. Uh-oh. He's back down that way. How the fuck do I get up there? Maybe I can fly back this way and try going around. Actually, you know what? Let's fly to this one. Ah, that's a river. Uh, big walls. I just love they're almost dirty. I'm not trying to do the gym, I'm trying to do the Titan. But I can't figure out a way to get up there. Oh, I just have to walk into it. Okay. Show map. No, I'm gonna sub to my uh, OnlyFans for the map. How dare you?
I wasn't expecting a cutscene. Vaulting Velzula! I'm late, I'm late! Oh, that was, okay. Okay. Ah, uh, Kofu, wait! Ah, oh, he got away. How am I supposed to return this to him now? Oh, hey, you're here as a gym challenger, right? Uh, you can't fool me. You're definitely a challenger. That big man just left his Kofu, leader of the Kaskarafa gym. He has a bit of a childlike side to him, and today he's just run off to the market without his wallet. I'll be in big trouble without it. That's where you come in, kind gym challenger. Could you please take Kofu's wallet to him? No. Sorry, but it's impossible to challenge a gym without Kofu here. Can't exactly leave my post here at the lobby either, so... Here's his wallet. I'm counting on you. I'm just gonna take his money. Aw, oh, it's a little bit of that. <laughs> this be your gym test here. If you do this for me, you pass. Come to the Porto Marinada. It's on the other side of the desert to the west. Be careful, though. There are many dangerous Pokemon in the desert. Ah. Okay, I'm trying to get up here. So my plan right now is to try to cross the river at some point. And then maybe I can make it to where I need to go. Ooh, a water stone. You probably can't cause that not a titan, that's a mass outbreak. No, there's, I thought there was a titan underneath it. Is it really just a mass outbreak? Oh my fucking god, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot! Ugh. Alright. Well. There's a type of cookie to climb ability. No. All right, well, never mind me then. That's the one I was thinking of. I'm just gonna go crawl in a hole. That's the one you want? Yeah. All right, I think I think my cha <coughs> channel is just canceled now. It's been a good run, everybody. It's been a good run, but this is where we end it. Is there not a closer spot I could go to? Hold on. Oh. It's because this is still flagged. I thought I tagged this because of the exclamation part. Exclamation point. There we go. That's what I want. Okay. I think we're finally on track to do something today. That's not just, you know, catch Hitman uh, a Pokemon he's going to steamroll the rest of the game with. Did I check what den that was? I don't think I did. Yeah, it's an electric gym. Gym. Den. Ooh, hello. Another metal claw TM. Okay. Uh, electric crab brawler? I mean, I need a crab brawler, but meh. I guess I'm a bit too busy. 
I mean, you're not wrong, yeah. Oh, I know I'm not wrong. Trust me. <laughs> Are these made by that dung ball Pokemon? Ah, oh fuck, I thought I was gonna run through them. Ah, oh, shit. Where'd that item just go? Haunter! Come here, you. Haunter looks really good in this game. Oh, um, and we're level 30! And you have Nightshade, which is, I think, yeah, enough to kill me. Alright. I don't think I have a normal type on me. Um, do I have anything that would resist its move at least? I guess Mastiff. Just have to throw in Pokeballs and hope for the best, I suppose. Uh, that was the best, yes. All right, well, if anyone wants to trade Haunters, hit me up. I already have three Gengar I was planning on training. But if I don't have to... That's pretty good. I'm gonna check something. Okay, it does use potions, it looks like. When you just auto heal, it probably uses like your least effective thing you have on you. Which I welcome, personally. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Who dropped their cocoa pebbles? Hmm. But what? Huh? Bird? I really don't like that it has just like a flap. I really wish that was like a separate part of it that it just like fashions itself. But it just looks like a flap to me. It's unsettling. Bombardier, the open sky titan. Is it a dark type? So I have a dark and a ghost move and it resists both of them. Joke's on you, I don't have a berry. <laughs> yeah, it must be like flying dark. Dark flying, I think, yeah. Right, it goes into the cave to eat. Right. The Titan Bombardier began eating something. Sean, you managed to get the Titan somehow. Huh? You managed to get to the Titan somehow. So that's the open sky Titan. Wait, is this Titan what's been dropping all these boulders? I was lucky enough to be able to sneak up here because it had all its attention on you, little bud. Looks like it's trying to power itself up. Like with some kind of mystical meal power or something. 
You mean like the other one did? So we better be ready to go all out. Okay. Trying to trap rocks and folks is dangerous. Let's give this a good taste of defeat. I'm just gonna try to put to sleep. Well, it's not flying anymore. Not that I have any ground moves to use on it. Oh, I just realized I get to rasteralize again. Even though I did last battle. And I don't think I should be able to. So I guess it it at least carries over between the two fights. Maybe it just considers it one. And now it's raining, so my attacks do less. Not that it matters, I'm gonna kill it anyway if it's not already dead. Just feels like the game is like, hey, here's a quick middle finger for you. Good job, Peps. I believed in you. Yes! Way to go, Sean! Looks like we don't have to worry about any more boulders falling on us now, huh? Yeah, I, I guess. There has to be more of that Herba Mystica it ate in here. Let's hurry and fight it before the Titan can come back for another go at us. So you're gonna cook an, cook an entire meal before then, right? If we're lucky, there'll be another herb here. Question for the chat. Do you say herb or do you say herb? Like, do you pronounce the H or no? I knew it! I mean, I'm American, so I don't pronounce the H, and I don't know why. It really is here. This is one of the herbs. Make no mistake. You and Arvin found the bitter herb, Mystica. Woohoo! We did it! Thanks, Sean! No problem, buddy. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? Bitter Herba Mystica, great for your circulation. It really gets the blood flowing. And that warms you right up, nice and toasty, even boosting the immune system. Or so it says. If I could just split this into a tasty sand, slip this. If I could slip this into a tasty sandwich and get him to eat some. Does he have? Mirai Dawn? <laughs> Is that why he didn't worry about losing a legendary Pokemon? I have the other one. I don't really care. Well, what are we waiting for, Sean? It's time to dig in. Let me whip something up for us. That would be quite the twist, huh? Yar, tia, whatcha? And Bob's your uncle. Here you go, my special whimsical herb filled super sandwich. And it comes with a side of Titan Badge. This is a token of my gratitude, course. <laughs> oh no. They made dubious food. We really are playing Breath of the Wild. Oh no. I 
I guess. Oh, come on, you again? Sniff, sniff. I'm gonna give you a sandwich, Koraidon. I, I'm, I'm gonna say right now, Koraidon, and I'm guessing Miradon. I haven't played Ultraviolet, obviously, but Koraidon at least, actually pretty cute. How it's just like, okay, you got some sandwich. I would like some sandwich. Can I have some sandwich, please? Here you go. Gans? Hmm. They're trying to say thanks or something? Well, good thing I made extra. They're so cute. They really are. I, I don't know if anyone's seen yet, but um, someone bought Ultraviolet for Spooky. Uh, and I'm very excited to see what they how they react to the uh, legendaries being like this cute. Same, they're both awesome. This is what she, this is what she does. This is what she does. She just stares at like. That's mine, right? You made that for me. <laughs> you helped me out with a whole bunch with the hard stuff, so it's only fair that you get more. Oh damn! Yeah, right. Like Spooky wasn't gonna buy it until like next year, cause of like bills and stuff. But uh, you know, someone bought it for them. Which like part of me is kind of like sad I didn't do it. But I was like, hey, what if I bought this for you? And they were like, do not. So, oh well. Cause I I bought Spooky the last two Pokemon games. I bought them Sword and I bought them right. It, I didn't buy them Legends Arceus. I won them Legends Arceus from another streamer's channel. So. I definitely, absolutely did not make extra so that Koraidon could have a sandwich, okay? Charlie stared at me like this for 10 minutes yesterday wanting a cheesy puff. Did she get a cheesy puff? Like, Koraidon's getting the sandwich? Chomp, chomp, snarf, chomp. Oh, yes! Koraidon will be able to move across the water now. Not the power-up I saw coming from that. Did it go stronger again? Ah, yeah. Man, these Urban Mystic really do pack a punch, don't they? I gave her one 10 minutes previously. Oh, okay. He's starting wanting another. How dare. I mean, they better. I wasn't really up the creek. Sniff, sniff. No, 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 no. Ah, yeah. That's not yours. You can have mine, but you, you can't, you can't have Arvin's. Don't you dare touch that! That isn't for you! I can't. Oh, uh, sorry. I shouldn't have shouted like that. I guess I should at least tell you the full story, Sean. Finally. Come on out, bud. Oh. It's so cute. This is Mabo Stiff, my partner. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh. Here you go, bud. Eat up. This sandwich should help you feel better. Why not just feed it the herbs? Why does it need the sandwich? Slowly now. Take your time. Small bites are fine, just chew nice and slow. I love it. My buddy here was hurt pretty bad a while ago. Real bad, in fact. He never really recovered. I wish I, both of those are basically the same thing. They said this wasn't any old regular was it any regular old injury, injury or illness? Mabastiff here is the only thing in the world I care about. The only thing. So I promised I'd make him better. Whatever it takes. I have not been giving Arven enough credit. I searched online, I read books, I looked all over and tried every cure and remedy I could find. But nothing really worked. I had almost given up hope. That's when I found out about the Herba Mystica. That book. What is it? I found it in my mom's lab. Hmm. 
Area Zero is home to wondrous herbs that instantly impart vigor when eaten. We dubbed them Herba Mystica and attempted to grow some in areas around Paldea. However, before we could harvest, the herbs were eaten by Pokemon, which in turn grew large and strong. We call these Titan Pokemon. <laughs> ah. This book's full of crazy stories and legends and things. Stuff nobody would usually believe. But I believe it. I think what it said is says is true. According to this book, eat all five Herba Mystica can cure anything that ails you. Case in point, Mabasif's paws were cold as ice before he ate that last herb. But they've warmed up a little now. I'm sure they have. Hmm. Oh, you're done eating, buddy? Your bud? Hey, Mabastiff! Can... can you see? Are your eyes open? Yes! I did it! It's... it's been so long since he was able to open his eyes. I was so worried. I'm like gonna start crying. This is so sweet. <laughs> Oh man, I, I'm so, I'm so glad. Hey, hey, look at him. Those fiery orange little eyes. I don't even tell if they're open or not, but I know the difference. I'm gonna need a tissue. I'm like actually tearing up. <laughs> How is these herbs is amazing. I knew the book wasn't lying. I'm gonna bring Mavisif back to full health. I swear it. So, uh, yeah. That's my story. Three herbs to go. Let's find them together. I just want to find all the herbs now. Agya, <laughs> Agya. Like, I know I'll probably get my shit rocked, but I, I just really want to do that to help now. Hello, Sean. This is Sada. I detect that Koridon has regained more of its original power. How do you know this? While riding upon it, it seems you should be now should now be able to move across water. Oh, Koridon can jump out of the water too. Good. I'm relying on you to continue taking good care of Koridon. Okay. Well, I think that makes our next destination pretty clear, huh? If I even can make it up there, but we're gonna we're gonna try. Ooh, what do we have down here? Oh, that's, um, the new kicky bug. Yeah, fight me. Yeah, I just, I just want to help Mabistiff now. <laughs> oh, it's a fighting kicky bug. All right, uh, go to sleep. Oh, I'm so tired and bored of this fight. Oh, ho, ho. Uh, so let's see. Uh, super or an effective lick will be more power than a resisted snarl. So I guess we'll go with that. <laughs> oh, actually, no, because right, I discovered last night that if you're battling a wild terrestrialized Pokemon, um you can do as much damage as you want to it, and I'm pretty sure it'll always, like, stop in the red. So I was fighting a Diglett, and I, uh, I used Bullet Seed. It only hit twice, and the second attack did, like, next to nothing. I think because I broke the Terra thing. So...
There we go. Low kicks is mine. I will get this TM. Shadow Claw. Ooh. We plunk. Low sweep. I think that's the move that lowers. Oh. It lowers speed when you hit with her, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I should actually make sure my Pokemon are... Oh, yeah, we're, we're doing good. Found a Moonstone? And all my things just disappeared. Okay. All right. Well, before we deal with that lovely fella, let's go see what this is. Ooh, a Silazar. I actually want another one of these because the one I have it has shed skin. I don't know if it's supposed to have like a different thing, but. See if it has a different bit. It's level 45. Of course. That did so much. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, choose next Pokemon. Um, rocks, electric, ice, nothing. Okay. This will at least resist any flying or normal attacks it has. Or dragon. I should be immune to dragon, which is even better. Might as well. Shit, okay. Um I might wanna just like run Facade just one sh uh, I guess I was a fairy type only. Damn it. Okay, that's my bad. Alright, we'll we'll leave you be, I guess. I said not boxes. Bag. Nest ball.
No, oh, it's a little sand dial. It's cute. You arrived at your destination, I sure did. That's also a sand dial. Okay. All right, you. God, you look cool. I'm guess so I, I don't know what its type is. My best guess is it's gonna be ground rock. Hello Sean, this is Professor Sada. Great Tusk is a Pokemon that came from the great crater Paldea. I ask that you do whatever you need is needed to subdue it for me. With all due caution, of course. Great Tusk, the Quaking Earth Titan. Ow. Okay. Did I bite off more than I can chew? Of course. Well, that's what I'm best at, right? Right, everybody? That's what I'm best at? It already woke up. So this is bad. I might need to go back to my strat of just like, yeah, I was gonna say something, but I don't want to see this. Thanks, man. No, but actually, thank you for it. I, I would rather run into it and then get fucked over than uh, be told to just not do it. So. Um... Not very effective. Okay, so it's not... So does that mean it's actually fighting type? Hmm. So go to the electric gym, and then after that, do the dark and fire. Because you're so over level for them. I mean, I already did the uh, the fire star thing last stream. Um, what what's the point of trying to do it in order if I got an open world to fuck around in, right? So where's my attack is special? God damn it! My attacking special. Um, double kick. Speed rose. Wait, rapid spin increases speed now? That's news to me. I'm going to revive our flamigo. Mm. And that's why I revived Flamigo. Flamigo is our only Pokemon that's going to resist its fighting attacks, so... Oh, did the Sandstorm die down? Oh, thank god. Also, Dragon Tail does how it is back in the day and send the Pokemon back after hits. Yeah, I kind of figured. Alright, I'm gonna take some time and we're gonna res everybody. 
Yeah, that's why I'm not using it because I figured why bother? I'm not exactly using like spikes set up, so. I like that. It's nice, but it's like if I'm using Dragon Tail, it's probably going to hit a Dragon Pokemon, and then I don't want to bring out a non Dragon Pokemon, so. Um. Did I res? No, I did not res everybody. Res you now. I am running very low on super potions, and I really need to go to a store and fix that. That and the uh, great balls. Okay, I can start hitting it now, at least. Jesus Christ. I actually wouldn't mind if you tried to put Sandstorm back up. Or maybe that was a weather effect. Never mind. Worst part is, as soon as I'm done with this, it's probably gonna go eat its stuff and fight me again. I'm gonna attempt to get two wing attacks in. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. I have hyper potions too. Whoa. It's getting dark too. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do a curtain and whatnot. It's not even that dark outside, it's just that it's, uh, the sun is, like, over there, so, like, my side of the house is very dark. There we go. Okay, that's definitely the point where it's just gonna run off, because that, that was a crit, too. Could've used that, like, three turns ago. Okay, cool. So that's over there. I'm gonna make my way to the nearest town that I can get to. And we're gonna heal. Even though I just used all my items, but that doesn't matter. Oh shit, there's a crack down my glass. That's probably not good. It's not leaking, but still. Okay. Okay, Terra Orbs recharged. I'd like to buy Super Potions. I'll buy 
27, we're gonna pay with the LP, because I have a lot of that. I don't like paying with the LP, but... And buy 17 more Great Balls, too. Oh, I also have shit I can sell. Damn it. I should have done this first. Oh, well. You can bulk sell? Oh, I guess you can. Okay. I didn't realize that was a thing. All right, well, now I have a lot of money. I'm gonna check this. Let me see if I can get any good flying moves if Flamigo's gonna stick around at all. Oh, I didn't realize you could also. Okay, so we got normal. Air, grass. Flying, here we go. Acrobatics. Uh, can't make it. Air cutter. Uh, special move. Probably don't want to put that on you. And uh, Air Slash. Also special. Damn. Okay, close sweep. Bulk up. Focus Blast. What is that? Okay. There's a really be battle somewhere. Eh. Okay, we're going to make you the lead. Because we're still going to need bull hop for that. I also, I think, we're going to use some candy. Use some EXP candy. We got everyone up to like peps level. Slam, nah. Montoros, two. Two more. There we go. Zen Headbutt. Uh, yeah, I'll take a coverage move. I'm not using Workup, that, that's for sure. Alright, I need... Perfect. One Thorn Hex. Why? Uh, oh, more damage was inflicted by Sash Mission, and I have Sun Spore, so yeah, sure. Wait a minute. <gasps> Lakey's is evolving! Oh, look at them like, oh, I did not, ex I did not expect the snout. Okay. Toad's cruel. These Pokemon gather into groups and form colonies deep within forests. 
They absolutely hate it when strangers approach. More leggies. So many more leggies. Wow. Okay. Um, I guess you can have my last two. Let's learn payback. Payback's probably an okay move, right? Uh, it's less than bite. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave it at that. Uh, rare candies will hold on to. Even though I think the EXP candies are probably worth more overall. I wanna check a thing. I wanna check something. Toad's cruel, where are you? I have to be getting close, right? Yeah, there you are. Tropius, okay. Looks a little stubbier than normal, though, so we'll see if it's regular Tropius or not. But yeah, Toad's cruel looks like the end of that line. Bramblin. Looks like it, yeah, looks like that evolves. Litleo. Oh, does that mean Tauros doesn't evolve? Because that's 24. Interesting. Cacnea, probably Cacturn. <laughs> Behold my giant wad of dung! Ah, Fortress is in the game. Uh, we got Caesar and we got Heracross. Okay, I was actually wondering if Cleavor was in the game. Hmm. I suppose not. Maybe we'll be able to transfer it later, though. Wait, did Ryan already go offline? <laughs> Shit. Okay. Anyway. Wait, there's a Dreadnought here? Where is there a Dreadnought? I need that for my decks. Where's Dreadnought? All right, I can go on water now. I totally forgot. Maybe I need a water Terra Shard. Okay, that's my second Terra Shard I've gotten. I got a rock one earlier, like yesterday. Oh, I don't. I see where Dreadnought could be. Alright. Time to go fight us, a mammoth looking motherfucker. Yeah, Stone Turner. Yeah, I got my strat now. It's, you know, I got Bull Hop, send in Bull Hop, get the Intimidate off. And then from there we can switch into Flamigo and take it down, hopefully. I saw you earlier. A little 44, just FYI. That's I I handled it before. I can handle it again. What? You don't believe me? You don't believe in me? How rude. I probably should have finally like bought a sharp beak and given it to it though. Do I have any good items to actually give? Although it has knockoff, so I guess it doesn't matter. gonna knock everything off anyway so 
Never mind. I wish I could have made acrobatics. That would have been great. I'm pretty sure I checked your moves earlier. Let me see if... Yeah, just... Peck. Alright. I mean, good news is, I'll know what's super effective for sure now, so... Look at the mats you need. I think one of them was mystery, so I haven't run into it yet. The Titan Great Tusk began eating something. Sean, looks like you found yourself a Titan. Wait, that's the Quaking Earth Titan? Uh, is... Is that thing even a Pokemon? It must be trying to get pumped with that little snack. Time to show that thing what you and me can do, Sean. I'm also going to have another target for it to try to hit. So that's good, too. <laughs> oh, and he's got a Scovelin now. Um... Yeah, we'll swap into Flamigo. I'm gonna use Covillain to cut nearby to see a real spicy victory. Good for you. Good for you. Speed harshly fell. This is already going great. Look at my fancy hat. Can't even hit me with that move. I'll just go ahead and heal just in case it tries to attack me again. Would you stop that? And you were worried, Hitman. I will say, I, it, I think it could kill me here, so I'm just gonna go ahead and res and hope that Scavillan can take it out. I was just letting you know. No, you, you were just saying you didn't believe in me. That's what you were saying. Hey. Must learn roost? Absolutely not. Yes! Nice going, little buddy! What even was that thing, though? Kind of feel like maybe I've seen it before somewhere. In your book? Was it in your book? Anyway, I bet if we head inside, we'll find more of that Herba Mystica it was eaten. Well, let's give the place a once-over before that thing decides to come back. 
I mean, yeah. Let's. I'm sure there's some here, too. What if there wasn't? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! I spy Herba Mystica! You and Arvin found the Herba Mystica. I think it was sour, so. Another successful search. We're on a roll. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? Okay. <clears throat> Sour Herba Mystica is chock full of nutrients and is great for boosting your overall health. It says here works wonders whether you're tired physically or mentally. Perks you right up. Is this will definitely help Mabstaviff. Mabastiff. Feel even better. Come on, Sean. Let's get some food going. Kyarjahua! Sorry to keep you waiting. There you go. Another of your favorite old Arvin sandwiches. And it comes with a special Titan badge. The Pokemon League might not recognize it, but I hope you appreciate it all the same. I mean, I like it. Quick, you're outside and defeated. Path of Legends. I mean, you know who's gonna like it more, though. I said, you know who's gonna like it more, though? Yeah, there we go. Gas? Figured this might happen. Don't worry, I made extra this time for that brood of yours. Sniff, sniff. Do you want to give your sandwich to Karadon? I'll share. Guns! Come on out, Mabbo Stiff. Got some for you too, bud. I'm too invested in this dog now. That's it, small bites, small bites. Chomp chomp, snarf chomp. I guess. Oh, we got, okay, I kind of figured we'd get rock climbing from this, but I guess I'll take gliding instead. Come on, at least bother to taste it before you swallow it right down, would you? I guess. This bird seems to be benefiting from the herbs too, I guess, in its own sort of way. Well, it's healing it. Just like it's healing Mabastiff. Oh yeah, before I forget, Sean, take another look at this. There's always a Titan Pokemon near the Herb of Mystica when we find him, right? Like the book says, it's not like big old Pokemon just happen to like these herbs. It's actually something in the herbs that makes the Titan so big and strong. So does that mean Titan's Lair isn't really some kind of treasure hoard or whatever? It's just a pantry where the Titan keeps its food? Oh, you doing your sandwich, Mabastiff? Say Borf. <gasps> he did a Borf! Woof! You, you heard that, right, Sean? Mabastiff just woofed, right? Yeah? Right? I'm not imagining things. <gasps> Borf. See? See that? I knew I wasn't just hearing things. Oh, Mavistiff. Who's my best bud, huh? Who's the best bo best boys? You are. Yes, you are. <laughs> it's... It's been so long since I heard that wolf. Mavistiff is definitely getting better. Ever since I've teamed up with you, good things keep happening. But we still got two more herbs to go. Hope you stick it out until we're done. Ah, yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Mabis is such a good boy. Oh, he's such a good boy. 
forth. Da, 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 da. Hello, Sean. This is Sada. I detect Karida has regained more of its original power. After it has jumped in the air, you should try pressing B again. It should glide now. Um, if you saw if you press B once more, you'll stop gliding and immediately start falling. Okay. Please keep taking good care of Karidon. Awesome. That'll help me get to new areas, at least. Um, we're near the town with the guy, so... Also another raid. Ooh, Thunderbolt? Very nice. Oh yeah, we got your Afri too. Alright, so we have a dragon type hop up. I'm sorry, I'm just gonna skip that. It's already so weak to ice. Why would I want to give people more of an excuse to use ice on it? Figgy berry, that's pretty good. I don't know how I feel about the Pokemon just kind of disappearing if I get too close to a town. Go ahead and heal up. It's a curly here. Two curly is here. That'll actually save me some evolving I need to do. I think I just saw something new actually. Yeah, that looks new. Oh, it's the little engine from um the fight we did. Also, that's a ditto that we ran into, not a curlia. <laughs> well, it'd be easier to make Pokemon if I need to. Um If I don't kill it first, I'm gonna kill it first. Whatever. <laughs> There's gonna be more in the area. I'm not worried about it. I'll throw peps up front. starting to hurt from wearing headphones like most of the last two days it fled man fuck you curlia candy here's another one That should probably be enough. Yay. Uh, 
Alright, we got the Curlia. So... Is that Meowth? Hello. What the fuck? What just... Oh. Well, I guess it doesn't matter, because it's just... It's, it's a ditto. Enjoy being a peps. I forget, does it get the catch rate of the thing it becomes? I think it might. Which, if that's the case, this might be rough. Oh, okay, we got a crit. There we go. Alright, got a uh, ditto. Transformation ability is perfect, however, if made to laugh, it can't maintain its disguise. Aww. Dittos can laugh. That's cute. Sorry, I'm gonna interrupt your meal because I need uh, like two more of you. Life do? Oh. I mean, you could use it on me if you wanted to. That's what I was hoping wouldn't happen. Because now I won't fall asleep. Paralysis will still give it a boost, just not as good as sleep. Speaking of sleep, I'm sleepy. Been streaming since what noon? Flamethrower finally. Oh, I can get rid of incinerate. Remove that actually burns. And Amy Rose wants to learn flash cannon over metal claw? With your higher special attack stat? Yeah, might as well. I got Ralts dust. Dust from a Ralts. Okay, can I actually fight this thing now? Tandemouse. Well, it's cute. I'm just gonna start checking the Great Balls. See if that works. Oh, they're like little dolls, it looks like. Flamethrower might kill it. 
I'll go for Snarl. I remember back in my day during Gen 5 when they introduced the move Snarl, it was a hard to get TM because you needed to do an event for it. And now they just give it away like it's candy to all these little whippersnappers. Oh my god. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna heal. I don't need a hyper potion. Facts. <laughs> Yeah, it was like TM95 or something, and you can only get it from some event. I can't remember exactly what, but like it wasn't... It was in the game, like in the data, but it wasn't something you could just get. I hope that if Tandem Mouse evolves, it just, it just gets another mouse. And then I hope it evolves like... 50 times. So you just have an army of mice. Back in my day, you only got one TM per game. And we liked it. Yeah. No, we didn't. <laughs> no, we hated it. Mm, Alright, I'm gonna go for Yawn, but if it does Encore on me... Okay. Also, I think you could buy Flamethrower, Thunderbolt, and Ice Beam at the Celadon, um... Uh, department store. And those are, like, always the best moves. Thank you. Tandem Mouse. He's been in great teamwork. They use their incisors to cut pieces out of any material that might be useful for a nest. They make off with them. They're pretty cute. I love Tandem Mouse. The puns in this gen are great. They're pretty good. Slap that in there. Okay. And gotcha. You caught the ditto off guard. I don't want a ditto. I already have a ditto. Bye, ditto. I want a muck. Or Grimer, rather. special back here yes another moonstone all righty oh actually I gotta gotta do this Quick ball soon. Ooh, baby. Oh, there's Tandem Mouse. Okay. And it looks like it's just Tandem Mouse, but one of them gets a bigger arm. Or maybe both of them. They hold their hands so hard that they actually, like, get muscular from it. I'm on the roof now. Ooh, a large experience candy? I will take it. Let's see. Any of the roofs I should go to? They become that scene from the Arnold movie. Oh yeah, the one with like the just the the bursting muscles.
Nice sleepy little town here. Kinda like it. Kinda dig it. I could live here. We've got a calm mint. Of special defense lowers attack. That's probably good for one of my Pokemon. Oops. Ah, I didn't mean to run into you, Skeeto. Although I don't know if I have a Skeeto yet, so I should probably like catch this one, huh? <laughs> Even if I have the Skeeto, I don't think I have a second one for Go Goat at the very least, so. Flamethrower will probably kill it. Damn. Yeah, of course you have synthesis. I just had an idea for crits in this game. What if... This is probably... This would probably break the game, but it would make like trying to get crits more worth it. What if when you crit, right... Um, if you like lower or raise it's like stats to like a second mean like I lowered a special attack right what if I crit and I lowered it two stages as well it'd probably be busted but I, I think it, again it would make crits worth it you know Skeeto Crits already ignore stat changes. Well, it ignores the stat changes, but it would still put that stat change on the Pokemon, you know? Also, they can make it so they don't ignore stat changes. Just saying. It's Pokemon. They do what they want. Oh, something on this roof? Nothing special for me. Heh. Poison jab. Ooh. That's a good jab. An assault vest? Hot damn. Alright. That's that's good. That is good. Oh, sorry, hold on. Just let, me, just let me clip through it. Just let me clip through it. I look so excited to be here. Wee, Plunk. They really put Bruxish in this game? Alright then. Actually, they really put Skrelp in this game. Come here, my boy. I love Skrelp. Oh god, it's a higher level than me. Um, yawn? Don't like that. Maybe I should just run. I'll come back for that when I can. Enjoy your day, Skrelp. You deserve it. Now I gotta figure out how to get out of the ocean. Ain't that a mood. Oh, hey. What do we got here? We have a bug bounce suite. No, thank you. Even though I think I need bounce suite, no thank you. We got a Cantonian slow poke. We got a big bird. I I have one of you, but smaller. Kill a watch. Okay. 
Watchrel and kill a Watchrel. Okay, I like it. I like it, I guess. Oh, so Figly, what the hell are you doing here? You're streaming. Our mini Zapdos, too. Yeah, it is a mini Zapdos, isn't it? I'll we'll try a flamethrower. Probably won't kill it. It might kill me, though. All right, can't it, like, not fall asleep because of uproar? God damn it. Oh, damn. Did you just fucking- you bastard. Now I gotta do all that damage all over again. Try my last yawn. Granted, it has to, like, not use uproar for, like, two or three turns. Asleep. I think I hit it with one snarl and start chucking balls. Oh, there's a floatzel behind me, too. Kill a Watchrel inflates its throat sack to amplify its electricity. By riding the wind, this Pokemon can fly over 430 miles in a day. Damn. Okay. Oh, uh, pardon me, Floatzel. I did not mean to, um, bother you. I've now seen a float tool though. So I'll know where to find him. Come back for that. Oh, it's a wingo. I was like, what is that walking around? Super Potion. Oh boy, metronome. And there's our crab brawler. Got a health feather. There's a giraffe rig. Another floatzel. My game just uh paused for a second, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go ahead and save. Muscle feather. Ultra Ball, Secret Cave, nope, oh, pardon me, level 50, here, you may have this doll, goodbye.
You know what? I think I think we export that. Hold on. What the fuck? I was gonna say I think we export enough, but I want to know what that is. Hmm. Well, it's behind me now, but I'm also want to go over here. So. Oh, it's a Raichu, so I don't have to use my Thunderstone that I don't have. Granted, it's probably like level 50, so I probably shouldn't. So, uh, we'll, we'll wait on that. But I know that it's there. Yeah, you just yeah, fly here. Ugh. <sighs> Soda pop. Okay, I'm gonna look to see how a few of these evolve just because we're getting kind of mischief. Okay, certain level. Got it. <laughs> Okay. Oh, Flamigo is a single stage. Okay, so that doesn't even evolve. So I'm not going to leave that in my party anymore then. Good Pokemon. I like it. It's just, you know, trying to work on a bunch of things, so. Uh, let's see, 32, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There we go. Okay, level. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. So, Bullhop might not be sticking around the entire time, just saying. Just saying. Okay. What do I want to put in my party now, then? Interesting. Okay. Female Curlia? Yeah. Do we have a male Curlia yet? We do. Perfect. Okay. So we'll throw Curlia in here. Bag. Um, we'll just do a rare candy. Um, I guess I evolved it a little too close to the Pokemon Center, huh? It's either that or Mastiff's fucking gigantic. Or sorry, Mabastiff. This Pokemon can store energy in its large Dulap. Dulap? Mabastiff unleashes uh, this energy all at once to blow away enemies. Oh, is that a dark type? That's such a good boy. Comeuppance? Yeah, let's see what that is. 
Uh, the user retaliates with much greater force against the opponent than last inflicted damage on it. Is this just dark counter? Huh. I'm gonna not learn it, though. We'll go ahead and throw you in here. Hmm. I know the tumbleweed evolves. Do I even need to worry about things that evolve? Cause like I have candy and I can get more candy. So I, maybe I should worry more about team comp than anything. Hmm. We got fire. We got fighting. We got ground grass, fairy steel. That's not really part of the party, but. Hmm. Like, what other Pokemon would I want to use, though? Could, I could put Rockruff in the team. Um. Hmm. Like, I would want to use new Pokemon, but I don't know what other Pokemon there are that I would want to throw on my party. Squawkabilly. Uh, Knackley, but I have a higher level one I can use. <laughs> I don't know. I would, I would love to use Scovillain if I didn't already have this guy and, or sorry, this girl and this girl on our, on our team. We got Relor. I could throw Relor on the team. Just the, 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 the poop bug. I guess. Uh, Tandemass. Kill a Watchroll. I could throw on the team too. Uh, it actually has a good nature as well. Up special attack, down attack. Oh, but I have... No, I don't have... I keep thinking Leggies is an electric type and I don't know why. I don't have an electric type though. Yeah, you know what, Kilowattro? Welcome to the team. We need nicknames though, so mini Zapdos. Um, I probably can't fit Whistle Teats in there, huh? <laughs> or a little Zappy. Zappy's not bad. We'll do... How about mini zaps? Mm, mini zappy. Sorry, I did like uh, little peps. For uh, Foy Coco, so mi mini Zappy is good. Okay. I do need you to know better moves that are not physical. Faster. Well, you are a very fast Pokemon. Seemingly. So that over Spark's probably a good idea. Okay, actually, what do you know now? You know... Bug Bite, Mud Shot, Roll Out, Take Down. I do not like Take Down. Sand Attack, Defense Curl. 
Oh, you have an admin nature too. Wow. Okay. Yeah, those are actually two really good ads to our team. Okay. Yeah, actually... Let's see. So, modest, adamant, modest, modest. Which, actually, this might be, like, a bad thing for you. I don't know. It depends on what you evolve into. Uh, no boosting nature, and then just not good. But that's fine. This might be our team from now on. I probably don't need to heal again, but oh well. Unless I find something else I want to add to the team. Like, the last two are not definitive members of the... Of the party, but... They are filling some holes that we need filled, so... What a Flaffy. Is it Flaffy hours? Oh, wait. Is this a department store of this game? Oh, my. Um, maybe not, actually. More bidding experience. Enter auctions. Another time. Au auctioning? And then catch your eye? No, because you're not selling me anything. I guess I might have been wrong. I like the art, though. Oh, here we go. Sandwiches. You know what? I'll buy that zesty sandwich. I've come up with a new recipe. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, I can buy more fillings for stuff. Blue Pokeball pick? Oh, okay. So this is just more like a, a, a food place. You buy food stuff here. So I guess it's kind of a department store for food. My Pokemon will have more bonus experience and you have higher water encounters now? Oh, okay. Volton, Vizula! Where? Where in the world? Why do you have two sets of eyebrows? Where in the world is my wallet? Without my wallet, I won't be able to get today's hot item. It'll get bought up by someone else. Sniffle. Don't worry, old man, Kofu. I'll run and look for it right now. What do you want? Old man Kofu's in the middle of some super duper important ingredient buying. If you're thinking about trying to interrupt him. Sorry. I, I think it's more of a southern. If you're thinking about trying to interrupt him, then I, his best apprentice, will have to stop you. So, what do you have some super important to say to us business folks or what? This is super important. Super important, eh? We'll see about that. Maybe a bat will shut your mouth. Maybe. Jim Trader Hugo. Bah. Pokemon. Go leggies! Go just like kind of touch him with your tentacles. You'll probably give up after that.
See ya. Clauncher? Ooh. I also like this Pokemon a lot from Gen 6. Or I guess the evolved form, Clauncher. Huh. I forgot that I got this from a, uh, a raid. I was like, oh, terrestrializing. I'll power up my Mega Drain. No. It did not. Shucks, I let old man Kofu down. But I did give you a lot of prize money, so that is probably for the best. Dang it, that backfired. Now my wallet's empty too. You didn't have to give me $40 for winning. Just saying. Hey, I sit right up and tell me, what's all the ruckus about over here? Oh, old man Kofu, seems this kid's got something to say to you. What's that now? A customer here for old little old walletless moneyless me? What kin do I owe ya? Oh for ya. What kin do What can I do for ya? What kin okay. What can? What kin? Okay. I have your wallet. I stole it. Volta Velzula, my wallet. Say what now? My lobby server sent you out here to bring it to me. Ha 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 That's a huge help. Thanks for coming all this way. Guess I should apologize to my little apprentice too. I hope he didn't bother you too much. There's something here at the Porto Marina, uh, Mira, the Marina da auction that we really want to get our hands on. So as you can imagine, we were both a bit worked up to find I forgot my wallet. Ladies and gentlemen, you won't want to miss this. Here comes today's last item. Hmm. Feast your eyes on the main event. I have here the legendary Wakame Seaweed of the Hoenn region. Ooh. Do I have any takers? Vault and Vilzula. I don't even have to touch it, and I can see it's got the springy texture of seaweed chock full of nutrients. I just look at it. Look at how it catches the light and shines so brilliantly. Oh, and that rich, fresh aroma of something plucked straight out of the ocean. I need to get me some of that. No, listen, kid. If you want to challenge me at the Cascarafa gym, you're going to need some smarts. And this is the perfect place to test you. Get the winning bit on that seaweed for this old man. Alright, I'll give it my best shot. Gahaha! <laughs> you already know the ins and outs of auctions at such a young age? Yeah, I have a gambling problem. You're something else, kid. Here you are, fighting funds for the auction. Be smart with it. And with this old man, that seaweed. Damn. I mean, it's easy. Just always bid one dollar more than the last person. Right? That's how bidding works. How much are you walking my seaweed? We'll start the bidding at 10,000. Bid 10. We're currently at 10,000. 15. Oh, shit. 25. Or 25. Do I hear more? 30. 40. You jerk. 45. I want to walk away out of here with a profit. That was amazing. You put those grown up bidders to shame with your bidding skills. Thank you for winning that seaweed for old man. I'll be taking that. Uh, I'll be taking it now if you don't mind. I mean, maybe I want to keep them, just saying. This seaweed's a great catch. I'd be feeling low as seabed. If I'd fail to get my hands on it. I got it for 40 and profited 10k. What? I guess maybe I shouldn't have done the first bid. That's probably, that's probably where I fucked up. 
If there's any of that money I gave you left, feel free to keep it as a tip. You can even use it to try your hand at the auction again if you like. Alrighty, I'm gonna head back to the Kaskarafa. Kaskarafa, yeah. Gym now. Oh man, Kofu is gonna prepare a real good battle for you. You spelled, you spelled real wrong. See you there. I did it. Yay. Yay. I guess we're going to do this gym. Actually, since I evolved Leggies, doesn't that mean Leggies might be able to learn new moves from remembering? Uh, it doesn't seem like it. Never mind. We got a grass round 30, you're chilling? I kind of figured. And on top of that, I got a uh, mini zap, so. Thanks, Nintendo. When did you last save? I'm not entirely sure. It might have been a little while. I don't have autosave on Fig Leaf. I don't like keeping it on for Pokemon. We're not that far behind. Um, oh, but I need to need to evolve mass shift still. Oh well, we're all good now. Stink bug in here, not stink bug, dung beetle. Move the dung beetle in here. Go back to our bag. So I should also probably level them up to like 30. Dual wing beat, perfect. Is that, that's a physical attack, god damn it. I mean, it's better than pluck, so sure. Let's learn dig. Is it better than mud shot? 
It's like a free turn, I guess, but I think I would rather just hit with mud shot twice. Okay, yeah, so it looks like I just have to do that fight again, and that'll be really quick. Because I dicked around a little bit. And now I can get that uh, 10,000 instead of 5,000, I guess. All part of the plan, right? And we can just throw leggies up front, so. Is that? That's a grimer. Okay, for some reason, I don't know why. I thought that was a ride on. Okay, so we can just skip all this dialogue now, so that's nice. Yeah, it could have been worse. I could have, like, you know, found a shiny and it could have, like, ended instead, so... <laughs> that would have sucked. For the energy. I think we can stay in for Clauncher. Yeah, just give me your money. Just give me the money. Why are you still moving at like four frames a second? I'm right here. Okay, it seems like it might be random.
Goodbye. Closer. Oh, I'm tired. Can we go? In case it explodes again. Oh, now I can go through water, though. Misty terrain. All right. Give me the secret cave. Oh. Ooh, what do we have here? <clears throat> Second one of these I found. This one's orange, though. Okay. Energy root. Nugget. The music here is just making me want to play Pokemon Coliseum. What's this shop? Can I get saddles for Koridon? No. I can get hats though. I don't really care about those. Okay, sandwich. Any way you want. Come on over. Every which sandwich. Okay. Ow. Hey, Sean. It's me. How's the gym journey? Which one are you on? Which one are you going for right now? Wait, seriously, I'm close by. Hang on, I'll come say hi. I'm kind of busy. I mean, I just okay. Hey, Sean. Or sorry. Hey, hey, there you are. Oh, I said, I said, Sean. <laughs> Look at you with two gym badges already. Awesome. And this gym is you chose to be number three, huh? Well, you're up to the challenge for sure. But like, just to be safe, you probably better have a pre-gym warm-up battle with me. Yeah, sure. Yeah, there is that enthusiasm. Now let's go. Are we allowed to battle in here? Oh, no, we're gonna go outside and do it. Alright. Alright. Yeah, okay. Excuse me. Before you take it on Jim. It's good to see if you can find the battle court in town and check it out. You have to see where the court is, what it's made of, stuff like that. Those things might affect how the battle goes. I wish. You know, Sean, one look in your face and it's obvious you're getting even stronger. I think it's time I start introducing you to some of my harder hitters. Alright, ready? As I'll ever be. Let's have a fruitful battle. You will challenge my Pokemon trainer, Nimona. Sent out Rock Rough. 
Hell yeah. You get to deal with my leggies. I think this is a practice run for your next gym battle. Come at me with everything you've got. You are going to regret that. Oh god, level 21. You poor thing. Oh, nice moves. Your skills are ripening. Sure are ripening. I don't know if my skills can get that much more ripe. Maybe a little. Pommy? No, we've got a ground type. Gato. Oh. Don't pat yourself on the back just yet. My next Pokemon is going to turn the tables. So is that the yo-yo that's like pinned to its not scarf? I should have switched to uh, Peps. Honestly. Since you have a Terra Orb too, we can both terrestrialize our Pokemon fair and square. I mean, you're welcome to. Oh, I'm so glad you terrestrialized into a, uh, you know, a grass type to use bite. <laughs> I mean, had she used a grass move on my, uh, leggies, it would have been neutral just like bite would. But if you want to play this game, let's try out that new move of yours. Use magical leaf floor, Gato. Oh, there's the yo-yo. Okay. Goodbye. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> yep. Your skills are ripening quick. I think she's upset. Man, you sure battle like someone with more than two gym badges. Well, that was a great battle. Fruitful for sure. Here, take these as thanks. Okay. I challenge you again literally right now, but champions have to be understanding. So I'll hang back and respect your time. Keep on collecting badges for now, and let's battle next time we run into each other at a gym. And Sean? I'll never fucking lose to you again. I hope you get even stronger. Like, way, way, way stronger. And once you do, you and me can just battle our hearts out. Alright, time for you to whoop that gym test. Thanks for this. I already did the gym test. I just have to do the battle now. She definitely has a crush on us, right? Even though we're probably like three or four years her junior. <laughs> Alright, looks like we're all set. So. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. It really seems like it. Sean, I heard you reunited Kofu with his wallets. I can't thank you enough. Though this is a little irregular, please consider your gym test passed. What's the gym test normally? Are you ready to challenge gym leader Kofu, the surging chef? Yeah. Very well. Allow me to show you to the battle court. So, Hitman, is this like your favorite gym leader? Do you want to cosplay them? I feel like you should. Nah, I think she is like a year ahead because she's in your homeroom. That's true. Unless homerooms are just kind of like more malleable elsewhere 
Honestly, kinda. <laughs> Can't say I'm surprised. Cosplay when, my dude? Cosplay when? Oh man, Kofu, play with us, come on! I'd be honored. But if you would try a new item from restaurant's menu as well. Oh no, sorry, that was someone else. Sorry everybody, I got some business to take care of as a gym leader real quick like. I have a few I want to do now. Yeah, but this guy is like up your alley. He's into Pokemon. He's a chef. He's got two sets of eyebrows. Like, he's got it all. Three if you count the beard. <laughs> I'm keeping someone waiting, you see. Please forgive me. I need to do this first. Okay. And I'll cosplay uh, Mela, and everyone will hate me for it. Hey, uh, step right up. I've been waiting for you. Thanks for the help over at Porto Marinana. You did a mighty fine job. Dude, only thing is missing is uh, Scovillain. But no, he's a water type. Well, here's the thing. He, he's specialized in water types, but he probably has a Scovillain somewhere to help with the cooking, right? And now I've got that legendary seaweed, I can make some real quality dishes with it. But don't expect me to go easy on you in our battle here. I mean, like, Brock is a rock specialist, but he caught, you know, Zubat, and he got a, uh, um, nine, not nine tails, uh, Vulpix eventually, so. Gym leaders can have other Pokemon. They just probably can't use them in the gym fight officially. At the auction, we battle with buying and selling. At my gym, we battle in a more traditional sense with sticks. Crow Gunk, Crow Gunk too, yeah. Moves and tactics ever changing as a raging sea. I'm gonna serve you a full course of water type Pokemon. Don't try to eat them though. I'm saving them for later. Got my gym leader, Kofu. And his... Oh. It's that Pokemon I passed on. I feel a bit indebted to you, but don't expect me to go easy on you just because of that. So I have to imagine this is probably a water steel type. Um, so we're going to try Mudshot first. Luck. Ooh. That Pokemon is kind of cool. I like it. it it's a it's a good looking Pokemon. If I didn't already have an idea of what I want for my water type, I'd probably uh probably pick that up, honestly. Oh, I forgot to rename it. Uh oh, I also forgot to reteach it. Electro Ball. Aqua Cutter? Wait, they added another Cutter move? Interesting. I didn't see what it was sending out, but I actually didn't know you had a different or a new ability. Pokemon becomes charged when it's hit by a wind move, boosting the power of its next electric type move. Pokemon uses. And that just has compound eyes. That's pretty good. Wug Trio. That was the poke. I, I actually, I got semi-spoiled for this. I But it was my own fault. I had um, Neodoodle stream up. And I was lurking. And I think he was doing this gym fight. And that was there. And like, I had it at, I swear to God, I had it at 160p. And I still saw it. And I was like... That's the Wiglet evolution. Uh, oh well. You know what? Let's... Actually, I didn't mean to terrestrialize, though. But yeah, let's use Roost. I need a water type. I'm on the fence. Uh, use Clauncher. 
There you go. Look at my lights bulb. Yeah, see, me terrestrializing was just a uh, a ruse so I could use roost, and you know they wouldn't expect it. Gooey. Oh. Ew. Crabominable. Ugh. Yeah, uh, I didn't read it. Whatever. Prepare the ring for a big transformation. My Pokemon's gonna rock the boat. It's it's nice that they use Pokemon that aren't usually that type, but you would you would look at them and be like, should you be a water type? No, you you're like you're a crab, but you're not. But at the same time, it so does. It feels weird. I will also say the the bug trainer using a Teddy Ursa seems a little weird. Stereotyping is a good way to differentiate the Pokemon. Yeah. Oh god, Crab Hammer. Yeah, that was gonna hurt, no matter what I did. I think the Bug Trainer using a Teddy Arista was inspired. I mean, I don't know. I, with, with the Crab being a Water type, I get it. I don't understand how that makes sense, though. Um, I can send leggies back in and hopefully outspeed. Crabominal's pretty slow. Bugs make honey. Cause honey bugs make Yeah, I, I get it. I just, I don't know if I agree with it. If that makes sense. I'm still gonna be neutral. Oh lord. It's okay though, I think we won. Miss, it's like big claw deal, tentacruel head. Vault in Velzua! You're a lively one, aren't you? A little too lively, if I do say so myself. Gahaha! <laughs> a loss is refreshing as the air at the morning market. I'm just like a helpless little magic carp to you, eh? Flopping around all willy nilly. You got me good, I'll tell ya. What a great catch you are. Just like a master fisher, you held on tight till the last second and reeled in victory. Now it's time to hand over a gym badge to ya. Let's get a real good photo together using a pose I've been wanting to try out for a while now. Tell me it's a JoJo pose. Okay, not a JoJo pose, but that's a- that's good. That- that's good. With three gym badges in your possession, Pokemon up to level 35 will be easier to catch. And will listen to you when you ask her to do things. Amazing, right? Yeah. I'm gonna listen too as an extra special bonus. I'm sure you can make use of it. Chilling water. User attacks the target by sho showering it with water. So called, it saps the target's power. This also lowers the target's attack stat. Ooh, okay. Alrighty, it's about time to head back on to my restaurant and get prepping for the next wave. You'll go back to see me again now, you hear?
Pardon me, hello. You just simply the gym leader, yes? And your name is Sean, if I recall correctly? Tell me, do you seek to become a champion? No, I seek to become the champion. Just what I hope to hear. You have a rare talent, especially for your age. Aim high. Greater heights are within your reach. Oh, but I've gotten ahead of myself. I am Gita, chairwoman of the Pokemon League, the organization that runs these gyms. As you seem to be collecting gym badges, I suspect we'll meet again down the line. Until then, good day to you. Okay. How do you get your hair to do that? I'm gonna change its name while it's knocked out, and then it's gonna wake up, and I'm call it. I'm gonna call it uh, Mini Zappy, and it's gonna be like, "What the fuck are you talking about?" I did it again. Shit. You know what? Not stinky. Stinker. That's better. Uh, I also need to fix its move so don't I? Because I want to know Electro Ball or Spark. <sighs> I don't think you had anything I wanted you to remember. Okay. <laughs> oh, there's a sandstorm. Oh, also I'm in offline mode. I'm just gonna switch that to online now. Not that it matters too much. New classes. Oh, uh, you know what? We haven't actually done classes at all. What if we take a break from this, uh, gym business and, uh, check one of them out? Actually, I need to heal my Pokemon, so yeah, go, go there. Coming through. I will say that one thing Violet has over Scarlet is I, while I like Koridon's design a lot more, the fact that it has these wheels but refuses to use them to like roll, it, it bothers me. Master Sean, what class would you like to take? 
Um, biology. You like biology, Mr. Jacques? Yes. Yeah, such a design flaw. I agree. I agree. Like, it wouldn't make sense since it's the like the 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 past wizard. It wouldn't make sense to just have a wheel, like two wheels on it, that could move. But like, they could figure something out. Just have it carry around two big rocks. Conkleder does that already. And it doesn't even use them to roll with. Hello, hello. My name is Jacques, and I will be your Pokemon biology professor. In my class, we all learn the various quirks of our beloved Pokemon together. But then, uh, don't have those wheels. Well, I mean, you have like the big like stone wheels that it just carries around or something. And it uses those to roll. I don't know. We can figure it out. Maybe I'll come to love your Pokemon even more for the things you learn here. In today's class, I'll teach you a great way to get to know Pokemon more in depth. If you like to become better friends with your Pokemon, you can let them come out of the Pokeballs and walk along, so along with you. Sounds great, right? You use the R button to throw a Pokeball and let the Pokemon inside. I don't think you're watching your Pokemon run underfoot, if you ask me. Once you Pokemon out, try speaking to them. They're sure to respond in some way. It's great way to get to know them better. However, getting your Pokemon over its ball isn't such a great idea in some locations. Can anyone tell me where it is that you shouldn't have your Pokemon lo walk alongside you? Uh, near water, inside buildings, and tall grass. Inside buildings, I guess? That's right, great job, Sean. I see you did your homework. The correct answer is we should not walk with our Pokemon indoors. How about that? Some Pokemon might damage walls, desks, and other things walking around inside buildings, so... Something out regardless of the species. Yeah, for please don't let your Pokemon out of their Pokeballs while in outdoors. Okay, everyone? I think I see them out and about in classrooms from time to time, but still. Anyway, you may become even closer friends with your Pokemon pals by walking together. Oh, I almost forgot. Keep in mind that you can only walk together with your lead Pokemon. Remember to use a ZR to throw your ball and let out the Pokemon inside. You also want to remember that throwing a ball at a wild Pokemon will start a battle. It looks like that's all the time we have for today. See you all next class. Do we care if I actually read all of these? Do you get like rewards for doing all of them? Yeah, you know, let's, let's do biology two with Jacques, Monsieur Jacques. There's some info you need. What if I'm a Pokemon? I'm a Pokemon master already. I know all of it. Hello, hello. I hope everyone's ready to learn some new things today. And yes, you do. You have you have exams. Oh. Do I try using zero to let your Pokemon out as I taught you in the last class? Oh, my Pokemon. That's the unique and cute they are. I'm oh, sorry, I'm making picnics when you want to spend some quality time together with your Pokemon in a party. You can get them all around the table, making sandwiches and play. It's really a lot of fun. What's all the more about making food, Mister? Sarga Saguaro's class. Saguaro's class is the best place to go. Now, sometimes while you're enjoying a picnic with your Pokemon, you may find something very, very important in the basket next to your table. It's very important in something is what Pokemon are born from. Let's all say it together. Pokeballs! Now we catch them, but you fucking idiot. Woo! You all got it right. A very important something I'm talking about is a Pokemon egg. It's not clear where these eggs come from, but they're probably placed in the basket rather stealthy by the Pokemon at the picnic. Walking around with an egg, it will help warm it, which allows it to hatch. Eggs won't warm up by sitting in boxes, though. You need to have them in your party. And here's one more super important thing I like remember about eggs. Pokemon trust their eggs, uh, us with their eggs because they believe in us. So I'm sure I'd be happy to see you all be responsible parents with your little Pokemon eggs. Whoops, most important points came right as the bell rang. So all next time, I guess. Yeah, I'm not gonna do any more lessons. Not right now. I thought they would give me like immediate rewards.
Actually, speaking of immediate rewards... Nope, nothing. Now nah, you can do them off stream? Okay. But you do get easy rewards, so it's nice to get. Okay. I just It's going to be a lot of getting talked at. And... Uh, I mean, we might miss some, like, personalities of people, but... I feel like I should be making more progress in the story while streaming, since that's kind of why we're here. Cortando Gym. Stony Cliff Titan. Wait. Was that the Stony Cliff Titan? What? Whatever. Whatever. I don't care. I don't give a damn. Hmm. I wish they gave you like a general level idea. Like don't go here until you're like this level. Do I wanna go yeah, you know what? Let's Let's go towards the electric gym, shall we? And while we're here, we'll, I guess check that. And this gimme ghoul. Give me the goods, gimme ghoul. I don't know what that is. Who wants in? So I need water, I need rock, or I need ground. And we'll just send him pups. Wait for me, I need a minute. Oh, fine. Yeah, kind of what I looked only for kind of ish path. But I'm still making it as I go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone else wants in for this thing, oh, let me know. I also need to pee again. So I'll do that at, you know what? I'll do that while the countdown's going. You're good? Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna hit it already. Put that aside. Hitman, hop in. Anyone else who wants to hop in, feel free. And then we'll just uh, do it when I get back.
Shit, I didn't want you to see that fuck. Well, that's why I stepped away in case you were using something uh, that I didn't want to see, but I, I guess... I guess Primeape has an evolution, huh? Alright, let's get it over with. Oh, it's just, uh, Tink-a-Tink. I got spoiled for nothing. No, I locked it before I switched, and I couldn't back out. I can see that. I guess take a tough <clears throat> evolve, so I didn't need a third one of this anyway. Sorry, it's fine. It's, I mean, I've been getting spoiled for stuff anyway, so at this point, it's like it's just gonna keep happening the more I play. If I if I truly didn't want to get spoiled, I wouldn't be playing with anybody. I wouldn't be streaming it. I just I still want people to try to be courteous and like not spoil stuff for me though, but. It's just gonna happen. All right, we got a tank a tank. I thought I was holding like some sort of bell, not that it was like uh, the Pokemon with like the metal club. That's fucking cool. I didn't need that. Ah, okay. Well, there, there you go, then. Oh, a tomato and a grappa. Give me that. that that Taurus really came at me huh how do I get off the ladder I'll take that rare candy and your life. Um. So I found another glitch. <laughs> I'm kind. I'm kind of in the way. <laughs> um. No, don't attack it, Leggies. It's just an innocent gimme ghoul. Oh, I might, I might actually kill it, huh? The Pokeball is pointed the wrong way now because of it. And my fire alarm's going off.
Give me gold. There we go. I'll take you. I'll definitely take you. Ooh, Tailwind. Excuse. Excuse. You know what? I think you need a drink anyway, so why don't you go ahead and do that? Fine. Just leave then. Leave me alone! I have not caught a Litleo yet, I don't think. I probably should. Ooh, what we got down here? Oh, uh, ooh, okay. A terrestrialized Toxapex. It's a normal type. Honestly, not even worth it, but I do need a Toxapex in general, so... I guess we'll try to catch it. Limp, oh, god damn it. Fuck. Oh, I did like no damage to it. Uh, maybe I should just leave and worry about this when I have a higher level Pokemon. You have a good, good day, Toxpex. I see you, Dolphin. East Paldean Sea. Oh, I go over here. Marini, the Gyarados with some, hanging out with some dolphins. I found some vinegar. Keep racing around here. I will get one of those dolphins eventually. I might check to see if I can get it. Like now-ish. Hyper beam. Ooh, calcium. No, that's no, it's mine. Stay away from me. It's my TM. Uh, um, hmm. I should probably just swap. Send out paps. Burn it. Just spamming roost. It's one. It's one of those Pokemon. Ugh. Blech. I'm doing more damage than I can heal, though. So. one of the little ones. Aw, it's cute. Hold on. I know you're a water type, but I need that yawn, so... It's too bad dolphins are vicious. Ah. 
Got it. Finizen. It likes playing with others of its kind using the water ring on its tail. It uses ultrasonic waves to sense the emotions of other living creatures. That's not how sound waves work. Why do you think that's how sound waves work? I also see another raid over there. I might, uh, might pop into that for a spell. It's my baby. Oh, it's a weasel. Okay. I mean, it's cute. I just, you know, I can't look at it and think anything other than dolphins or monsters. Oh, five. Oh, and do we have, like, leaf pledge or grass pledge over here? Wow, who would have seen it coming? Is this an item to enhance all the pledge moves? Nope, it's a protein. Okay. Could have at least been the thing to increase special attack instead of attack. But it's in his baby. It is baby. Honestly, it looks like uh, like a Neopet to me. That's a great ball. Ah, it's a Shellos. Oh, we got... It's probably a normal one, it looks like. Maybe Steel. It's normal. Who wants to... No. I don't want a normal Magikarp. I don't want a normal Magikarp. I don't want a normal Gyarados. I'm going to try something, though. Uh, maybe I can do it to this tree. Oh, a tomato berry. Supposedly, if I run into trees full sprint, Pokemon will sometimes pop out of them. Maybe these trees are too big. You mean you don't want Magikarp tackle, so I stab? You know what? You got me there. I should I should probably get it just in just in case. Actually, part of me was thinking like, but what if like terrestrialized Giga Impact? But uh, you can do that with any fully evolved normal type Pokemon or terrestrialized normal Pokemon. You know what I mean? Tomato. All right, this is like what poison? Maybe psychic? No, it's a rookie D. It is in fact a rookie D. Jesus fucking Christ. Leave me alone. Oh my god, Taurus! <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start killing you all. Fuck it. You want to step to me? Go for it. You won't step anywhere else. Uh, poison three-star young goose. I actually need young or not young goose. Uh, gum shoes. I still need gum shoes, so I'm gonna I'm gonna put this up, and if anyone wants to join in, feel free to. Me? Just give me a sec. I'm in a cutscene. Yup. Okay. If you're in a cutscene, I'll cancel it. We'll give Fig Leaf a minute, and then when Fig Leaf says he's ready, I'll uh, I'll start it again.
And then after I finish streaming today, I get to go organize all my boxes. Again. And try evolving more shit. Uh, I may or may not do more tomorrow. It all kind of depends on how I'm feeling, if I'm being honest. I think my dinner's ready, too. Alright, it looks like Fig Leaf's, uh... Yeah. I I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go grab my food, because it looks like my food might be ready, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back. Fig Leaf, I don't trust Arvin. Fig Leaf after the cutscene with the doggo. It feels so bad now. I mean, to be fair, I didn't trust him either, so. Okay, Fig Leaf, if you're still there, let me know if you're good. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I went downstairs to get my dinner. My parents are watching Clue, the movie. Yeah? Awesome. Um, if you don't know, Clue is an old movie. Uh, and it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. It's so funny. Please watch it if you can. Oh, it's got Tim Curry in it. If that, uh, if that appeases anybody, so... Okay. Yeah. 
Is it the movie where a different theater show a different ending? Yes, it is. Yeah, there's three different endings for the movie. If you watch the DVD, you can actually set it to show one of the three endings, ra endings randomly. Or you can set it to show all three of them. It's really good. Hitman, get in here. There we go. That's such a cool concept. Right, like imagine you went to go see it and your friends went to go see it like a different, uh, like a different day or a different theater. And like you came back and you were like arguing over who actually like watched the right movie. <laughs> All right, um, pause. I don't know if you would want it on this, but uh, if not, I might just start. So. No, oh, that's didn't ha that didn't happen. Yeah. What do you mean this person was a killer? It was this person. Did you even watch the same movie? I'm good, but thank you. Okay. It is a level three though. Although you're probably fighting level fives at this point, if that's a thing. Maybe even six, for all I know. Right. Poison. Uh, we'll just do headbutt then. Wait, no, I have... I have Zen headbutt. You only have two badges, how? Is it school work? Catching them all? Oh, okay. I go for I'm about to go get my fifth. I made sure to finish on my score back Thursday. Good. Taking a side trip to a Dratini outbreak after this. Oh, okay. Get you a shiny, Hitman. Want? Do you mean, oh, I will? You're just gonna have all pseudo legendaries on your team by the end of, uh... Huh. We got poison terror shards from this as well. <laughs> mm. 
No. No what? Did you not catch it? Only two. No. Oh. oh no. Uh, pseudo legendaries. Gotcha. Booked. All right. Already. 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 What do we got here? I can't even. It's a it's a flow at. Okay. Go to sleep. Flower veil. Well, shit. Joke's on you. You're not even touching the ground. I don't want to kill it. And I don't have to. Also, look at the little Teddy Ursa in the background just minding his own business. So there is a Pokemon I want to catch that I did kind of get spoiled on. Just a little though. It was like I kind of got spoiled and then I went and spoiled myself entirely. See how that happened. <clears throat> I see you there. Doesn't seem like it's gonna be over here, though. It's a little further back where we were. Protein will be good for it. Some palmies. You know, I've seen a couple Venonauts, but not Venomoth yet. We also got Murkrow. It seems like this hill, in particular, might be pretty good for getting those stat-lowering berries. And I guess a polka doll too. Sword power. Yeah, tomato and koala. Ah, there's my little tentacle boy. Toad's cool. Mm -hmm. 
maybe if I make a s ooh, a sandwich. Uh oh, there's another item here. Another tomato. Okay. Maybe if I make another sandwich. Oh my god, just take me off the wild the ride Pokemon then. As long as my feet are touching the ground, who cares? Okay, it seems like I can't actually make the thing that I need. I, I need the, um, pack up and go, please. I need to be able to encounter water Pokemon, I believe. Maybe if I go buy a sandwich in town. Another raid too. Could check what that is. Seems to be a normal type though. Maybe steel. Yeah, normal pine co. Mm, I feel like I can wait on that. Um, there's an item over here. There's two items. There's a palm egg. And a super potion. Let's see if there's anything over here, too. Uh, there's more Squawkabilly. These ones are green. I think they're meant to have different colors, though. Not like it. They're all five of them are shiny or something. Unless they are. Oh my goodness! Magnemite, you look so good. Oh my god. Yeah, she looks great. It really does. I accidentally ran into a Rotom. We can grab that too.
Hmm. These are balls be super effective, so let's go for lick. Did I kill it? Oh well. Oh, we're all good. Okay. Let me try another ball since it's probably about to wake up. Hello. Please heal my Pokemon. I am desperate. Dinner's done. Let's see, I'd like to buy. Hmm. <clears throat> Still no Ultra Balls, but I can get Nest and Repeat and Heal. You know what? I probably should have saved that for after the gym. Oh, excuse me, gym though. Oh well. I don't. Oh, extra small candy. I already passed that at this point. There's a TM over here. Surf. Okay. Another Tailwind TM. If I get something with Prankster, that'll be pretty good. Very futuristic city. I think I just saw Quaxi's at least uh, first evolution, if not the second. Ah, the gym is right there. Wise glasses. Okay. Boost the power of special moves a little bit. X accuracy. All right, leggies. Are you ready? You're gonna be the main event here. Not only do you resist electric attacks, you also are immune to them. That's a double threat. Struggle bug. Okay. Oh, there's another item. Dire hit. Okay. <clears throat> wow, everyone's here right now. I forget what voice I gave you. Um, so I caught the Dratini not shiny below 50. What the shit, dude? Two rare candies and you have a Dragonite? Are you serious? Wow. Well, no, shot. 
You appear to be progressing well in your gym curriculum. What is this now? Is that is this that kid I've been hearing so much about? Hey kiddo, I heard you're like way too good at battling, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, but he won't listen to me? Oh. Well, isn't that just for um trade Pokemon? I mean he won't listen to you now, so why don't you just test it out? Nah, <laughs> you got some spirit, big shot. Now levels for gym badges matter. Are you sure? This young lady would be Rika. Oh. I'm not changing her voice. As young lady would be Rika. That's me. Rika here at your service. And hey, I know I'm pretty, but no need to get intimidated or anything. Yeah, I've had an issue earlier. I was way over level. Ah, uh, okay. She is a little far farcical. Farcical? Shall we say? But like myself, she's a member of the Elite Four. What? I wasn't trying to be funny. Anyway, hmm. Oh, you matter if it's a new catch? If it's an older Pokemon you caught that you race at level, it'll listen to you? Oh, okay. Tell you something, kiddo. You look fun. Like, interesting. At a glance, anyway. Naturally, he is one of our Academy's esteemed students. Oh, haha. <laughs> That checks out. But the battles you face at these gyms really ratchet up the farther you go. Indeed, you have a trainer abandons the challenge at roughly this very point. But not you, right, kiddo? See, when you hit the champion assessment, you show these gyms what you got. Best of fortunes to you. It's nice you get to see the Elite Four members before the Elite Four. <laughs> you don't always get that. Welcome to the Levincia Gym. Levincia. Levincia. Let me say just you're the challenger. Your name is Sean, yes? Great. Now, in order to face a gym leader, Iano. Ion, yeah, it would be like uh, Ion, Iano. You're first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Levincia Gym, that means starring in one of Iano's streams. I think I can do that. I was a streamer as well as a gym leader, so we want you to dazzle the audience with your skills and rack up those subscriptions. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet. Maybe with Twitch Prime. Or Prime Gaming, rather. You get you get a free Twitch sub every month if you have Amazon Prime. Just saying. Head, uh, just head outside and you'll soon find out what you need to do. Now get out there and have fun. Also, if you're watching the VOD later... You subscribe on YouTube. That one's free. <laughs> so does that mean you have to catch the Pokemon below the level? At the time, so... That's how it's done. Yeah, Hitman's got it. <laughs> wow, thank you, Hitman. I appreciate you gifting a sub to Ryan. I really do. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, someone had to do it for the joke, right? To make it actually, you know, not sad for me. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Iano Zone. Had to be done. Yeah, exactly. Wait. <laughs> okay, that's a fun transition. Hey, hey, hey! Your eyeballs are mine! Caught in my electro web! Who's a what's it? Uh, who's a what's it? I don't know, I'm the gym leader here! Hello, hello, hola, hola! Ciao and bonjour! 
We got we got a hyper up, right? Oh snap! Look at you! Already a master of Ionese! I on yeah, I on on ease. Um that's your first radio, eh then? Not a then a uh, Viano, she's pretty fun. And uh, I hope this doesn't come as too much of a surprise, but you're being broadcast live to the world right now. Smile! Anywho, Challenger, thanks for coming out to the Lavincia Gym to see me. Yeah, you got it. I'm super happy you're here because I'm also a bit of a celeb, you know? I'm all kinds of busy. So I can't collab with you unless I know you can bring those sweet, sweet viewer number- Yeah, I mean, I gotta make sure you can bring some real passion to my stream. No! Okay. And so, if you want to battle me, you're gonna have to help me make this live stream a viral hit first. Got it? I'll do my best. I don't think I've ever gotten to be a viral hit before, though. I can tell you just can't wait to get started. Well, uh, well then, allow me to explain the plan. Come on out, Mr. Walksabout. Um. Oh, Jean, what a coincidence meeting you here. Say what? Do you guys know each other or something? I love how she, like, vibrates when she, like, doesn't know what's going on. This here dude had a real aura about him when he was walking down the street, so I snatched him up from my dealio here. You are uh, too kind. <laughs> well, anywho, Sean, since you're today's challenger, I'm gonna have you play hide and seek with Mr. Walks about here. Look for the good gentleman using the street surveillance cameras. Find him three times, and you can consider this gym test passed. Gotta fight a cosplay anyone. I wanna be her. Do it, pause. Do it right now. We need a better name for this challenge, though. I'll call it... Actually, because Hitman... I want Hitman to cosplay Kofu. So that'd be perfect. Where in the Vincia is Mr. Walks about? Quite the astute name. You think that title's safe? There's nothing iffy about it or anything, right? Eh, whatevs. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to go. Get ready to hide, Mr. Walks About. I feel that I owe the Pokemon League for many a past favor, so I'm more than happy to help. Do bear with me as I try my best to in my allocated role. I don't feel so good. Oh no, Lady Tuesday, I'm sorry. I didn't feel good today either. Mayhap our dapper gentleman is ready. Hey, Mr. Walks about. You good to go? Yes, I am. Also, welcome in Lady Tuesday. How are you? Besides not feeling good. Yo, ho. ready he be. Mr. Walks about is hiding somewhere in this video feed, friendo. Open those eyes wide like a magma and get to searching. Ready or not? Here, our challenger comes. I already see him. I found boosted and sleepy. Hmm. Found him. <laughs> oh dear, it seems you found me. Ah, uh, that'll do it. Yeah. What? By Valent boosted? Do you mean you got your COVID booster and like flu booster today? Because that would definitely do it. Where's Waldo? Uh, I've I've played Where's Waldo that are way harder. Congrats on getting your booster though. Yeah. Indeedly do it will. Just a bivalent COVID. What is bivalent? Is that just like the latest one? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I can't spell. Okay. Our challengers found Mr. Walks about. Wowza, you did it! You're one cool kid! Imagine getting invited to, like, my stream, and I'm just like, let's play Where's Waldo, where there's five people in the picture. You'd probably slap me. Well then, before we move on to the next round, let's make things a bit more interesting. 
You get to have a battle with one of my fans. Get out here, you silly Pokemaniac. Oh. Well, where's Waldo? Yeah, it targets two specific strands. Oh. It makes me sad that you can't change the outfit. You can accessorize it, but you're right. You can't, like, change... You So, there's four different uniforms you can wear. And I'll show you how after I do all that. If you press... Tell Jerry to press left on the D-pad, and he'll see. You can check there. The Auto Hype Squad is here! Long live the Iono Zone! Uh, okay. He showed me. I was like, lame. Dressing up in X was great. I do agree. To be fair, though, with X, they planned on having that be a one-time feature. But everyone loved it so much, they were like, well, now we can't get rid of it. Hopefully in, like, whatever DLC we're getting, or maybe even the post-game, we'll get, like, way more dress-up options. Because I do agree. I wish there were more options for us to dress up in. Reggie's wants to learn Seed Bomb. But Seed Bomb is a, a, a physical attack. Mega Drain is special. I'm just gonna hold out for, um... I'm just gonna hold out. You know what I think I might do? I've, since I'm gonna play through this whole game, obviously, to death. If I ever want to come back and revisit this game, I might have a playthrough where I only catch, like, a few Pokemon, and I have them learn their own moves. Like, cause when whenever they want to learn a move, there there's an option for them to pick the move they want to get rid of. I think that might be a fun challenge. Bro, Dragon Tear Lechonk. Oh, oh, ter oh, Dragon Terra Lechonk. I'm I'm good without. I don't I don't need a Dragon Pig. I mean I do, but like I need one that's like a Dragon type pig. Win or lose, I got a hype squad forever. Uh huh. And you win! Well done, challenger friendo! Time for a change of scenery. <clears throat> Here we go! The next stage of my totally rad test! Everybody loves it! It's the Pokemon Center! I already see him. <laughs> Mr. Waxabout is once again hiding in the feed somewhere! It's panic! Ah! Find him quick! Oh, and here I thought I had blended into my surroundings quite well. It's it's the it's the jacket. It kinda sticks out. Mr. Walksabout's been found once again. Yes, I knew you were something special. Let's spice the things up uh, again before moving on to ye old next round. That's right, it's another Pokemon battle. Get out of here, Pokemaniac pal. Miss Anna's watching! I can't lose! Like so, like Scoob. That actually does levitate. Yeah, like this is the uh, deal where Waldo throws back out and people who remember that remembers. It's like to find Waldo. I didn't even do too many find Waldos when I was young. I think I had like one, maybe two I Spy books and that was it. <laughs> oh, it got really hard. I loved I Spy. It was good. Well, you know what I haven't lost in you? My devotion to Miss Sayano. Okay. I, I feel like One Punch Man just over here like, okay. And you win. Well done, challenger friendo. There's no stopping you. Master of seeking and master of battle and you're the real deal. 
Oh, hey then. I dropped my spoon. Let me get this out of my way. I need a vacuum anyway. Time for a change of scenery. Every time she says that, I think of like Pete from Kingdom Hearts 2, where you're doing his boss fight in Timeless River. And he's just like, how oh, about a change of scenery? And then he like zoops and then like the, the screen changes. The last stage will be this place right here. The battle court where battles are a raging. Can you find out? Uh, our Mr. Waxman among these randos. Let's find out. Ready? Go! Um. Yes. My, my. Admirably done. I hope you'll find your treasure in your independent study with just as much ease. Whoa, my subscriber numbers are on the rise like a super fast Electros crawling out of the ocean. Uh, I mean, congratulations on passing my gym test. Hot diggity dang. What a good time, huh? You had people on the edge of their seats worldwide. We're not, how are we staring at each other? Am I being told to like look down into the corner? Okay. I bet I could have some super rad streams by collabing with you, Sean. I mean, I don't know if, you know, if you ever wanted to, you know, come on stream and like do an actual collab, you just gotta let me know. You know, just hit, just hit me up. My DMs are always open for you. So, hey, when you're ready, just hit up my lobby staff. They'll get you all set up to collab with me lickety split. I'll be ready whenever, ready to go when Evs. This is funny. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Uh, Tuesday, have you decided to like just not play this Pokemon gen? I think I think we talked about this, but I'm not sure. Yeah, okay. That's fair. Did you already look at all the spoilers and see all the new Pokemon? I haven't, so no spoilers for me, please. I'm just curious if you did. I say Arnold gave you a performance of thumbs up. Amazing job, Sean. Well done on clearing the gym test. Now you've earned the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Oris bored me to tears. I didn't even finish the demo of Moon. Now I'll just see him when Jerry plays. Okay. I, I will say, Sarah. I will say. Uh, this game is way more like Breath of the Wild than like Sword and Shield was. Lots of running around, finding little things. It's not just uh, like eight gyms and you're done. It, there's eight gyms, there's five Titan battles, there's five uh, evil leaders to take down. There's a lot of stuff to do around a massive like open world, so. I would say maybe when Jerry's not playing and you get a free moment, maybe give it a shot. Or maybe just pull the controller from him for a bit. You know, you can do that too. All right, uh, uh, to challenge gym leader Ayano, a supercharged streamer. Allow me to show you to our battle court. And I don't know. I'm just, I'm just saying, try it. I'm just saying, try it. That's all. I'm enjoying watching. All right. I mean, that's fine too. Like Sword and Shield and Arceus and more side quests is great. I still need to play Age of Calamity. Yeah, but that's a different game. That's not, you know, an open world thing. That's just a, a Musou game, so. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Are you ready? Transformation Central. Your eyeballs are mine, caught in my electro web. Who, so what's it? Eno! Also, Flamingo, Flamigo, and even autocorrect. I was saying, like, it's it's like the worst name for a Pokemon because they literally just dropped a letter. It's so dumb. But I do, I do like the Pokemon. I, like, even when I saw it on stream yesterday, I was like, this is literally just a Flamingo with a knot at the base of its neck, and that's it. It doesn't even evolve. 
Hello, hello, hola, ciao, and bonjour. It's time for the Eno Zone, everybody. I like her shark teeth. They remind me of Denji. Today's challenger is flying high like a watch roll. It's Sean. Yay. Ugh. Oh, my camera got really... Okay. Don't we normally battle across from each other? I hate it. I don't hate it. It's just... It's lazy. Is all. How are you feeling about this battle, Sean? I'm ready to do my best. Like, I can't lose. I'm honestly a little worried. Like, I can't lose. <laughs> hey, hey! I got a lively one here. You make a gnarly influencer, friendo. Thanks. Alrighty then, who's ready to see me kick some butt? Looks like you're all getting hyped. Ah, uh, thank you much, the Electro King. Am I the Electro King? Let's get the show on the road. How strong is our challenger? I don't know. Let's find out together. I mean, you saw how tough I was. I battled like two people for you. She can't even hold her Pokeball. She's I'm bouncing it like right, right here. That already puts a issue in my plan. Give me a battle that electrify all my viewers, pal. Yeah, I don't have any rock moves, and you know what? Oh, but I can't. You can't paralyze an electric Pokemon. Shit. I do have an, uh, a rock move, but it's rollout, and it's on my bug type. Um, I would have sent an Amy Rose. Sarah, have you seen this Pokemon yet? Draining kiss. Yes, it was in a raid. I love it. Okay. So there's a dolphin. There's also a dolphin too. That looks kind of like a Neopet, if you ask me. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Next playthrough, I'm using that. Yeah, I. I like I said, I saw it on Ryan's team, and I was like, you know, I've never really used fairy types that much. And this is fairy steel. That's a good combination, so. Uh, the dolphin is Finizen, I think. F-I-N-I-Z-E-N. We got Belly Bolt coming out. We can send in leggies for that. I, like, I love its design. I just wish they made the eye things on its, its head, its actual eyes. That's the only part about it I don't like. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> it reminds me of the Lisa Frank Dolphins. <laughs> oh, you're not wrong. You know, I've also noticed that Gym leaders in this game don't tend to heal their Pokemon. <laughs> Luxio? Hmm, I'll stay. This Magius, really? Yeah, I'm gonna have to switch. 
Gonna send him peps. Oh no, this is good, loyal fans. I need you to hear you cheering. Give me all you got. Oh, they actually address the fact that it's cheering. You better not have thunder. If it just started raining and you have thunder, I'm gonna be mad. Come forth, shiny little light bulb. I'm not done yet. I own no power. Go! Where was she keeping that? It wasn't a pocket there. I was gonna say, but Miss Maz just already has a hat. Oh, but if it's raining, it's gonna depower my flamethrower. Fuck. Her hair? Oh, fair enough. That still did a lot of damage. Used Hex? Does Hex do extra damage on... No, I guess it doesn't do extra damage on Confuse. Just the more volatile statuses. Ow. Yeah, I found a Terror type Growlithe and I'm using it uh, him with Earthquake is not okay. Wait, the Growlithe is Terra type to be ground? Is that what you're saying? Ground type? Okay. Okay, Peps, I need you to do me a big favor right now and evolve because I want to see what you become. You're as flashy and bright as a 10 million volt thunderbolt, friendo. Uh, it's actually seeing stars, but they're, they're two magnemites. That's funny. Our challenger came out victorious. Well done, Sean. I hate to say it, but I lost. Thanks for cheering me on, anywho, my loyal fans. Well then, what does our challenger get for beating me? The lead means streaming queen. I want your channel. Give me your channel, I'm rebranding it. I'll tell you, Sean, you win. A gym badge. Woohoo. Who would have seen it coming? Screen cap this quick. This will be a shot you'll want to save in your brain spaces forever. Is that what she's doing uh, underneath her thing the whole the whole time? Okay. By the byzies, with gym, four gym badges, Poke Pals have up to level four to be easier to catch. They'll listen to you when you ask them to do stuff too. And as my thanks for such a sweet pick, I'm gonna give you a TM. Why did we have to spout out like that? Volt switch. That's a good one. I might actually teach that to something. If any of you found your electrifying battle to be shocking, go smash that subscribe button. You heard her. Your eyeballs are mine. Caught in my electro web. Who's a what's it? Eno, the supercharged streamer. Catch you later. Okay. <laughs> that was an ordeal. And not the battle thing, I mean. Oh, Sean. Hola. Caught you just as you finished up in here, huh? Nice work. That puts you four badges in now, right? Man, that's awesome. 
I can't believe you're halfway through your gym journey already. Your efforts are bearing so much fruit so quickly. It makes me want to just challenge you to a battle right here, right now. But I'm going to have to wait. So I've put together my team of Pokemon specifically to take on the gym leader. Dang it. I just saw glowing fletching and I went, ooh, what a rare terror type does that have fire. It had fire. It evolves into fire. <laughs> I pause. I had the same thing happen, I'm pretty sure. But it didn't evolve into fire. It just, what? It was that Toxel. Right? I had like a Toxel raid. I think that like it was a poison type Toxel raid or something. When I battle you, I want to do it under the best possible conditions, which means this time I've got to ask for a rain check. Yeah, it's random Terra's. Yeah. God, this is the worst timing ever. Sorry, Sean. Forgive me. Forgive me. You were about to sign up to battle the gym. Where are you going? All right. Okay, I guess. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. I want to see what this thing becomes. And I don't want to wait anymore. Big peps. Big peps. Big peps. Big peps. Big peps. Oh my god. Why does it have a little bird? Skeledurge? Oh. It's a fire ghost type. Ooh. <laughs> that is better than I thought. So it's a it's a ghost pepper Pokemon. When did you get nine rare candy? Uh when I ran around hitting every single tiny little sparkly spot I could find. The egg on its head hatched. Oh, okay. Okay. Wait, I'm going online for a sec for you to a new Pokemon that's Poison Steel with a Dragon Terra type. Oh, I'm in for that. Um, it's playing on how some wild birds and alligators live together. Oh, I get it. Okay. Well, it's like the birds will just kind of chill on the alligator and the alligator knows it can't do anything about it. So it just kind of lives with it. Um, the fire bird changes shape when Skeledurge sings. Rumor has it that the bird was born when the fireball on Skeledurge's head gained a soul. Oh, I love this Pokemon. Torch song? Yes. The user blows out raging flames that are singing a song, scorching the target. It also boosts the user's special attack. Yes. Okay, raid. Hold on. I told you you'd love it. Yeah, you were right. I was afraid of the sombrero. That was it. I can't use the poker portal now. Hold on. I'm going to leave the gym and hopefully nothing's going to happen. But I can't use the poker portal right now. Maybe I have to be outside for it to work. The one first Springer Tito's final evo is 70 damage, the attack never misses, and always crits. So Springer Tito's just the uh the the fucking Cinderace of this gen. Alright, hold up. What the fuck where's the code? There's the code. Two V B Two X A. Yeah, that's pretty the beast. Yeah, I would say so. Oh, I've I've seen one of these around, just not here. Let me change my Pokemon. Like I saw I saw it in the the raid thing. Um, I'm also gonna select my Amy Rose. Plus, it has base 120 speed, so even with my Speed hindering nature, it's gonna outspeed ever. Holy shit! That's so good! What the fuck, Sprigatito? I mean, I'll be honest. Uh, I think a lot of the grass starters 
for a very long time, I would say, I've probably been pretty middling. Um, in terms of, like, just being good Pokemon. Not design-wise. We're not going to get into that discussion here, but... In terms of stats, like, Rillaboom was pretty good, I think. Because it had, like, a good, you know, hidden ability. But, uh, Sprigatito's Final Evo sounds good. It's hidden ability's protein- No, that's not fair. No. That's not fair. <laughs> no. I know. That's, oh, that's so ridiculous. Holy shit. I, I need eggs. I need eggs of these things, like now. So I can start evolving them on my own. And we're in. Oh, Ryan's back online. Go ahead and open up his stream. So yeah, you said I was gonna... Good, but mine's better. Yeah, well... I mean, I still had the best starter of Gen 8, Cinderace, so... Whatever. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Oh, is this the motor one? That I missed out on? I think it is. Yeah, it is. I saw one of these in the wild, and it ran away while I was fighting something. Didn't realize it was poison steel, though. It makes sense being an engine. Oh my god, it's still alive. Okay, it's dead. Uh, you know, which is a great ball. I gotta check the shop now, too. <laughs> Fucking always lands, always crits. That's so ridiculous. Varum. I'm here for Varum. Varum. It is said that this Pokemon was born when an unknown poison Pokemon entered and spirited an engine left at a scrap processing factory. Okay. Are you sure I've already caught one before? Caught a Varum? Oh my goodness. Um, I need to check... Pe Actually, we have to change Pepsi's nickname now. Because Peps is no longer just Peps. It's big, period, space, Peps, period. Big Peps. And let's see. We got to see if we can learn any good ghost moves now. Nope. So mine, it's, it's definitely a special attacker. Because, like, again, mine has a... Um, a special attack lowering nature, and yet it's still higher than its attack, so. Bib, fuck. <laughs> Mine is Lord Sprigus, that's, that's good. I can't scroll up for some reason. Um, buy another. Okay, there we go. Big, yes, big peps. Oh god, that's so good. Alright. Oh yeah, Skeledurge has 120 base special, I believe. That's a good special. It's got low speed, though. Wait. It can learn Sing now. 
But it already has yawn. Hmm. 110. Oh, that's not as good. I don't want to play with you anymore. Confuse Ray. I can learn Hex. I would need to teach it Will O Wisp too, just to really make that like worthwhile though. I was about to say, I think I might have picked up Shadow Ball, but now I'm thinking about it, it might have been Shadow Claw. over lick do I have a will o wisp tm it doesn't seem like it yeah okay that's all right for now Hex over Snarl. All right. All right. I'm gonna do one more check on TMs, but just like so generally look at what it can learn. Okay, for a second I thought I could go on Water Pledge, and I was like, wait, really? You can learn Thunder Fang, which is like good coverage, but you can learn Disarming Voice, never misses. Kind of looking for more Dark Moves, Flame Charge, Endure, and Shadow Claw, but no thank you. I gotta learn what this business about, uh, Singing crocodiles is no, don't I? Helping hand, yeah, no, that's fine. Uh, yeah, so if anyone has a Sprigatito they can trade me, or rather a Sprigatito egg, I would not mind, and I can I can give you a Fue Coco egg, so. And then same with, um, Quaxley, too. You want to give me the ditto and uh, I can? Sure, let me just go catch a nut. Well, I can, I can find another one eventually. <sighs> All right, uh, once you set up a trade, let me know. Actually, I gotta find a sandwich shop too. So you set that up while I go looking for food. Bring you some Kanto. Uh, raid power, catch power, encounter power. Ooh, here we go, this is what I want. Same as before, okay. Hold on, we're chowing down on a crepe. All right. 
Look at Portal. Link trade. Set code. One, two, three, four, six, nine, six, nine. <clears throat> Here's your ditto. I'm gonna have so much stuff to sort later. I think I already have all the Starlies I need, but yeah, well, that's fine. Wait, I gotta hit A on that screen. <sighs> Alright, I need to check the shop too, see if I can buy anything better than before. I'd really like to get some quick balls. I got other stuff for you if you want. I just don't want to spoil anything. Uh, we'll wait. We'll wait. I will say, if you know if there's any um, version exclusives that I don't have, that I it's just, I can't get, rather, um, you can trade those to me, no problem. You, I'd like to buy. Uh, I can buy luxury balls now. I gotcha. Thanks. Yeah, I can buy luxury balls, but still no ultra. So I guess buying all those great balls was fine. All right. Now let's go see if I can find another ditto. Actually, there's something else I want too, so. Kelpsy Berry. Another Kelpsy Berry. Hot and Berry. Yeah, all these berries will be useful whenever I find a shop or uh, unlock the items to Race Pokemon stats. So like proteins and calciums and all those. And I just want to like go ham on my Pokemon. Oh, there's the dolphin. Great ball. That's a nice boulder. East Province. Area one. Oh, just see something on the ground. Oh, and there's a dealing. Grab a berry. Problem is, you need so many. I think you need like 11 of each berry that you're going to use to like lower the stats down to zero. At least. Or not at least, at most. So that's good. Hmm. Tomato. Tomato Yoshi. The cycles are. There's a bunch of bulls bullying a pig. Yeah, if anyone, uh, oh shit, I was about to open up the map. Rookie D, what the hell? Oh, 
Let me check that again. If anyone needs those berries at lower stats, they're over here on the uh, south... What is that? East? Yeah, southeast-ish area. They'll be more useful, like, late slash post-game, probably, if you plan on doing, you know, tower stuff with your team. So... Though I feel like I haven't been battling that much in this game, weirdly enough. Especially since, like, you can just skip battles in this game. So I'm mostly just catching. It's a Murkrow. They give you the reward in if you battle in roots and find people at poker stops, you get rewards, mainly TMs. Right, but they don't force you to battle is my thing. So I just haven't been doing them. I might be too far away from their spawn now. Yeah, cause I'm seeing other Pokemon. Uh... Oh, there's an item I didn't get. There's an item I still didn't get. Pokeball. Okay. Teddy Ursa. Teddy Ursa, not Teddy Ursa. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I almost made it. Oh, I forgot I could fly. Sarah liked it. That's the only approval I need. <gasps> shiny pupper? Not sh okay, not shiny pupper. Sparkly pup. No, that still doesn't kind of work. It's a pupper. It's a earth pupper? Ground pupper? Oh, that's a ground pumper. Yeah, great ball's fine. Hell yeah. Growlithe was caught. Mm. All right, well the reason I came over here in the first place was to check the den out, so let me go do that. Ah. 
Oh, hey, we got a Firestone. Perfect. Super Potion. And Great Ball. Looks like Ice type. No, Steel type Salandit. Yeah. Um, if anyone wants in on that, I'm going to start it. So uh, let me know. Seems those Tauros have um, taken a liking to me. All right, I'm gonna open this up. I'll give it a minute. If anyone, if no one says they want in in a minute, I'll uh, I'll just go ahead and start it. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, my other Pokemon got knocked off the gym, too. That's rude. I'm at Picnic for Eggs. Um, oh, right. Yeah, you were doing that for me, too. I'll be there? Okay. Okay. I can't exit it now, or I'm going to get attacked by, like, four Tauros, so... I want to get down to like 30 seconds, and if you're not in, I'll, I'll reset. Hey, there we go. I see you got your final Evo. I'm ready to go. I was working on eggs. Yeah, I appreciate it. Because I know you're going to get me mine. And then, like, as soon as you trade it to me, I'm going to hatch it and evolve it. So. Well, I guess I won't evolve it because I probably won't have the candy too. But you know what I mean. You see a soon enough with your rival? Uh, true. Yeah, Quaxi's the one I actually need to worry about. And like, no one's talked to me about trading me a Quaxley yet, so. Oops, I killed it. Well, look, man, I'm not saying, you, like, I need your help with these. I'm just asking if you want them. We need three stars because we're OP right now. A little bit. I got to find three stars, though. I don't know how to unlock more. I found one. So, I mean, maybe I just need to go more north for them. But I mean, hey, I'm getting ex medium experience candy, so...
I guess story progress, not sure. I, I mean, I have been making story progress. Ooh, light screen. Mm, light screen! Alright, um... God, I still want to try to find this Pokemon, but... Oh. Am I the only one in chat right now that's, like, chatting and listening that, like, cares about spoilers and, like, hasn't looked anything up yet? Because I, I will just say what I'm looking for. So long as, uh, no one's like, you know, don't, don't tell me spoilers. Oh, there's another Magnemite. Oh my god, Shiny Meryl. Too shiny, baby! And that's my second crit catch on shiny Pokemon! Hell yeah! <laughs> oh my god. Actually, like, I like Shiny Meryl too. I, I love... Meryl is maybe one of my favorite Pokemon. I've loved it since I was a kid. It's just so tiny and round and huggable. It's so cute. Uh, I hate Azu Azumarill though. And honestly, I think Azumarill was a little unnecessary. So... Uh, so I guess that meal paid off. I'll help you with whatever. You know me. No idea. Okay, look. If you care about spoilers... Mute this for like a minute or so, I guess. I don't know. But I'm gonna say what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a uh, Tauros, but not one of these Tauros. I looked at like, since it, there was more to Tauros uh, than I knew, um, I looked it up real quick to see if it evolved. It does not. It actually just has two other forms that are rare. And one of them's water type and one of them's fire type. And I'm looking for the water one to add to my team. It's post game. Oh, okay. See, I just read that it was a rare spawn. I didn't know it was post game. All right, well then I guess I'm gonna move on then. Well, you know what? I caught a shiny Meryl. So, still worth. Still worth. Oh, and there's a Dreadnought. If I catch that, I won't have to evolve a Chewdle. See if I can just Great Ball it. Great Ballin! Nope, okay. We'll switch to big peps. Check more balls at it. Am I the only one who hasn't found a shiny? I guess. Can we trade eggs? Yeah, as soon as I catch this dreadnought.
It'd be a lot cooler if you did. <laughs> wow, Hitman. All right, Dreadnaw, let's go. Pokedexed. Okay. Um, what am I trading you, Hitman? Oh, I guess the egg. Duh. <laughs> Link trade. Oh, good. The search code's still in there. Oh, the trade code's still in there. <sighs> Fuck, I got some gray sandwiches, but I need ingredients. Oh. I'm not ready? Oh. Well. Alright then. I guess I'll just sit here and wait. Why is it? Okay. There's a problem with Twitch I keep having. Like, I'll open up a tab. It's specifically Firefox, too. I'll open up a new tab on Twitch. No co- Oh, it doesn't just stay open. Alright, well, I guess let me know when you're ready. Um, but it'll just mute the stream. And it's like, I don't want to mute the stream because then my view doesn't count. I want them to get the view. That's why I opened them in the first place. Um, right. I'll worry about it later. All right, well, I'm gonna check the map. Where is the next story beat around here? You're good? Okay. Ah. You know what? I think I am just gonna turn on auto... Auto save, because it's probably just better. And do that Titan? That was the next plan, is do, doing that Titan next. Egg. Got seven eggs right now left, so I should be good. All right. Well, enjoy your flake, Coco. I have to go move that egg now, lest I forget where it is. As long as I put it over here, we should be good. And then Meryl's got to go in the shiny box. Okay. Alright, it looks like, yeah, there's a path on the other side of the city to get around. We also have, I believe, a fairy type terror raid? So we could check that out too. Save on, yes. I'm gonna drop a manual save too. You know, they made Pokemon games like other games where it has an auto save slot and a manual save slot. I'd be all for that. Oh, 
Oh, there's gotta be stuff down there, right? Oh wait, there's stuff right here. Hold on. No, I don't care about your links. I want a super potion. Or these super potions rather. Aha! That was correct. Electric terrain. Hmm. Someday I'll find a Pokemon that has like one of those terrain setting abilities that I actually like and I'll end up using it and I'll be like, oh man, terrains are great. How have I been sleeping on this for so long? But until that time. I'm just gonna keep scoffing at them. Electric Terra Shard, okay. So I'm guessing these Terra Shards, I'll probably be able to put them together and like change a Pokemon's Terra type with them or something. So. Rain Day Electric Terrain, where are you? Oh god. Having a Pokemon that sets up like a terrain on uh upon entering the battle. And then also have it using like rain dance. Or like doing a doubles battle with a Pokemon with Drizzle and uh the electric terrain setter. That'd be nuts. I like the way Rotom moves. It's weird. Oh. Goodbye. Why are no- why, why is no one picking up these TMs? I'm not complaining. It's nice to have them. But still, you gotta wonder. You like that move? East Province Area 3. Calcium's pretty good. Cuffant. Got that roly coly down there. Ooh, we got a Terra Raid. Let's see. We have a. I can't even tell what type that is, but I know it's a Fanfy. At least I'm pretty sure it's a Fanfy. I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna try to make some progress. We're gonna try to take down, what is this, number four? Will O Wisp! Hmm. That's tempting to use right now, honestly, because I was thinking about using it earlier. Timer Ball. Hopefully, I won't ever need to use it, but it'll be nice to have. Energy powder. I see another terror raid battle. I just stepped on a diglet. Oh, there's a terror Pokemon over there, too. Let's go check that out. Oh, is that? Ah, oh, that's a little engine. That's a little engine that could. Where'd it go? I see you up there, Gimme Ghoul. Can't get you now that I jumped down here, though. Where'd my Terra Pokemon just go? It just despawned. This is bullshit. Smooth Rock. Maybe it was a Diglett or Doug Trio that went underground. Or maybe it was a Voltorb that exploded. I don't know. Ooh, we got a purple one over here. We have Ghost Dratini. Three stars. 
Now, Hitman, I know that you already have your Pokemon, but if you want to do this one, let me know. Yeah, you're down. If you're ready now, I'm gonna hit the thing. So, feel free to enter. If you're not, let me know and I'll cancel it. Also, can I just say all my complaining about, um, Starter Pokemon being too humanoid, I think paid off for me at the end of this evolution. Being one of the least humanoid, well, I mean, I shouldn't say least humanoid, least humanoid Pokemon would probably be like some of the Ultra Beasts, like Guzzlord or, I don't know, something else. Um, yeah, I'm ready to go. Um, but you know, Crocodile. Just, just a fucking crocodile. Uh, a starter that went from two feet to four feet. Good. I'm, I'm very happy with it. No, like, don't get me wrong. I love Cinderace. I love Incineroar. But, like, we needed something like this. So. Battle... Oh. Oh. Great. Stop targeting me! I fucking flinched, really? I didn't hit it once. I did not hit it a single time because it paralyzed me and then kept flinching me. What the shit? Get in the ball. I am unhappy with you, Dratini. I should have punched your shit out of it. You sure did. Uh, two ghost terra shards. Stuff to sell. Okay. Some good candy. I'm gonna need that for the egg. In fact, I should probably put the egg in my party, so. Good rewards, yeah, for three stars, definitely. Doesn't take long to hatch, good. Good, I'm glad. Yeah, I'm gonna, we're gonna take Stinker out. We'll leave them in the party box though, cause I, I still I still think they're part of my party. I just haven't really need had like use for them yet. I see a gimme ghoul. There's that flamigo again. Rare Bone, Rare Bone, Firestone, Venoshock, Energy Root. Revive. Wait a sec. 
I think that's the color you're supposed to be. Kind of wild if I found three shinies in one day, huh? Dawnstone. Rare bone polka doll. Rare bone. Oval stone. Polka doll. Energy root. I got a lot of rare bones to pick with you. Alright, let's try this again. Curlia. Okay. What's bold nature for Dratini? It, it shows you in the stats menu um, what goes up and down. So if you look at its stats and it doesn't have an arrow up or down on two of its stats, it means it's neutral. Melissia Might? I don't even know what that does. Hold up. I oh, know it tells me on the screen. The Pokemon will always act more slowly when using status moves, but these moves would be unimpeded by the ability of the target. Okay. I also gotta teach you a dark move to make use of that terror typing. Intimidate, Blaze, Mold Breaker, and Wind Power. Okay. Yes, we have a fire type Curlia. Fire terror type. Part of me does wish we went Delta Species on this shit and just changed their typing. Maybe someday, but not today, I guess. Go on, big peps. Ow. Well, I already yawned, so... And we caught it. Okay. Is this not the way up? Oh. Hello, Flamigo. No, I guess not. Alright, I mean, I guess I don't need to go up. I need to go that way, so. Let's go that way, then, shall we? Uh, oh? Oh, shit. The egg's already hatching. Okay. That didn't take any time at all. Yay! Sprigatito, hatch from the egg. Told you. Yeah, you, you were right. Mm, books. Damp rock. Guards back. Yeah, I'll battle to something. Raise it up a little bit. Eventually. Like this diglet that I didn't see there. Sucker punch. Well, let me just take that back real quick. Level nine.
Fui Blech. Here, hold on. Let's... Hmm. Let's put Amy Rose up front and see what you're all about. There's so much sand around here, my mouth's getting all gritty. Wear a mask. We challenged by Eth Esther the student. Esther. I'm gonna break the mold. And then your face! Your face explode! <laughs> that was not a lot of damage. The fucking light reflection made this land that looks shiny, but it wasn't. I'm so sorry. <laughs> that sucks, pause. It really does. Of course you crit. Home claws? Yeah, you know what? Let's get a nice setup and move on. You over. Uh, not scratch. Tail whip. And wants to learn magical leaf. Yeah, you can learn that. Your attack stats way higher than your special. Oh, we'll learn it for now, but as soon as we got like, another physical grass move, we're probably just gonna teach over it. Dawn fan? Yeah, we should probably switch. Um, I'm gonna go with Bull Hop. Alright, well, if I can't get that replacement for Bull Hop until post game, I guess, uh, I guess we'll just stick with Bull Hop for the main game then. Speed falling. I don't think I have much of a choice though. You know, it's wild. I've been streaming for like eight hours and like I'm tired, but I still feel like I want to keep going. I'm, I'm gonna, again, hard cut it at like 10 hours at the latest, just because that's how long a VOD can be on YouTube, or video in general, rather. And then I'll go through and, you know, just fill out more of my Pokedex. So. I saw quick attack. Yeah, sure. We got a priority move. Yeah, that still means almost two hours at least, uh, or at most, so. Uh, I need a rock move. We got rid of our Pokemon with the only. I have three Pokemon on my team right now. Technically four, but I don't think I'm gonna keep Sprigatito with me. Three Pokemon with dark moves. I think one of them can go. Feels like dark moves have just come, become like almost as distributed as like normal moves, which I guess makes sense.
Yeah, I'm going to have two dark Pokemon, but you also have to account for Terra types. True. <laughs> the thing is, you still need a move for your Terra type on that Pokemon. Here we go. That, um... It can use right so like if I have like that ghost Rotini that we have now we have that ghost Rotini but if it doesn't have a ghost move and it doesn't have um, the th uh, fuck Terra blast I think it's called it doesn't do anything it just becomes a ghost type and it loses actually I don't know if it loses stab on its uh, other moves but still uh, floor gato deftly wheels the vine be uh, hidden beneath his long fur summoning the hard flower bud against its opponent okay throw that in the books it's weird that it doesn't give you the dex entries for like the next evolutions or the other starters like, I guess it kind of makes sense, because you don't want to... I mean, you don't want to spoil it for people if they don't want it spoiled for them, but... That's interesting. Uh, we're going to heal everyone up, too. I have a feeling Amy Rose isn't going to be too powerful. Yo, Sean! So somewhere in one of the mines that around there, we should find the lurking steel titan. Remember has it that thing's staggeringly huge and really long. You'd think a Pokemon like that would be easy to spot. I wonder how it stays hidden. Maybe it's super fast? If that's the case, riding the Pokemon of yours might be able to catch up. Might help you catch up. I remember that. Yo, Brick Break though? Damn. That's a good fighting move. That, that is just a solid fighting move. There's also a Growlithe here. That's a good boy. Hmm. Oh, hey, a Larvitar. I mean, I guess I still need one, so... Um, Brutal Sink probably won't kill it. I was correct. In fact, I can do another one. Hit the button now. Still so used to going into my bag for Pokeballs, even though that hasn't been the case for like at least two gens, if not three. Larvitar was caught. I'll probably go back to that other cave for another Pupitar though. And then like evolve one of those in Tyranitar. What the fuck? Get away from me. Guy here. Coming in, touching my leg like a weirdo. So another another sunstone, yet another sunstone. Uh, okay. Holy coly coal. Holy coly coly coal. A pack of cuffant.
I see a basculine down there. Oh, a couple of basculine down there. Spikes! Hmm. I kind of want to go over there and check out that situation. Oh, there's another Logvitar. Little babies. Let me jump down here first. Oh, there's a Torkoal. I think I see a Gimme Ghoul. Alright. Hariyama. Hello. Okay, this is a little more what I was expecting from that first cave we went to. Went into another. Max revive. Alright. And we're already out the other side. Okay. Well, it seems I have a poison terror raid available. Let's see if there's anything worth. Poison sand dial, two stars? Nah. The terror orb is all charged. Oh, do I charge the terror orb by also just. Like checking terror raid dens. I had no idea. Pokestops, heal. Pokestops. What? If you're talking about the uh, Pokemon Center up there, I didn't visit that yet. I'll have to come back through here, I think. To recharge your Terra Ball? Yeah, but I didn't go up there yet. Check what's down this one. Diverging paths. I found an Espeon. It's a Terra Pokemon, too. Terra... Did it really get Terra Psychic? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I mean, I guess that's different. Or not different, but... Like, if I evolved it from an Eevee, it might still have, like, Terra Normal for all I know. So I guess... I guess it's something. It's also level 50, I just noticed. So we're going to have Amy Rose do what she can. No, oh, please don't set up on me. No. Oh god, it's got a healing move. No.
I should have taught Big Peps. Uh, I should have taught a Will O' Wisp. And Dugs are just sitting back. They're like, wait. Oh no! Oh my god, it lived! You won't, I won't kill it with anything. That's the problem. <laughs> what I need to do is I need to put it to sleep and start hammering it with hex. Maybe snarl actually. Just so I can lower its special attack. I'll do Snarl this turn. Oh my god. We've seen Morning Sun, we've seen... Shadow Ball, and we've seen Calm Mind. I don't know what his fourth move is still. Okay, Hex will do double damage. It's super effective. It's got stab. But it's also... It's also been buffing its special defense a lot. I need it to stay asleep one more turn, and I don't think it will. Nope. We got a high level bag on for you later. Cool. Awesome. Thank you. Stop raising your stats. And your health. Please stop raising your health, too. Oh, good. I got a crit. And it's about to fall asleep. Okay, that might be enough for me to knock the Terra off of it, if it stays asleep for three turns. down to this and it woke up and used morning sun it's only got five of those right oh my god I wish I had a normal type here. Bullhop should be fighting normal. <laughs> Make me feel better. Yeah, let's intimidate it. Let's lower its attack stat. Let me let me just let me just check some. Let me just check something here. It's at plus five special defense. Plus three special attack. Dear God. Big, big peps is our only good option. Hmm. 
I don't even have a dark type to like even try to resist it. Steel doesn't resist ghosts anymore. I feel like I need to send an Amy and like just just need to heal up big peps. And hope it'll tank another another hit. 60, it'll go up to 125, not 130. Oh, Lord. <clears throat> it does have psychic. If we lose, when we lose big peps again, I'm gonna have to probably just call it. Cause I'm losing too many mons to this thing. All right, we're gonna try to yawn. Your shadow ball. Unless you hang on again. Nope, all right, we're out. I need to leave. I mean, it's level 50. I know it's level 50. I didn't mean to choose next Pokemon. Fuck. Whatever. Send in leggies. We use a Poke it all and leave. I knew what I was getting into here, Fig Leaf. Don't you worry about me. This is by far the most I have ever used Poke dolls. I have used like three, maybe four during this playthrough. And that is far and away the most I've ever used. Okay, uh, we'll just go boop, boop, boop. Doug Trio, leave me alone. I'm having a bad time right now. Well, at least I know the Titan wasn't in there. Hmm. Wait, did... Okay, I guess I'll pick it up. I was gonna say, did that spawn inside the... The little thing there? But we're all good. Um... Okay, we made it. And it was just for a candy. Mm, heat rock. If I ever want to do heat, like, not heat, if I ever want to do weather strats, I got those, I guess. Stardust. Speaking of Stardust, I actually want to, uh... I decide if I ever do do a playthrough and I use Quaxley... Oh, jeez. I'm gonna name it Josuke. And no one can stop me. Is this supposed to be, like, a maze? How much of a maze when I can just jump over the stuff? I'm probably not meant to, but... Yeah, there you are. Power gem. Special type rock move. Or rock type special move, rather. Oh, oh you, uh, okay. are you, are you okay there? Bud, bud? All right. <laughs> I don't know if we can chalk that up to a glitch or just I mean, what is a glitch, but if not faulty coding? 
I was gonna say it's like faulty coding, faulty structuring, but. Kinda was a lot of that in there, right? PP up. That's good. Awakening, alright. Whatevs. Uh, now I need to figure out how to get up there. I'm probably meant to. Yeah, that's. I don't think. I think that's too high to actually jump on it. So, oh, but I can maybe make it from here. It's so awkward only being able to jump with Koridon. Acrobatics. Oh, and I'm stuck again. Well, at least I know it's repeatable, right? Yeah, acrobatics is good. I just, I kind of wish my flying Pokemon wasn't a special attacker, so I could make more use of it. Uh, three shinies. <laughs> Third shiny today, baby. <laughs> okay, I need to make sure you don't run, so I'm just gonna throw an Ultra Ball and hope it works. Dude, I, what do you, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm sorry? Bisharp is awesome. It really is. I've never used one except for you know the <laughs> the end of our soul link where I just had a shell smash Shot what the fuck? I can't help being this good at Pokemon pause. Oh If I could take some of my talent that I have and give it to all the little people I would But that's just not possible, you know that's just, it's, I, I can't do that. It's sad, but it's true. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, use it. Please, it's shiny. You have no ex Well, my excuse is it's not new. And I've been using mostly new Pokemon. So... You got to, though? Uh, dig with dirt. I'll consider it. Sean, please. Please, you... Um, hold on. Here's the thing. I want to. I want to, but I already have a steel type on my team. I need to cover more bases than just that. Just use it? Fine. I'll use it. After Sprigatito evolves... I get it. I get it. I get what you're all saying. I get it. After Sprigatito... Er, Florigato, Florigato evolves again. I'll stick it in my party. Ugh. Okay, let's actually go to the Pokemon Center real quick. Grab the Gimme Ghoul first. Grab the Thunderstone. Okay. If I have enough candy, maybe I'll just evolve Florgato. Florgato right now. Use 
Is this... Boom, 31. Want to learn U-turn? Yeah, okay, we can learn U-turn. We'll learn over home claws. Worry seed? Nah. Uh, we'll use 10. Want to learn slash? No, we'll keep quick attack. Perfect. Okay, here we go. And then I'll use the rest to get a Ponyard leveled up. Okay, that is a pretty good um, evolution. Meowskerade. Okay. Grass Dark. I kind of figured it would be a Dark type. Not bad. It's pretty good. See, here's the thing, though. If any haters of Cinderace are coming to defend uh, Meowskerade, they, they need to take a good hard look in the mirror, because I would put these two in the same exact camp. Uh, this Pokemon uses Reflective Fur Lining. It's ca uh, Fur Lining, it's cape to camouflage the stem of its flower. Green illusion, the flower is floating. Oh. I love it. I really, really fucking love Meowskra. It's good. It's a good mod. I still... I need someone to trade me a Quaxley, though. Someone trade me a Quaxley, please. Oh, mine has a neutral nature. That's that's pretty good. Its attack stat's way higher than its uh, special attack, too. User throws a uh, rigged bouquet of flowers at the target. Its attack never misses and always lands a crit. That's so ridiculous. That's so ridiculous. Looking for eggs as we speak. Wait, are you like asking around for them? Oh, by the way. What's up? You know what his hidden ability is? Pause told me already. It's, it's stupid. <laughs> it, it is just Cinderace again. It is just Cinderace again, but it's grass now. All right, let's put our shiny Ponyard in our party, I guess. <sighs> they did nerf protein? Oh, thank god. So it's auto, does 1.5 rip off that, yeah. I forgot it was 1.5, I actually thought it was double. So 1.5 isn't bad. I guess. Whenever I hear auto crit for some reason, my brain goes to double damage. Uh, let's see. Didn't even level up. All right, well, once it levels up once, I guess I'll use my rare candies on it. The man with all the luck. Oh, did you hear about it? <laughs> or do you just happen to see it when you rolled in? Firestone, Ultra Ball. Give me ghoul. I was informed. Ah, uh, okay. Who snitched? <laughs> Who snitched? Uh, let me check the map. Yeah, I'm way far away from where I need to be. Thunderstone. Voltorb doesn't evolve with Thunderstone, right? It evolves by level up, I'm pretty sure. <coughs> oh, actually, here we go. We'll battle you. The beach, I'm gonna tell you how my crush. Tell my crush how I feel. 
Uh, Judith, I think you should tell them regardless. Because there's no way you're gonna crush me. Unless I'm the crush. So close. But it wasted his to oh, it's no it's Aqua Jet. Okay. I don't know, I kind of thought that finding shinies in this game was going to be difficult, because, like, trying to notice them would be hard. I think I bit my tongue on that one a little bit. Excuse me, young goose. I just want the carabos. You go about your day, okay? You know the problem with Ghastly though, is that it's shiny just has like a blue aura around it. And I see the aura as blue and purple sometimes. And I never know if I should check them or not. Granted, I have shiny Ghastly in uh, Pokemon Go and I, I am at this point, now that I have home for like a month, I'm planning on going through and slowly dumping a bunch of shinies in there since you can't do it very quickly. Okay then. I'm gonna go up here first. I just want one shiny, please. Pause, you just gotta like check everything really carefully. Ooh, we got Darude Sandstorm. I do kind of hope they patch in like a sound effect and like overworld effect for the shininess though. Like in Legends Arceus, cause like having to just see them, it's kind of hard. Yeah, Aardvark doesn't have one either. At least in this game. You have loads of shinies elsewhere, though. All right, yawn. Nice try, jerk. This guard is going to throw great balls at it. Now we got a quick catch. Works for me. Whoa, that's precarious. I better get away this dangerous fight by jumping on the ledge of this tower. Hey. Actually, no, you're right. I should switch. So you're probably a ground type. <coughs> Ugh. There's nothing in that corner either. I got you cornered now. Are you a ground steel type? This is the weirdest Onyx evolution I've ever seen.
Orthorm? Orthworm, the lurking steel giant. Mudshot? It doesn't affect it? Oh no, okay. Um. Uh, stun spore? Avoided the attack, of course. You are much farther than I am, though, so see you later. Bye, Aardvark! That's fair, I am pretty, pretty far into this game. I guess. What I've, I've done, what? Three Titans, this is number four. Five gems. I've only done one hideout, though. I should probably do a hideout before the end of the night if I can. Uh, Torch Song. <laughs> that was cool. Oh god, I hope I hope god what's it called uh fucking big big peps. I hope big peps shiny is green so I could like catch get one and call it Vector the Crocodile. Yeah, I got a well I guess I'll put you up front. Actually no, I could put you up front. Should actually hold up. Bag. Can't learn brick break. I can learn bulk up, but can't do anything with it. Other than bulk up. And you can't learn Focus Blast. Tauros, I need you to learn something other than Double Kick. I can't ride Coridon in here. That's a pain in the butt. I can't ride it out here, though. This was a tiny hole. Just enjoying some uh, fresh air out here. Oh, you little bastard! Get back here. Got it. <clears throat> so who is out here cybernetically enhancing earthworms? The titan earthworm began eating something. Sean, you managed to pin down the titan? Yeah, I, I've been doing that. That's the lurking steel titan. It's a, uh, well, it sure is long. I think a little friend might even be faced here now. I'm drinking those herbs. Yeah. That's how they work. We're gonna do this together, Sean. All right. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna go for terrestrializing against it, I guess. Doesn't matter how big an opponent is, victory's gonna taste so good seasoned by my Toad's Cool. You using Toad's Cool? 
I will tell you right now, I already tried that. It doesn't work. Unless it changed its ability for some reason. You get the kickies. <coughs> what sucks about a fighting Pokemon that's on all fours, a lot of fighting moves have to deal with fists. So a lot of bull hops moves are, well, they're not, they're not gonna be fist moves probably, so. Good night, sweet prince. Would you still love your girlfriend if she turned into the Titan Orthworm? We did it, Sean. Way to go, little buddy. Did you get a good look at his face, though? I didn't expect a Titan to be such a little cutie. Uh, did you not see the cloth? But if we go in here, we'll find more of that Herba Mystica I ate before. Let's go find it before the thing can regroup. Oh, okay. I mean, that, that's been the plan. Y'all ready to feel more feelings about a fictional dog? Come out, come out wherever you are. There's a Pokeball in here? Yes, found it. Here's our little herb. It's salty. Okay. The shape, the sheen, it looks like it'll taste horrible, which means it's gotta be good for you. Now, let's see, what does the book have to say? Well, apparently, salty herba mystica helps with aching hands and feet. Good for neuropathy and numbness. We gotta tell Lady Tuesday. When you've got muscle weakness, it supposedly builds up strength again. Okay, but how can Belly Bolt not swim in this game, but... Palmot? What's... You mean Palmo? Palmo can? Uh, Palmo is... special. No time to waste. Let's get some food going. I mean, Palma, or not Palma, Palma just looks like it would float anyway, so. Belly Boat looks like it would sink. Sorry for the wait. No, Palma. Oh, does it evolve again? It's a super healthy sandwich that'll perk you right up once you eat it. Plus, as a token of a friendship, here's another Titan badge. Gaze upon it and awe as you eat. Are you still Titan defeated? Oh god, he's doing the salt meme. Okay. Uh, yeah, exactly, because you know, the arm not right, but still. There he is. Yeah, I hate the evolution method, though. What is it? Gas! Do you want to give your sandwich? Yeah, sure. Guns! Walk 1,000 steps in the overworld with it? No? Why not? Come on up, Mabastiff. Food's up. That didn't sound so bad. How does he break it off so cleanly? Ingredients and everything. Munch, munch, munch. Oh, would you look at that? Seems like someone's got a proper appetite now. That's a lot of steps. I've stepped longer. Chomp, chomp, snarf, chomp. 
Yes. And if you go too fast, it despawns. Ah. Uh, so it's 1,000 slow steps. Okay, I can do it. See that that fellow is also slowly regaining its original strength. Still, it doesn't look like it's anywhere near close to returning to its battle form. Yeah. It seems healthy enough physically. Maybe it got some kind of mental block that's preventing it from returning to its true form. A mental block? I've read about it in books before. A mental scar, like psychological trauma, you know? I think that's what you call it. Why aren't you the little therapist? Maybe you had a terrifying experience in battle and I was scared to battle at all? Well, don't worry. I'm sure both that brute and Mabo stiff will make a full recovery eventually. So how do you feel, Mavistiff? How's that Urban Mystica working? Gah, oh, uh, no pressure. Not like it's fair to expect every kind of Urban Mystica to have some huge effect, right? It's not like the effects have to be immediate either. Hey, it's okay, don't worry. Sean and I are gonna make sure you're right as rain. We've got one more herb to go, and I bet it's the best of them all. It's... it's just gotta be. Alright, Sean. Next up on a little herb hunting... herb hunt should be the last. We can't lose steam until we're done. So let's keep our momentum. Here we go. Fuck yeah. What if... What if I want to go do that? <laughs> what what if I just went and did that real quick? Hmm? Hello, Sean. This is Sada. Hi, Sada. I detect that Koridon has regained more of its original power. While riding upon it, it seems to now be able to jump higher if you press and hold the B button. Cool. I was expecting something a little bit more, but all right, I guess. You must continue helping Karida and recover. I mean, it'll help me get out of here at least. Um, I also saw that Pokeball just kind of sitting in the den, and I don't know if that was a glitch or not. Like, I can't, I can't go back in the den. So it must have been a glitch, right? So can't jump high, uh, quite high enough, but there's something. Uh, so that's my fourth shiny. And we're just gonna go ahead and throw you up front. I don't know what you want from me. I don't know how this is happening. <laughs> I'm running out of Ultra Balls. <laughs> I look back for one second. <laughs> Hacking, you're hacking. Got it. Look, if I was hacking, I would be hacking in shinies I wanted, okay? Not this one that I haven't even caught yet, just because I don't care about Cuffant or Copperaja. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what to tell you. I'm just, I'm really, really good at Pokemon. That's all. <laughs> wow. All right, let's um, let's zoom out a bit. Where is is this our last one? Ooh, it's a dragon one too.
Yeah, we'll fly here. Dude, go to the ladder or something. I I mean I think I'm wasting all of my shiny luck. Or all my all my good luck here, so I don't know if uh doing the lottery would do any good. Okay. Um how do I get over there? I could probably make it through this way. Let's 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 go this way. God, I saw like my first two today and I was so excited. And now I've now it's four and I'm just like, eh, whatever. Nah, I get back here. Let me just go ahead and save real quick. Just in case. Oh yeah, I said I was also gonna let's see. Bags. Uh maybe a medium candy will level it up. Yeah. And then we'll use this to get it up to 35. So I wanted to use seven. Okay. Metal sound, nah. Slash, sure. Pause hates you right now. I can't, what do you want from me? Do you want me to just not catch them? Do you want me to just not catch the shinies? I can't help but see them. I can stop catching them if you want. Raging Bull. The user forms a tackle like a Raging Bull. This move's type depends on the user's form. It can also break barriers such as light. Wow, that's really good. So this will probably be a fighting type. Um. Uh, yeah, it'll become a fighting type move, so I want to learn it over double kick. Thank God. Play rough? Yeah, sure. Mm, never mind. Yeah, I'll save the last one in case I need it. It'd be nice if I could get, like, one of the new Pokemon is shiny. Though I guess I'm asking a bit too much at this point by saying that, huh? Oh, I want that. Give me soft sand. Alright. Oh, we got a Terra typed in there. So one, please, game. Oh, you're one of those uh, salt mons. A ghost salt mon. Oh, well, I think I just happened to leave my ghost type out front, so that might be good. I can't put it asleep. Being salt cured. Is this just rock fire spe- oh god, it just killed itself. And it didn't stop itself from fainting, it just fainted. Oh well. Yes, Bork. Fun fact, its ability prevents it from being affected by status moves and has ghost stamp. Really? That's actually pretty funny. 
Uh, clearly didn't help there, though. A ghost type sun kern. Wow. Moving on. Oh, there's a bridge. Okay, we're all good. I wasn't even touching you! Oh, shit. There's a Chansey here. Hello, Chansey. I don't want to bother catching you right now. Okay, for a moment I was like, what the fuck is that Pokemon? And it was two Pokemon stuck together. Oh, Krogunk's in this game. That's fun. That's a fun mon. Kesseroya Lake. Oh, we got some Sligoos, and Goomies, and Gold Duck, Scyther, ooh, there's a Star Raptor. I am definitely getting towards the later game. What are you? What are you two? You didn't sparkle, so I'm gonna run. I'm gonna check this one. Okay, you didn't sparkle either, so it's just some sort of... ...thing, I guess, that they have. Um... Oh, wait, Tatsu Gear? Okay. So it's a type of Onigiri. So like, yeah, um, it must be water type then, <clears throat> I'll give it a snarl, okay, that didn't much, I'll probably give it a hex after it falls asleep, ow, asshole. Okay, I can give it one more, and it shouldn't kill it. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm going to save my Ultra Ball, so we're going to have to try to catch this with a great one. Oh, we got it. Cool. So, uh, bro Pokemon, uh, Dragon Water. Okay. Pokemon are, bird Pokemon are its main prey. This Pokemon knows it's weak, so it hunts with a partner. And is that why there was also a red one as well? Will I find more red ones if I go looking? It's just like... My brain is like, that's clearly got to be a shiny. Because it's a different color, so. Oh, what's up, Tropius? How you doing? Alright, I want to find a Pokemon Center. Before I go fight that. Oh, wow. Oh, they're kind of far away. That one's closer, so we'll set that as the destination. Yeah, we'll 
we'll just go this way. It just, it looked pinker, and I was like, I gotta check at least. Hey there, Sean. So rumor has it the false dragon titan lurks somewhere in this lake, yeah? No single person's ever caught a glimpse of it. it. Must be some kind of truly terrifying beast. But how are we supposed to search for a thing when we don't even know what it looks like? Sure would be handy if you just ran around crying, I'm a titan or something. If only, right? Good conversation. Oh, let's grab this. Taunt. Oh, we got some ruins. Ruins usually means gimme ghoul at least. I see a gimme ghoul. Although it'll be a pretty high level gimme ghoul, so maybe I'll just leave it there for now. nice and peaceful around here. I like it. Alright, I think I actually have to go around. Oh, look at the tiny baby Tropius. It's so cute. Oh, it's a basculine. Those things are aggressive. I don't want to be near that. Ah, oh, there's an Azumarill. All right, well, I know I can catch those wild. So that's good. And a jump pluff. And there's Vigoroth. A trainer early game had a slack off, but I haven't, I haven't seen a Vigoroth until now. Some Persians around here. Okay. Overall, though, nothing I really need. I just want to get up to this Pokemon Center. You were Shiny Merrill, you seem to be level 18. You think I'm evolving that into Azumarill? I hate Azumarill. Merrill's so much better. I ain't a fool. Oh, it's a Persian. I was like, what is that? I was looking at it from the front, though. For sure, I got all the centers unlocked now. The, uh, I did that for a while yesterday. I just, like, I would do that. I just don't want to spoil myself for, like, running into a random Pokemon, you know? Oh, not random, but like a new one. Now 100% fair, yeah. Oh, look at the little, uh, not the, the whale, the tiny, tiny versions of the whale. Yeah, I can see a lot of ice types around here. Ah, right, we got Bergmites.
Set Toodle. His name is so cute. Set it's sh Shroodle and Set Toodle. Never melt ice. If I actually catch an ice type, that'll be pretty good. Okay, let's heal. It's Toodle. Oh, Toddle. Right, okay. I like a Toddle, Toddle. Okay. Alright. It's a Toddle, not Toodle. I, I read the D as an O. I'm sorry. For some reason, OBS, like... It's not good. Ever since I got my new graphics card, like, the graphics on it are kind of messed up, so I... Looks weird to me sometimes. Alright, how much time do I have? I have less than 40 minutes. Let's go get this last Titan done. Oh, that's a long way down. Although it looks like we start dropping off after a little while, so... We're gonna go down pretty... Oh, okay, it ran out. Oh, there's Avalug down here. That makes sense. And there's that fish we saw. There's a feather. Let's check this Terra Pokemon, then the Terra Raid. It toddles. It's toddle, like a uh, toddler toddles. Toddle, 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 toddle. A slow bro. The Terra Pokemon disappeared though. Oh my. That's not Whiskash. Neither is that. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna see what this thing's about real quick. Don Dozo. So it's a mob boss? Uh, fairy type Makuita one star. Yeah, I think that's gonna be my water, honestly. It's it's a good one. Hmm. Wow, all the way out here. Well, you're also all the way out here. Okay. Um. Maybe we aren't doing this Titan, because I don't know where it is. I guess I'll go check this island over here. If I can even get on top of it. Oh, this way up over there. Oh, more feathers. The feathers used to be really good. Until they, uh... You know... Just replace the, um, things with them. The, the medicine. Like, you could just use the medicine up to the last bit, so. That Terra Pokemon disappeared, too! I mean, it's probably a slow bro, but... I want to at least check.
Yeah, the feathers only work if you get them in like massive bunches. Ah, oh, there's Venomoth. Not even gonna check that Terra Pokemon now. Not worth my time. Dragon Claw, though. Oh, hmm. Another one of these things. Ominous black stake driven into the ground. We pull out the stake. Yes. I think that's three I pulled out. I saw one yesterday after I finished streaming. I didn't pull it out, though, and I'm thinking I probably should have. Hmm. I guess we're not doing the final one today because I don't know how to trigger it. If it's related to the stakes, let me know. If it's something else completely, I guess, you know, we'll see. Or if it's like I have to wait for a certain time or weather. I would want to know that too. But I guess for now, I'll just... Keep running around. Do a star battle? I could go do a star battle. I could go do a star battle. This was the one I was eyeing next, I think. I got that Pokemon Center unlocked at least, so if I need to head back there, I can. Amy Rose up front. More feathers. Alright, Team Star. Let's go. Actually, I should... Hmm. I gotta throw something else. I don't want to throw Big Peps in, because A, it's weak to dark. And B, it's also already level 37. So... How do I, like, switch them? Do I have to, like, throw you and then you? Yeah, I guess so. And then switch, uh... Amy up front after that. Whoa, whoa, hold it, you. Up ahead's the base of operations for Team Star's Dark Crew. You may know us as the uh, Sagan Squad. Sage, Sajin? Alright, whatever. Yep, and we don't take too kindly to random kids sniffing around our turf. Sorry, but if you don't turn yourself around here, amigo, we have to send you packing. I have a flamigo. Wait, hold up. Just a hunch on here, but are you that Sean kid? 
You know, the piece of work we're out to get for declaring war on Team Star. Maybe I am. What are you gonna do about it? Maybe I am, he says. Cool as a cucumber? Honestly, it's not always the best policy, you know. Ugh, you know what? It doesn't matter who you are. You're not getting through. Buzz off, I get thrashed by me and Battle Kid. What'll it be? I'll take you on. Gosh, sassy kids, like you are the worst. That's it. Prepare to get stomped into the dirt. I'll make you eat those words. Imagine you're like a nerd like this and you make a star out of your hands every time you start a battle. Like I thought Z-move poses were weird, but like they took it to a whole new level. Um, no, I don't want to terrestrialize. We got to save that for the boss. Why is it just as you can't have to be so strong? Uh, cause I need to put my money where my mouth is. God, how the heck could I lose? Well, whatever, it's your problem now. Finish up here for me, would you, bud? Oh, that was the other. Whatever, it's your problem now. Finish up here for me, would you, bud? Okay, thanks, Hasta la vista! Hasta la vista! Ugh. She's new to the team, you know. Might have a little chat with her about her attitude. Uh, well, I'm gonna go to the base now and give the rest of the squad a heads up. We'll come at you full force if you set foot inside, so you may want to consider turning tail. Either way, best of luck to you, amigo. Hasta la vista! Heart just wasn't in after that. I see you took care of the guards. Nice work. Now hold up in that base is Team Star's dark crew, the Sagan Squad. Their boss, Giacomo, pretty much runs the whole of Team Star. He's also produces, produced that wild soundtrack of theirs himself. He's a sharp guy. Even our declaration of war won't have ruffled him in the slightest. His plan is probably to wear you down with a wave of grunts and to finish you off himself. Now he's trying to outthink strat strategic types like him. Bring him down with a head-on attack. Just keep on defeating as many Pokemon as you can until the big man himself shows up. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to knock his knock off this phase of the operation. Time to wave out the Sagan squad off the map. And then after this, I'm going to call it a night. Ding dong, bing bong. Beep. Some kid locked out beating one of our sister squads and now he thinks he can take us on. Time to give him the boot gang. Let's show this Gatecrasher what Team Star can do. And if you're listening, Gatecrasher, know this. Once you can be 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss won't lift a finger to deal with the likes of you. What a weird stipulation. It wouldn't let me send up the others for some reason. Don't know why. Ah, oh, there's some more. I wonder if these could be shiny. That would suck, right? Just having to have my ground type out. That's pretty great.
anymore. He's got skills. Damn right I do. Been playing this game for like 30 years. Oh, well, like 20 years. Zaru, uh... I want a Zaru, uh... Sableye too. Oh, they're so lucky. They got all the best Pokemon here. Leggies, what are you doing over there? I defeated 32 out of 30. How do you like that? He's way above our level. We gotta get the boss! I don't remember any of the voices I gave them. So just be prepared for that. Do I have to fight your car again? Probably. Why does it look kind of like Goku? Like an alternate universe Goku. Maybe Vegeta. One or the other. You've done a real number on us, Party Crasher. Sean, was it? I'm Giacomo, the Prince of All Team Star. At the deck, I go by DJ Vice. Call me whichever, it's a vibe either way. Nice to meet you and all, but how about we skip straight to your outro? Don't worry, I'll pay you a sick requiem as you crash and burn. Let's get this party started! Okay. Judge by... Guacomo of Team Star. You don't really think things through, do you? The card war team star is a real bad move. Yeah, I'm not afraid. Revaroom? Time to up, up the tempo. This show ain't over yet. Intimidate. Oh, well, not speed boost, though. So that's good. Um. So it's gotta be dark type. So I'm gonna. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna leave Bullhop in the back, and I'm gonna leave the. Uh. Uh, the task realizing for it. If I need it's level 20. We're fine. Ha, huh, how's that for an opening track? I'll spin you up good, party crasher. Yeah, you're definitely gonna show me. Mela was way more of a challenge. Wicked Torque.
They say this guy's the leader? Well, I did a star battle. Guess that's that. About a year and a half ago. What are you even- Your headphones are around your neck. What are you listening to right now? Ugh. Guess that's that. What's up, Giacomo? Did something happen? The big boss just wanted to take on some stuff, so we had a chat and settled on a few plans. A few plans? Like, for what? Operation Star, first of all, and also a new code of conduct for the team. You know how tons of new members have joined up recently? Well, we figured we gotta make some team rules like a code, so we'll all be on the same page. Uh, nice of you to come up with a great code for us, won't you? Sorry, nice. You'll come up with a great code for us, won't you, Giacomo? Ha! Huh, no thanks. I'm way too, uh, way too much pressure. I mean, yeah, I used to be the president of the student council, but you know everyone ended up hating me after that, right? Of course we know. You forced a ton of stuffy rules on everyone, they wouldn't take it. We got some other nerd to replace you after, like, five minutes. I cannot help but to concur. Male student's hair must stray no further than 1.8 inches below the nape and so forth. Your rules were vexation made manifest. My point exactly. So you all agree that I shouldn't be let anywhere near this new code. But you always know what's best for the team. Giacomo, you look out for us. You've earned our trust many times over. Without you, Team Sarges wouldn't work. That stuck up student council press isn't who you are anymore, man. A code written by the Giacomo I'm looking at now, I'd follow that any day. As would I. Okay, okay, thanks for the ego boost, everyone. I'll do it. I'll write up the Dawn Code. And so I did. I did that. I did the best I could. I wrote that code myself, and there's no going back on it now. My days as boss are over. So here, take my star badge, would you? Oh, he's not breaking our hand, though. That sucks. I'll give you this choice TM2. You earned it fair and square. Foul, okay, foul play's good. I wouldn't probably use it, but... Unless I was running a Sableye. Let's go on Sableye. Ha! Huh, this is how the party ends. But let's talk about those Pokemon of yours. They're crazy strong, huh? Yeah, I've been doing stuff out of order. Sorry. You know those trainer chops at the academy? Like what moves you should use and stuff? Nope. Huh. Okay, you like it at the academy? Having fun? I've barely been there. No kidding. Sorry to interrupt, but you are Giacomo. Whoa, ho! Wasn't expecting a giant pompadour to make a guest appearance today. You get a Quaxwell to style you up for that? I guess Quaxwell's Quaxley's Evo. Style you up for that? I'm just after a quick word, would you mind? Sure, I can tell it's gonna be something annoying, but I guess I'm newly freed up for time. Thanks. I'll get straight to it. It seems all of you and Team Star are headed for expulsion if you end up your current acti- If you keep up your current activities. So why won't you break up the team and start attending class at the academy again? 
That's what you want to know? As it happens, we're actually waiting on a pal. Though we don't know if they'll be coming back. A pal? A close friend of yours, are they? I love how Clavel was like, I don't trust you. The next all goofy is Clive. And now I do. <laughs> they're the only they're only the strongest boss in all of Team Saw. Like how there's a top champion who's the absolute number one trainer, you know? They're the one who invited us and other bosses to form a team. We call him the Big Boss. And where's this big boss of yours now? Wouldn't we like to know? We haven't heard from him in, I don't know, must be a year and a half now. We thought if we kept Team Star going, then they'd get back in touch one day. But the teachers kept pressing us to call it quits, and then we'd get party crashes like you two. Maybe the big boss did ditch us. They were talking about breaking up the team before and all. So Team Star and this big boss of yours. They're really all that- they're really that important to you? Heh. <laughs> Is the sky blue? It put into words you eggheads at the academy might understand. They're my greatest treasure. Wow. Oh yeah, we're at 9 hours and 45 minutes for stream. Jesus Christ. So yeah, I'll be uh, organizing my boxes and maybe trying to fill out some stuff. So, Sean, it's me. I take that Giacomo Star Bridge is now in your possession. Star Badge. I see. With this boss out of the picture and Sagan's squad is pretty much done for. They found four shines during that time. It was like almost 10 hours. So, oh. Giacomo. Okay, so Cassiopeia is probably... Okay, for one thing, still I still think it's uh, Penny. And for two, Penny's probably the big boss. Just saying. Sorry, I got distracted for a sec there. No about your reward. I'll transfer some LP over to your phone as promised. Okay. And now we can make more TMs. Use those TMs to strengthen your Pokemon even further. Uh, my supply unit rep meet you shortly to deliver some bonus materials too. Uh, hello. It's me again from the supply unit. I guess. Well, what the heck? What the heck's going on here? Aww. He likes you. Hey, stop that. Somebody help. It's kind of nice that the legendary in this is a character, too. Crydon's so cute. It, it really is. It's just like... Yeah, we get it right at the beginning. We get like kind of chosen one stuff going on and like part of me would rather like have like a Psyquazar and like ride that first and then get Karide on later, but it's nice seeing it as a character. So But it drooled all over me. What even is that Pokemon anyway? It's really awesome. Uh I guess that's one word for it. Wait, is it really that special? Um, but before I forget, here's your reward. See, lots of Pokemon material. Um, your name's Sean, right? Since you're part of Operation Starfall's battle unit, can I ask you something? What do you think of Team Star? They're not all that. <laughs> Interesting. You know... Some of the rumors say Team Star wasn't a bunch of delinquents. Most of them used to be victims of bullying, or they just found it hard to interact with people. Kind of like me. But then these misfits and outsiders found each other and banded together to form Team Star. All they wanted to do was push back against the bullies they couldn't face alone. But uh, that's just info I got by hacking other students' social media accounts. 
Definitely not something I had firsthand. Don't look into it. That was fun talk about some secret mastermind behind the five bosses. Someone who recruited them to the team in the first place. Hmm. I don't normally talk this much. Now my throat kind of hurts. Yeah, you and me both, Penny. You and me both. So, um, good luck with taking down the other bases and stuff. God, I love that Eevee backpack so much. I hope once we finish, like, the team star stuff, we get to... We get to have that backpack. Okay. That's probably it for stream today. So I'm gonna go ahead and save. Uh, we're going to go... I don't know how far Ryan is. I might be farther than him right now. But we're gonna go raid Ryan again. Because he's the only person besides GDQ that's online at the moment. So. Control copy. Control paste. Alright. And actually, I'm going to remember to do it this time. Because I know Slab has asked me to do it in the past. So, shout out and shout out. Um, go follow Ryan. Please, if you haven't yet. I'd appreciate it. Ryan would appreciate it. We'd all appreciate it. Uh, Ryan's also playing Pokemon. Playing Pokemon Violet specifically. So, if you want to see what is arguably the cool motorcycle mode. I still think Coridon's cooler overall. But the cooler motorcycle mode. There you go. And that'll be it for me for today. Tomorrow... Stream's gonna be iffy. I don't normally stream Sunday anyway, so I might not be back until Monday. But uh, if the bug bites, it bites. And I'll, I'll put out something on Twitter. So make sure you're following me there. There you go. And yeah, that's it. And yeah, have a good one.